lovely jewellery makers. How are we all? Oh, we've been giggling here this morning. <laughs> reminiscing about, who remembers <laughs> Rainbow? Up above the streets and houses, rainbow flying high. And we were discussing, genuinely <laughs> discussing, George, do your George impression. <laughs> Hello, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. He's so cute. He was so cute. Uh, Jeffrey. Yeah, yeah, he was a bit <laughs> past, wasn't he? Jeffrey. <laughs> Jeffrey. And then you had. <laughs> so then you had. You had Bungle. Bungle. Bungle, yeah. Bungle was a bit more like. Talk like that, didn't he? Uh, <laughs> yeah, what should we do, Jeffrey? Do uh, zippy, do zippy. I can't do zippy. Zippy? Zippy talk like that, <laughs> didn't he? It's quite annoying. <laughs> and he used to zip his mouth shut. <laughs> <laughs> Our next in topic, genuine question. <laughs> What was Zippy? What was he? Um, it was like, like an alien thing. He, yeah, because his head was a funny shape. It was like a saucer. Zippy <laughs> guy. Like a saucer, wasn't it? <laughs> it was. But you had the hippo, you had the bear. Look, at these are the conversations that we have here at Jewelry Maker in the morning. Um, you had the bear, you obviously had Jeffrey. What was Zippy? Yeah, he text him, the, please, if you he know was what... Because we really, really need to know because we're so professional here at Jewelry Maker. <laughs> this is an important question. <laughs> <laughs> oh, everybody, look, I've got gorgeous Deb with me today. Yeah! Happy Saturday, everyone. Oh, it's always a joy to see you. <laughs> and you. Oh, I love it. We've planned our next week, haven't we? We have. We have. Because Deb's is here Wednesday and Thursday. And I was like, oh, I would invite you at my house, but it's a complete, it's a, it's a building site <laughs> at the moment, so you don't really want to stay with me. Um, I said, but do you want to come for drinks? Let's do some, some, you have some drinks and I'll, and I'll feed you. I'll feed you. <gasps> You're vegetarian, right, aren't yes. you? Yes. Yeah, right, okay, must remember that. Not to cook you a slap-up steak or anything <laughs> like that. Must, must remember I that. I can eat the vegetables. You're always welcome. You, you, you're always welcome. You're always welcome. <laughs> you know this. You know this. <laughs> oh, we've got an amazing... <laughs> always welcome. In fact, you know what? Summertime, when the building site hopefully is sorted, Yay. we will have a barbecue. Oh, love that would be nice, won't it? When there's my, my house no, has a patio again. And <laughs> You've when got my, your house back. Yeah. <laughs> when, it's, when, it's, when there's not cherry pickers everywhere and whatnot. <laughs> Ah, then we will. Anyway, our lovely jewellery makers, we've got an absolutely amazing Saturday for you. Firstly, because we've got the gorgeous Debs, and that's always a treat, isn't it? A wonderful treat. You've got beautiful, beautiful projects. Do you want to talk us through those first? Well, it's magic. Magic? <laughs> well, these, yeah. I, this is, I can't take um, credit for this. It was something that Georgia, one of our buyers, well, our head buyer, saw in India were gemstones with these kind of like diamantes around the outside and tried to think how we could do that and so um she's put them together in a kit and oh oh the end result is amazing and i've not seen anything like this before no so i think it's quite unusual you know and i've been in this industry a long time and i've not seen this um and these kits are lovely i mean some of these i've put them together those two kits because look at oh the that's beautiful and i've even put the little diamantes on the loose site flower <laughs> I'm loving that. Oh, look at that, full of sparkle. So that little little flower pendant just there, with the little umbrella over the top, yeah. that's ever so sweet. That is really fitting, actually, Debs, for our early bird this morning, Ooh. because they are lucite flower shaped. Yeah, Ooh. so they would be perfect if you wanted to incorporate uh, um, our early bird. Don't you think, Roscoe? The, the, well, sorry, the nine o'clock star by. Sorry, that's my bad. They would work perfectly alongside that too because we've got them in all three colors you see them there <gasps> oh i love those so if you got those with your nine o'clock have they got a hole in the top yeah <gasps> are they silver yeah oh i need them i know amazing sorry it sounded like zippy sorry, then didn't it <laughs> yeah <laughs> oh, oh, <I> need them. <laughs> <laughs> all right George. and we've got them in the rose the yellow and the silver um your early bird this morning check these out yeah brand new here we go, spacer beads. Oh, but then you shape the different shapes to what we've seen previously. You get a pack of 25 and in total, there's 200 available. Now these are 
in the hour right now so if you go onto our website all the wobblies at jewelrymaker.com um, click watch live in the top right hand side of the screen scroll down um, and you'll be able to see the love the positive plethora Sorry, that just came into my head and I thought it was a good word to say. You know, does it make me sound intelligent? I think you could be a weather girl. <laughs> Do you reckon? Yeah, because you've got that hand motion. Do you reckon? In the north, it's There's going a cold to front. Snow. Yes. Cold front and a warm front rising. In the 9 a.m., yes. we've got some beads. And it'll be rain, Britain. <laughs> rain, rain, rain. <laughs> and more rain stay indoors and watch jewelry maker definitely there you go um so you can shop ahead on those don't worry i won't quit my day job um and have a little look on the website because look at all these goodies and you've got ross in the hot seat so you know you're going to get some awesome deals now i need to mention the <gasps> stunner of a deal of the day that we have coming up at 10 o'clock ross um confession i did speak to my husband last night about these pearls he's like he kind of does this like Subtle eye roll. <laughs> um, no, I haven't yet, but I have told him he needs to tune in and make sure he buys them. Um, I was talking about these pearls. I was saying they're absolutely incredible, the quality of the pearls, um, which, you know, certainly over the last sort of week or so, we have absolutely heard the change in dynamic in the pearl market. We know that these are quite literally irreplaceable at the prices that we bring them to air and I will give you a heads up from one pearl lover to another that they are so affordable for what we're getting they're totally natural yeah <gasps> amazing quality so I spoke to my husband last night I was like um can you tune in at 10 o'clock because I do think they're going to sell out can you tune in at 10 o'clock and can you make sure you buy the deal of the day he was like right okay what are they he was like pearls I was like oh. So do you need any more pills? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Um, we were shocked. Ross is just saying we were completely shocked by the actual price of them because mm -hmm. I, w I would have thought that, yeah, it was either going to be like a 20 centimetre strand mm -hmm. or if I was guessing the price, I would have said at least double. Here at Jewelry Maker, outside these Ooh. four walls, um, then of course we know that it would be in sort of 10 times that price tag. So these are coming up at 10 o'clock. We have got 104 to be exact. 104 which is amazing um now at 11 o'clock i'm going to slide this towards me because we have a whole hour of another gemstone that if you are a collector you most definitely need to be getting now um because well sa sa 10 thousand oh. years cotan jade has been mined 10 thousand years and we are estimated to be at the final two. Seriously? Yeah, final two years of mining. So, and it's always been the most expensive gemstone on the planet. You know, here at Jewelry Maker, Stanley, you met up with Dave and the team yesterday. So, um, you know of our connections. Stanley, if you don't know, is by the way, one of the world's leading and most respected jade traders. Um, yeah, the fact that we're able to bring you Kotan Jade is but most definitely a gemstone for, I can't say the I word because I haven't got a crystal ball and I'm not a financial advisor, but it is definitely one of those gemstones I would buy for the future. Let's just put it that way. Is that Le pink jade? Yes. <gasps> there's pink, th there's blues, there's yellow. Have we got the yellow one? Yeah. Yeah, we've got a baby blue, which is the rarest color of all. Wow. And a whole strand of it. So we've got the last remaining opportunities of your Cotan Jade. Have you not seen these, Ollie? They're unbelievable. I, honestly, I, I can't stress how many times I say amongst the team here, have you bought Cotan Jade? Have you bought Cotan Jade? We need to be buying Cotan Jade because like I said, it's the history alone, there's 10,000 years history. It's always been considered with the value, most valuable gems on the planet, literally. It is one of the world's rarest gemstones. And the world of jade, that's like the pinnacle. Yeah. It's it's more valuable than imperial. You know, so to be able to bring you that gemstone here at Jewelry Maker is a um inc absolutely incredible. And furthermore, be able to do it at, a, at an achievable price tag. I you know, I never in my wildest dreams imagined that I would own Cotan Jade. You know, and and, and and I'll be okay, am I being frugal? I've bought a few strands from here at Jewelry Maker, some of which not yet, I'm gonna wait till the mine closes, some of which I will sell. Oh yeah. Absolutely. They'll pay for my new kitchen. It will yes. <laughs> it will. This is the thing. It that's the thing. Um if you look at Dave's Instagram, he was with Stanley yesterday, yeah, Stanley you. 
Yeah. Um, now, so let me just quickly tell you who Stanley is. Stanley used to be a jade wholesaler. In effect, he used to supply his jade. It is uh, multiple generations as well. Um, they used to supply jade, different types of jades, Kotan, Burmese as well, to different um, retailers. Now, obviously, with the closure of the Burmese mine and the imminent closure of the Kotan mine, he said, right, OK, well, we can't do this. Let's hold on to our inventory and sell it ourselves so they literally ah. opened up their own shop in Liana um, and like I said they, you know as a family they're hugely respected that's coming up at 11 o'clock today and you've got the most amazing masterclass as well haven't you that's the masterclass. masterclass and then you've got bro uh, crochet haven't you crochet for 9 a.m. loving 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 for the heshi oh with your heshi beads. Heshi beads sorry Roscoe what was that shall we get shall we get cracking he says Let's, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's get cracking with. What did you say? Oh, I see it. A gemstone that we see very, very, very rarely. Is this the one that literally glows under UV light? It isn't it? Oh, God. Sorry. Can I? I, I can hear my mum in my ear saying, talk properly, Elle. <laughs> it, isn't it? Isn't it? Not this one? No? Okay. I can't see any other pairs. Oh, right, okay. I thought you said it wasn't this one. Oh, uh, right, it wasn't the one I was describing. Right, I beg your pardon. Beg your pardon. Okay, in which case, um, I'm not too proud to admit, I have absolutely no knowledge about this gemstone whatsoever. Um, which is why, okay, Ross is saying, which is why we put it as the first auction. We can just literally go, I don't know. You know what, there's a little bit, <laughs> I don't know. There's over 4,000 different minerals on this planet. Um, do you want to know how, many, how much money we're losing on this? Minus 700 and what? 53%. <laughs> yeah. We, uh, 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 yeah, because of our ignorance, basically. Um, 753, that is. That's how much we're losing on this one. I love and it. It is all down to our ignorance. So how do you pronounce it? Udalite. 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 There you go. Bit of homework. We can do that tonight, can't we? Bit of homework on your Udalite. I've never seen it before. I've never presented it before, so I've got absolutely no knowledge. But let me just describe. You've got almost a level of uh, a labyrinth darkness. You've got flashes of ruby red in there. Yeah, it looks a bit like ruby zoazite, oh, doesn't it? Does it? A bit. it does a bit. Look at the enclosure. I love Ooh. it. It looks like someone's painted it. It's a bit mosaic y, isn't it? Yeah, it's a bit Monet. Yeah. Yes. Mm. Liking that. Liking love that. But with flashes it. of red as opposed to the greens. Sorry, is it a pound for the strand? It's a pound for the strand. Come on, that's amazing. Because we don't know, Debs. I went a little bit Gavin and Stacey then. I don't know. I just don't know. I don't know. <laughs> well done, everybody. Um. I do, these are lovely, absolutely beautiful, full of sparkle, great if you wanted to uh, um, see B bezel them, if you wanted to use them in something like your gallery <gasps> wire, Ooh. incorporate them in your seed beading, seed beading. These would be lovely for um, bead embroidery. Yes, oh yes, yeah, soutache and things like that. You get two, so it burns. Pet, 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 pet. Oh God, every time I do it though, I'm like, I regret it. Because it hurts your throat. Yeah, I do. One pound only. Amazing. Do you remember the days when we used to do Swarovski? And it was never a pound, was it? Nope. Yeah, because it's Swarovski. So, you know, Swarovski comes at a certain price tag. Um, they should be nine pounds and 99 pence, everybody. Well, there we go. Um, are we all the minuses again then? Just a bit. Just a bit, says Roscoe. Should we say hello to our lovely team? Ah, oh, I know you can't see him in the gallery, but we've got lovely Ross bringing you all the deals. He says, ooh, hello, hello, hello. Um, <laughs> we're treated with lovely Ollie today as well. Yay. Hi, Ollie. And we're treated with a lovely cat. Hi, cat. How are you doing? Good. You're all right. We haven't scared you off here at Jewel Maker because no, you're normally on. Here. You love being here. She's, She's got nice beautiful garden. pink in her hair. I know. Fabulous hair. Fabulous hair. Gorgeous. And don't forget as well, gorgeous Dan with the smouldering eyes. Hi, Dan. <laughs> He's on floor today, yeah. just like the old days. Got your tickets the other day, didn't you? Buzz in, he's going to see Kings of Leon. There you go. Happy, happy ah. Dan. Happy Dan. Um, right then. 
Next item, he's, uh, Ross says he can't get to a pound. Oh, they, I can see why, Ross, because these are amazing. But he will go as low as he can. Yeah, I will. <laughs> Ooh, Ooh, look at those beautifully colour matched. You can sand cast with these. Oh, yes. Garnets. I saw so, that demo. Oh, did you? Yeah, amazing. If uh, I was like, oh, I've got to get it all in. So you can sand cast with your garnets? You can sand cast with garnets. So, yeah, and, they, and these are great size, you know, wow. like if you wanted to make a ring or something. Well, there's a really carrot. stand out. There's, there's a, a carrot in the, each. There's a lot for the metal to, to hang on to oh, as well. Oh, I like it. Yeah. Oh. That's relatable, that is. I can relate. <laughs> <laughs> Can't get it to a pound. <laughs> can't get it to a pound but we oh. will do the absolute best that we can get it as low as possible one carrot per garnet how about one pound fifty each oh i know crazy absolutely crazy That's do we have many incredible 22 available on the phone lines oh it's busy this morning it's lovely to be with you has anyone um shed light on the fact what zippy is yeah one of these people must be able to somebody know. must know what zippy is zippy is described as an annoying orange zipped puppet <laughs> no species oh, oh. I, I guess that is the perfect description of him he's a one-off is he in the dictionary is that or something he's a one-off isn't he zippy was a frog was he a frog was he a frog? I guess you do get orange frogs. Yeah, I suppose he looks like a frog. Could be a frog. So if he was a frog, I... Amazing. Sold out, sold out, sold out. <laughs> um, three <laughs> products that we brought you today cost you five pounds. How amazing is that? How amazing is that? Tell you what, um, let's let's keep it under the or an orange note, shall we, with the next item. Right, okay, perfect how about i was looking eyeing this up there's loads look at all those Ooh. i'm thinking with your denim jeans and a white t-shirt and a jacket yeah. a little bit parisian chic so um you spend five pounds today if you bought all three items now this is not just your average strand of genuine gemstones uh, this is meters hello patsy darling say morning l debbie and all at jewelry maker zippy was a creature of in determinate species according to the web i always thought he was a sci-fi alien i said alien <laughs> he's an a i think he's a little alien how did the alien find his way in with a hippopotamus and a bear and jeffrey yes a frog what was zig and zag what was zig and zag they were little what were the fraggles <laughs> I like the fraggles. I like those. Down a fraggle rock. They used to walk like this, didn't they? <laughs> anyway, Roscoe, sorry. $24.99. <laughs> uh, 350 carrots. The first three items under £5. You can have this as well, under £10. There you go. <gasps> wow. Um, you know, I've never made any secret of this. I wasn't a big fan of Sodalite until we started seeing Sodalite like this. Do you know, it, it lends itself to this. I'd just put some pearls here and there nice and lovely like stations <gasps> what under 10 pounds but ross didn't mean this strand he meant everything all the auctions thus far and um, what's the meterage on this because it's clearly meterage huh a hundred inches i don't is that is that 1.5 i feel like it's 1.5 i'm terrible I with the metric know, system Angie. inches is it 1.5 I feel like it's 1.5. There's loads. There's lots. You could definitely do um, the crochet. You know the seafoam necklace that um, Katie... Uh, Parker. Parker. Yeah. Um, Katie Parker did. Um, you could do with these because you need lots and lots of gemstones. Yeah. So you could definitely crochet with this with monofilament. It looked beautiful. And you're doing crochet today, yeah, aren't you? Yeah, and it's the same stitch, so I'll show you. It's 2.5 metres. Perfect for that. Wow. I apologise for being so rubbish with my metrics. Um, do I want to count them? No, not really. No. Um, I, I think there's, uh, there's, there's definitely more than a handful there. There's a lot. And it's all natural. The clock's ticking. Ross was saying, I didn't mean under £10 for this strand. He meant under £10 for all the auctions that we have brought you so far. So by simple maths... That tells me that this two and a half metre strand of beautiful natural soda light is going under five pounds. That's amazing. How amazing is that? Put it on your wire, you could do your, your tree, oh, of, tree lives. of life. Oh, tree of life, yeah. Yeah, that would be nice, wouldn't it? Beautiful. 
the glow, the colour, and again, that's the thing so like previously, I always found a little bit underwhelming, but that wasn't until I saw quality like this. It's that wonderful denim blue. Four pounds and ninety nine wow. pence only. Roscoe, you best have lots of these available within the vault then. Huh? Is there a hundred? Well, they're not going to hang around, are they? This gemstone lends itself to this shape and this colour, yeah. doesn't it? Because you get to see all the different colours and I think it would be beautiful as a station necklace. You could put larger gemstones here and there and have a long line. Yeah, lovely. I think it would be lovely. I'm definitely feeling with your jeans in the summer. Definitely. And a pair of deck shoes and a jacket or something right like now. that. Um, Okay, lovely jewellery makers. It's Saturday morning. We're very excited about today's show because it's going to be absolutely amazing. We've got beautiful pearls, we've got Debs, we've got amazing early birds. How many have confirmed? 44 of you have confirmed. I've got 100 available. We're not even going to stop at £4.99. So those of you that I can see with multiples in your baskets, that's pound signs back in your pocket. We are going lower. Oh, really? oh there's perks to tuning in nice and early <laughs> here at Jewellery Maker, isn't there? We do like to incentivise the nice early birds. Yeah, I mean, just put a few spacer beads in there. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Some of your pearls, I love that idea. Because mm. then it's quite, um, again, I, f I feel like it's a little bit Italian yeah. chic. And you've just got this this lovely length of blue and then a white pearl and then nice. a length of blue and, it, and it'll pick up the white from the yeah. soda light. Beautiful. Oh, I want to make that now. Yeah, there you go. Well, you've got two and a half metres to do it. Not even stopping there, jewellery makers. We had 100, so many multi-buyers. More than half the stock has gone already. Three ninety nine. Goodness me, that's a coffee in some places, isn't it? It is. It actually is a price of a coffee in some places. I don't, I don't know. I try and avoid them because uh, you end up. It's less than a Starbucks coffee. Is that right? God, goodness me. Or any coffee, probably. That's not true. Not just them. Not just them. That is true. This is the thing. Popping for a coffee is not a cheap thing anymore, is it? Not at all. Not even at the Arches is it cheap now. It's gone up, hasn't it? Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Whereas you though. can still get your genuine gemstones from us at an affordable price tag. Um, we've, we're breeding, I think we've bred a little monster in our Tiggy because you know what she says every time we pick her up from school, can we go for a coffee shop? No, she loves Aww. going out for coffee. She doesn't have coffee, by the way. You know, she, she likes a baby Chino, absolutely. <laughs> loves a baby Chino and loves a cake. Um, but you know who doesn't um, 3.99 Rachel Liz West Midlands Tracy Sylvia well done congratulations don't forget your early bird that's coming up this morning brand new spacers and not just the one size the one shape that we used to bring you here at Jewelry Maker you've actually got a little collection so you've got lovely cubes look at the size of those um, you've got rice bead shapes just here you've got some kind of like irregular kind of irregular shapes there can you see like almost like hexagons oh, okay. um and then some more irregular shapes Ooh. at the back here and then you've got your diamond cut rounds all of these in one early bird deal that's coming up coming your way um oh amazing now coming up next i've got a beautiful strand of natural this one yeah of natural strawberry quartz now red is one of the ra it, well it is the rarest color to actually uh find in the quartz family and yet you have a full strand not so sure this should really be in our early bird hour really i'm not even sure i definitely don't think it should be starting at 29 pounds and 99 pence um exquisitely ombre it's little tiny sargonetic inclusions you can see on ollie's recording there tiny uh, sargonetic inclusions within the gemstone that give it its red color and that's rare it's very very rare so red to quartz is a bit like we used to say you don't get blue and garnets of course what happens then we find blue and garnets but it <laughs> is very very rare to be starting even at 29.99 this is a collector's stone yeah, I remember Jewelry Maker had strawberry quartz. I think when Marie was uh, um, buying for us, we only had a little though, um, sold out. And then it was years later that Dave actually launched it. Yeah, he had a bangle, but I don't actually remember him getting three millimeter strands or faceted variety. You're quite right. Um, anyway, do we have quantity of these? Oh my goodness me! Sorry, that I'm shocked because that's not a not a strawberry quartz price at all. I can't emphasize how rare it is to get natural reds in quartz as a gemstone. Incredibly though, says Ross in our ear, that's not even where we're stopping. I love strawberry quartz. So do I. 
It's a colour like no other. You can tell immediately yeah. what it is. Yeah. Um, it reminds me at the moment of the blossom trees, oh, of yes. the cherry blossom. But also, this is a fantastic size, the three mil. Oh, yeah, so workable, are they? Because you can use them for spaces. You yeah. can use them in your seed bead designs. Lovely. Um, I think I'd use mine as, use them all together and just have one, and I keep going on about pearls, but one large pearl, you know, that design yeah. Yeah, um, for the stacker bracelet. So yes. I think that would be so pretty. Pretty. Mm. Um, no, I, I've got no idea. We shouldn't be anywhere near a single figure price tag. Well, Ross is just saying, listen, under £10 is ridiculous already. But he says, I, I don't think you realise just how ridiculous this price is going to be. Those of you that are tuned in, nice, uh, uh, have checked out nice and early, well done. Is there quantity then? 40, okay, so there's not masses. There's not masses. Um, if we had if we had 300 it would be a deal of the day because it's a rare gemstone mm -hmm. we couldn't put together a shirt what is that goodness me sorry <laughs> ross oh my goodness ross you've got no remorse about that have you he always says i am i'm ashamed <laughs> 4.99 he doesn't look ashamed he doesn't he's a right rotter <laughs> Um, oh, look how beautiful this is. Rare. We couldn't do a showcase. Look, I could do a showcase on many gemstones here at Jewelry Maker from our vault, but we have not got the quantity to do a showcase for strawberry quartz. Don't be fooled by quartz as a mineral is abundant. Quartz as a gemstone is rare. Um, quartz in its strawberry color naturally is astonishingly rare we've shown you in the past haven't we little specimens that sold at bonhams i think it was for like three thousand pounds and they were like an inch an inch sold out well done well done well done i'd use that with a cotan you know oh i think yes. it'd be amazing with the cotan um silly deals this morning i do have a slider with a heart with a heart oh yeah this is nice i've not seen this before Oh, very pretty. So, slider bracelets are always... If you like the strawberry quartz, by the <gasps> way, tomorrow's early bird. Oh. These. Thank you, Dan. Is rose quartz. Oh, for love. This is brand new. Now we have 700. What? Watch tomorrow morning. I know it's Sunday. Set the alarm because it's going to be worth it. It is going to be worth. We're going to take it super low. Oh, I'd be multi-buying on these. It does look Morganite-esque. It's got a real strength of colour, which is quite rare, actually, when we're talking about rose quartz. That's coming up tomorrow. Quantity of 700. We're going to do an absolutely amazing deal. Do you know what? You could put that alongside as well, this lovely slider bracelet. Um, I've seen a few slider bracelets in my time. Never seen this one. That's encrusted with white zircon. Mother's Day. Mother's Day. Yes. How lovely would that be? So that's the 10th. Yeah, because my daughter thought it was Sunday. And went, what are we doing for Mother's Day, Mum? I went, it's not this week, darling, but thanks for being on it. Oh, <laughs> bless her. Bless so, her. Yeah, so I'm thinking Mother's Day, that's lovely. Beautiful. And you haven't got to worry about size. It's nice and comfortable to wear. So these aren't cubic zirconia. This is genuine zircon, one of the oldest gemstones on the planet. You've got 3.7 grams of precious metal. Um, and again, if you're, you're a regular here at Jewelry Maker, you know how easy it is to make a slider bracelet. Let's put those down now, because um, they're coming your way. <coughs> Excuse me. I mean, at 24.99, that's amazing. If you popped into somewhere like, I don't know, Pandora, firstly, they wouldn't be zircon. They would be a man-made gemstone. Zircon is mother na nature made. Um, and it would be more than 24.99. I think we'd all agree, wouldn't you? But we're not stopping there. Do we have quantity? 60 available. Okay. What if we said, this is not cubic zirconia, this is genuine zircon, this is solid 925. 10 pounds off that price tag, and we are still not done. Still not done. Oh, this is amazing, and it's definitely affordable to, for people to get for Mother's Day. You know, if you're buying for your kids, for, for their mum, or, you know, it's not always just mum on Mother's Day, is it? It's no. like Nana or Auntie or, but, you know, Cara. Absolutely. Um, oh, is it going less than 40? Yeah, it's going under £10. OK, well, that's a no-brainer then. Even if it was a pound less, I'd buy it. Yeah, under £10. We've done, we've done plain space uh, uh, slider bracelets at, at more than that. We have done in the past. That's zircon. That's zircon. Mm. Genuine colourless zircon. We had 60. 
Look at the gram weight, you can see. Let me just show you as well, jewelry makers. You've got the jump rings there on the other side. That's what you attach to. Um, so you could put the rose quartz, which is amazing because that's for unconditional love, isn't it? Perfect yep. for Mother's Day. And um, you could just do a little bar of those, or maybe you could crochet some. Nine pounds and 99 wow. pence. Do you know what? Some cards are not far off that price. I can't believe the price that some of these not all of them you go into the supermarket and you know they can be a little bit more um, yeah. um affordable however some are like who would spend like 20 quid on a card i know i'd rather that my kids always made me them i'm supposed to say don't don't buy them make them um <laughs> tr okay okay well i don't know because it 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 it's gen i just I, I just find the prices of things absolutely amazing right now. Flowers. Oh, yeah. Flowers. True. I always say to my husband, don't buy me flowers on Valentine's Day or Mother's Day. Don't do it. Buy them the next day because it's this so expensive. It goes up. Or like it? you said, make me something. Yeah. Make me something. Yesterday, I went from work and I went to um, Tiggy's school. Mm. To, to, well, she's in nursery. Um, because it was a little sing along for Mother's Day. Oh. It was ever so cute. <laughs> ever so cute. And Tiggy was that child. And they'll go, <laughs> just, uh, just out to the woods. That was Tiggy. <laughs> um, but we made, we sat and made little pipe cleaner flowers. I oh. will keep that forever. Forever. Nine ninety nine, absolutely beautiful. You got lu uh, luxury nine two five sterling silver, genuine zircon encrusted. In yeah, this would be amazing with tomorrow's early bird, wouldn't it? I or with your that. cotan. How about alongside your cotan? Oh, that's amazing. an amazing price. It I is. I mean, that is so good. I mean, what, I can't get over it really because those little zircons, they look like diamonds. Yes. Yeah. And I just think they're rarer than diamonds. Yeah. And you know, mm. you've got that lovely heart motif yep. and all of that sterling silver for ten pounds. Yes. I know I we're know. in our bubble, but still. We are in a very unique bubble, aren't we? That's base metal prices, isn't it? Yeah. You would assume that. I'd was be base happy metal. with that for yeah. base metal. It's not base metal, it's nine two five sterling silver, three point seven grams, and it's not zir uh, zirconia, it is genuine zircon. Um, you can see that brightness, and it's Cambodian zircon. So again, you should be elevating the price tag because of its location of origin. Um, good luck, Catherine. Well done, Angela, Diane. Anne, Pauline, Northampshire, Angela, Cheryl, uh, Miss Janet, Julie, Mandy, Robert, there's loads of you there. Well done, everybody. Congratulations. Um, ooh, where should we go? Should we do some um, cubes of road night? Ooh. Love road night. With your early bird, those cube spacers. Yes, that would be nice. I'd put it on like a magnetic class and have like a wraparound bracelet. Oh, what something a lovely like that. idea. Love road night. It's got this really beautiful, creamy, light -like colour saturation. Yeah. Um, amazing, absolutely amazing. What's the gemstone? I've gone blank now. What's the pink version? I always say it's a pink version of the malachite that forms equally like in stalactites and stalagmites. Yes, rhodochrosite, that's it. Sorry, that's what I was thinking. It has got an appearance of rhodochrosite about it. I went blank, thank you for that. Um, yeah, we, we don't see rhodochrosite very often, do we? I haven't seen, done a showcase no. of rhodochrosite in ages. So, rhodonite, I mean, this strand as well, when it's of amazing quality, has a rhodochrosite vibe about yeah, it. it really beautiful, creamy, natural, pinky, purple, uh, stroke red colour. 9 99 I agree, put this with your early birds, some of your cube spacer beads. How amazing would that piece of jewellery be? Um, also, I need to point out, this is something from this location um, we're not going to be buying again, so that does mean our availability of rhodonite is going to go down. Um, what we've got is what we've got. 9 99 this alongside some of your jades, I think would be absolutely Ooh. beautiful. We're not stopping there though, says producer Russ. Brand new low. Oh, I love the cubes. I do. I love that gemstone. I just, yeah. it's soft and yeah. um, calming. It is, yeah. But you could almost imagine like a, a nice cushion in this colour, couldn't you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's a really, yeah, comforting. Pink. Comforting is a good yeah, word. Beautiful. Yeah, beautiful. Six pounds and 99 Ooh, pence only. All the bargains. All the bargains this morning. Don't be shy. Come and say hello. Text in. We'd love to hear from you. Also, remember that your early bird hour is on a curfew. So remember all those items on the web, yeah, they will disappear. They'd go lovely with the spacer beads. They'd go amazing with your Burmese jade. 
I, I think because the, the, that would be a bit Japanese blossom, wouldn't it? Definitely. I think that spacer beads, and I've said this before, can make absolutely make a design. Yeah. You can take a strand and add spacer beads, and that's all you need to do, and you've elevated it to a fine piece of jewellery. And absolutely. I always say that. And people go to me, oh, that's lovely, and it's just basically a strand, but it's I've used spacers, yeah. interesting spacers. Yeah. And JM have come up with some cracking spacer beads yeah, lately. Yeah, they have. They have, it's just these irregular shapes because that's going to just Different. add luster, yep. yeah, quirks to your design. These are flying out jewellery makers, absolutely flying out. They're totally natural as well. It's almost like, you know, if you were to stir strawberry ice cream with some <laughs> vanilla together. Ooh. Yeah, sorry. I always have to mention ice cream yeah. at some point throughout the show. It is, it's that kind of blend of colours. Absolutely beautiful. Well done, everybody. Congratulations. Don't forget your early bird. Make sure you're shopping ahead um, on that one. Now, speaking Speaking of sterling silver, I've got a lovely little bracelet here. You know, yes. So it's a complete bracelet. Sorry, I was answer, answering Ross because he just said, do you know what? Do you want this under £10? Mm. Yes, we do, don't we? Perfect. Look at that. That's lovely. And it's got a nice open link so you could easily bubble style onto this if you wanted to or add a charm if you wanted. And that is a really good size. Yeah. I mean, I had to look in one of the jewellers because I was waiting for to pick Daisy up from college. She's right next to the shopping centre. And the price of silver mm. for a tiny, what I'd call like, you can hardly see one of these annoying skinny chains. I don't that know what they're called. That sticks to you. Yeah. You know, they want like 30 quid. Yeah. 35 quid it was, 34.99. That is a substantial piece of silver. It is. There's a big investment of precious <laughs> I, metal. Sorry, I'm getting excited, but you know, I mean, yeah, it that's is. very good, isn't it? The price of silver has not gone down, it's gone up. It's got, that's it. It's gone up, but how, and we mentioned this yesterday with Scott, didn't we? We were like, how jewellery maker is still bringing prices like this, particularly with the bullion market, because yeah. the price is the price worldwide. We can't really, really negotiate on that. That's crazy, Roscoe. Absolutely crazy. It's a full, beautiful bracelet. It's you amazing. can literally box that, gift it as is absolutely stunning it's genuine 925 you know you pop into i don't know um the accessory shop you pop into one of your um uh fashion shops you know you're going to be looking at costume jewelry at, at 9.99 yeah, aren't you oh yeah. yes i do think i do think especially the cubes they'd go on there no problem hang on should we try it have i got time what do you reckon ross Okay, I haven't got time, sorry. But it would, yeah, because you look, you've got a, just a little jump ring there, so you could easily feed that through. Perfect. There you go, squeeze that through, um, only because my nails are be here all day. Um, amazing. Next up, have a little look at the website first, actually. All the W's at jewelrymaker.com, there's loads of sellouts on there already. So well done to those of you that have taken the initiative to shop ahead on these. Um, oh, amazing sellout, sellout. Got some lovely jade, sellout, 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 sellout. You get the general gist. Uh, more sellouts just there. Amazing. You've got some more sellouts just there. And another one. Yeah. Oh, collots, they like gold dust. Um, oh, is that price appraise? Got loads to bring you. Up next, though, our number one favourite gemstone. There is only 20 of these remaining within the vault. Once they're gone, um, they're gone. I'm not saying that we're not going to buy more Amazonite. Of course, we will endeavour do, to do so. It's your favourite gemstone. But I understand why it's as popular as it is. Um, it, uh, talking of calming gems, I think that's what Amazonite is all about. Um, if you'd love to read about Amazonite as a gemstone, firstly, it's a feldspar. Um, but it's often referred to as a gemstone that symbolizes, it's a beacon of hope um, and the bridge between the cold of winter and the warmth and positivity of springtime. Oh. Yeah, absolutely amazing. And um, when we think of Amazonite, mostly we'll, th we'll see um, like blue, the bluey, greeny light color, but it does also come in these wonderful sandy tones, pure whites, darker shades. Yeah, um, and Ross and I, we, we, we both discussed this gemstone at length. We were like, we believe Amazonite and Neon Appetite, we believe will skyrocket in price because it's so popular. It's everywhere at the moment. It's beautiful. You know, look at Harrods. You know, they're doing in material a simple macrame bracelet with a couple of sterling silver spacer beads. This is Harrods. How much was that? £290. What? 
Yeah, you could make that. And this is a full meter strand. It's not you, you are not getting lesser quality. That's why we're showing you this photograph. It's not the same cut, but we're showing you the quality of the gemstone. No. You know, Harrods, amazing, lovely, lovely bracelet. Our, our viewers could create that easily, I think, um, or a version of that inspired by. But the quality of our Amazonite is absolutely yeah. up there. Remember, we're one of the biggest gemstone buyers in the world. So um, a lot of traders want to explain, uh, want to trade with us because we will buy quantity and just so you can get an idea of perspective it's quite slight that bracelet isn't it yeah you know if I if I drape that across just want you know across my wrist yep yeah. there you go that's twice as as wide as the what the other one and that's this isn't there you go so just pop some little jump rings they look like Look like jump rings in between on a cord. I don't think they're spacers. I think they're jump rings. They look like jump rings. Yeah. Yeah. So you you pay you, you well two hundred and ninety pounds. You're paying for two things really. There aren't you? Harrods, the name, and of course the gemstone. However, we believe Amazonite will that will be the norm for Amazonite. Two hundred and ninety pounds. That's mm. what we believe. Um, but yeah, we've never claimed ourselves to be uh, um, to be right in our pricing. Quite the opposite, you know. That's what we're all about: bringing you that level of quality and the more affordable price tag. You don't just get one strand; you're getting a full meter. Ooh. There's only twenty of these left. Six millimeters in their size. Under twenty pounds, Marla necklaces. I think they'd be absolutely beautiful. Knotted, simple stretchies. Go macrame if you wish. About one hundred and sixty-six beads on this meter That's long amazing. length strand. I've got a long line necklace made of this nice. gemstone, and I wear it all the time. I bet, and I bet I people comment it. on it as they well. Do. It goes with everything. Yeah, it's so lovely. My cousin came to stay just before Christmas. Was it just before or just after? Anyway, anyway, and she was wearing. It was just after because she was wearing her Christmas present from uh -huh. her husband. And it was a little Amazonite night pendant. Oh really? And he actually said um, he was talking about you know the the metaphysical side of this gemstone, which I was really I was like. Like, so ah oh, mm. didn't realize he would be uh, he was actually into that with gemstones he was talking about amazonite's metaphysical beliefs 19.99 there's loads of you with it in your basket so under 20 pounds for a meter not a 38 centimeter strand folks it's not 38 centimeters that's less than 10 percent of that bracelet which you could make well i don't know how many times over multiple 10 12 what do you think so the same palette, a meter of natural Amazonite, beautiful variety of colors, from your yellows to your classic Amazonite shades, to your soft cashmere silver tones, to your pure whites, not stopping there. This strand will sell out today, without doubt. Whoa. Yeah, 14 pounds and 99 pence. We have requested our gemstone buyer, Wayne, to get as much Amazonite as possible because, Ross, you know, we've both been in the industry a while, haven't we? Well, we've all been in the industry a long time. I think about the experience collectively. You know, it's, we're not, oh, it sounds a bit obnoxious, this, and a little bit like Zippy. Um, but, <laughs> no, but genuinely, we can normally gauge what's going to be the next big gemstone, yes. can't we? And yeah. that's what Gemporia do and do yeah. very, very well. Um, I actually think Amazonite, I agree, Amazonite and I think uh, um, Neon Appetite definitely uh, in the year 2025 are going to be huge. And I think with, with popularity comes a, a surge a price. in price mm. as well. So good luck, everybody. Um, it's stunning. And even if we're wrong, it's a beautiful gemstone, isn't it? And, oh, yeah. and that's a, a crazy price tag definitely in my top three yeah same it came from nowhere because i didn't really know much about it and then yeah. i was like oh my goodness i need to make yeah it's this lovely for myself to yeah. wear it, because it went with everything yeah it is beautiful hiya june in surrey saying morning team jm what a gorgeous sp uh, strand springtime in the making i'm going to make a mala for me there you go that's what june, I did. that sounds lovely that's what i did june and you'll be like Debs. you'll be wearing it all the time and it's lovely because you've just got that hint and there's so many different colors in it that it just went with everything yeah yeah. you know there wasn't anything I put on for all oh, that doesn't go and I think you could still incorporate it into your winter wardrobe as yeah, well definitely. it's one of those gems definitely. that like I said it transitions like like Monica Veneda said it's the bridge between the cold of winter and the warmth of springtime Love um, loving that 14.99 well done everybody don't forget your early bird your spacer beads um, we've got 200 available 
Um, what's that? On the website, they're priced at 49.99. You've got to remember that's a big gram weight of precious metal there. That is not your early bird price tag, though, jewelry makers. They are brand new. They've never been on your screens previously before. Um, I'm loving these ones, the little rice bead shapes. I love, I love so those. Pretty. I like the cubes as well. I yeah, think they're amazing, aren't they? Really big good. gram weight. So shop ahead on those. I've got 200, which might seem like loads. It's actually not, especially not for a Saturday morning. Um, Oh, from one multicolored Amazonite to another Amazonite, but this is, in fact, in fact, in fact, I'd sit yourself down for this. This parcel, we have asked the question, is there any chance that we can buy more? I'm just going to say two, I'm going to say one name, David Yeoman. Yes. We can't buy it, David Yeoman has the, has the, the parcel basically I love his jewelry. but this is the finest hands down this parcel that we bought is the finest amazonite i've ever seen oh <gasps> look at that. you wouldn't think that was amazonite would you it looks like you know when they go in deep into the sea at the fluorescing um, yeah. plankton it looks like that yeah and it's natural that's totally oh my natural goodness, that's stunning isn't it mm. i never knew amazonite formed in this color or with that translucency. So absolutely no enhancement. No what? enhancement. I know, it's crazy. It's just, it's crazy. Look oh, at it. it's beautiful. It's stunning, isn't it? But look, look, we cannot. Have you got the photo of the David Yeoman pieces, Roscoe? Um, we can't buy any more. Oh, uh, yeah. So when we brought this to you, it was on Mark's birthday. And... We launched IC Amazonite, it sold out, and we thought that was it. And then Roscoe found another strand. He found another strand. These are nine millimeter and the seven oh, millimeter. Beautiful. Now, the, uh, the seven millimeter sold out. This is the last, the very, very, very last opportunity that we have. Look at that color from there. Now, on Mark's birthday, 41 of these sold. I've got nine left, <gasps> but that's, that's it. No, that's it. Um, we know that we will not be able to get hold of it. Have you got a photograph of the David Yeoman pendant? Just because you'll see the quality and you'll see also why, why we can't purchase it again. Because you've got to look at it, look, if we put ourselves in a, in a gemstone traders or miners boots, um, you know, look, a lot of gemstone traders like to uh, shop, uh, tra deal with us, which we probably do continue to deal with them. However, this parcel, this variety, um, they've said, sorry, you can't have it. It's all gone here. David Yeoman. They've bought the entire quantity of it. You can see the Amazonite there. And they will pay top dollar. That's £500. <coughs> £500 for that necklace. Wow. Um, and that photograph's quite deceptive. I've looked on their website. It's tiny. It's tiny. It? Well, look at the chain. Yeah. It's an 18 karat gold chain. For £500, I was like, initially I thought, gosh, that's a good price for a pen. For that gram weight. It's tiny. Mm. Tiny, tiny, tiny. Um... Hello to you, Gloria. Morning, ladies. I own this ice blue Amazonite. We'll never sell it. I love it. It's amazing, isn't it? Yeah. Gloria, and, and like, no, I think all of us with our experience in gemstones, do you agree, Gloria? I mean, you've got an amazing collection, likewise. Have you ever seen anything like this before? No, never. Oh, with the coat on would be amazing. I think with gold would be amazing. With pearls would be amazing. I agree. This is something for your own personal collection because yeah. it is quite literally irreplaceable yeah. never say never because you know in the world of gemstones you don't know what's going what's going to what, what's going to be unearthed no that's the joy however the this supplier has said no that's it that's it it's all gone you can have other amazonite the more traditional amazonite but for the icy blue it's been purchased entirely by david yeoman 799 pounds which might seem um you know a, a, well it is a big price tag i get that but not comparative to that tiny almost amulet that you see there on david yeoman susie's got hers london maker maker angela gloria you're there london rachel and swansea Oh, this is the last eight that we have within the vault. No more. Once it's gone, it's gone. It, it literally is last chance saloon. But what, if you'd have asked me, if, if this had been put in front of me and somebody had said, guess the gemstone, Amazonite 
would never ever no. ever have come uh, I'd have never said that Gem no. I would have mentioned I would have mentioned your Pareba tourmaline Windex blue Pareba tourmaline that's what I would have mentioned never would I have said Amazonite because it's not just the colour it's the translucency as well yeah. that you get with this we had nine or or yeah you would assume it was a maybe a heavily treated yeah. gemstone not the case it is totally and utterly natural totally natural manchester you've done it well done you've got your split payments there as well during what did we go lower did we okay do you know what i'd use this with sargonetic quartz Ooh, i think that'd be lovely as that a would contrast be lovely and under yeah like a red or a like a pinky like color oh the i know what you mean um uh no it's uh harry winston um makes uh, put teams sleeping beauty turquoise with with uh, specitite garnet uh, it's unbelievable it's just that color the color contrast we're at 99 pounds and 99 pence incredibly we didn't stop there sorry i've got no recollection of this i uh, look my memory's terrible so um really we took it even lower i was happy at 199 loads of you were happy at 199 it's a last chance opportunity never say never in the world of gemstones but what we have said quite be, been told quite uh, um conclusively from the actual uh, trader of this you can't we can't have any more because david german will pay top dollars and we're priced out effectively we could buy it but then it would mean we'd have to charge you know higher prices if we took 10 pounds off that already amazing deal if we took 20 pounds that would be ridiculous wouldn't it how about 30 back into your pocket we have never in Ooh. our almost 14 years of broadcasting if we just put it that into perspective 14 years of broadcasting we have never done amber's night like this no 14 years look at the split payment it's gonna it's last chance so enjoy it enjoy it enjoy admiring it it's the last chance i'm gonna get the opportunity to bring this to air and it's absolutely stunning oh it's so beautiful you you, you think about the price of of windex blue brazilian tourmaline Oof. braver tourmaline you know, it's not 69.99. A strand like this would be tens of thousands of pounds, quite literally. Um, it's that color and it's totally natural. Well done, Carol, Linda, Cumbria, Surrey, Manchester, Maker, um, Angela, London, London, Anna, Julie, Barbara, uh, new customers, Anne, Pamela, Lillian. Uh, you can do it if you check out your baskets. Barbara in Sussex, stay where you are on those phone lines. Um, Swansea, North Yorkshire, Gloria, you've got it on in your basket. Joan and Isle of Wight. Um, there's a lot of you with it in your basket. Pamela in Monmouthshire, I can see you there, lovely. If you've pressed your option one, stay where you are. Has it gone? Wish list it. Wish list it. Oh my goodness me. I think I love that. Stunning. Now, on the website, on our website, all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. In item number 11, there is one 10 mil of the ice, J, uh, of that ice, oh, not Jade, the ice Amazonite. Oof. So if you what, if you missed out on that last strand, there is one in item number 11. And that is the only icy Amazonite that we have left in uh, here at Jewelry Maker. That's it. Now one more auction before I bring you your early bird jewelry makers. Um, I've only got five, uh, Liam's bundle. He was so naughty with this, wasn't he? Liam, of all the managers today, Liam was the naughtiest. Was he? I, I, I'm not surprised. No, I'm not surprised. No. Come on, to go. I'm the sexy penguin. <laughs> was he the penguin? Was he the... <laughs> He came on with, with, with products he nicked from Hobby Maker that hadn't even been launched. Naughty. These trolleys, see that pink trolley that's around you? Yeah, I've those. got it. I know, it's amazing, isn't it? I've bought some as well. I've bought a couple of those. They're so good, aren't They're they? They're amazing because you can move them to room to room. Yeah. You know, like, if you, yeah, absolutely epic. Now, you can hang things thing off did, them as well, can't you? Yeah, yeah, the little, the little, little caddy things. things. The other thing he did, he took Jade, Jadeite, Burmese Jadeite, mined out Burmese Jadeite. Now, he's a little bit out of the scene yeah. now, isn't he? Yeah. So he might not... Uh, no, he does. He knows. He <laughs> knows. Here's me trying to sugar, make things better for Liam. He knows that Burmese Jadeite is mined out. But he took this strand alone... Oh, it's lovely. ...which includes... Yeah, no, it's mirror image. Look at this. So I wonder if... Wonder if 
Cap, yeah, follow it down. So you've got yellow, firstly. Red. Ooh. Oil green. Look, mirror image. White. And look. A graduated 13 millimetre. Honestly, you are, and you get this one. I don't want to overlook this one, which includes black type A jade eye, yellow type A jade eye, white and green. So Liam bundled all this. You won't believe what he did. It's ridiculous. Oh, it's gorgeous, that strand. Oh, that's all me. I would do. I think we all agree. You've got oil green, you've got reds, you've got yellow. So even if we did that, mm -hmm. 199 pounds is a massive carat weight. It's not type B, it's not type C, it's type A grade. Look, this is a one-off. This is, it's funny because call it egos, whatever. It was a case that I want to bring the best deals. I want to bring the best, I want to be a fly <laughs> on the wall in that meeting. Um, basically, we're all trying to outdo each other. It's so funny. So funny to watch, actually. L this will get raised in our trade meeting. Liam, you can't do those prices for type A jade eye. We can't buy anymore. Our team are in Hong Kong as we speak. I don't know how fruitful it is as of yet, but let's just say we'd probably be better off buying it back from ourselves. A beautiful graduation. Reds, yellows, or, uh, you've got the oil greens. Look at the translucency. These aren't dyed. They aren't polymer impregnated. Type A grade. Even if we were to stop here, are we ready? This is a PR deal. Basically, it's, it's, it's a Liam PR, basically. <laughs> what? It is stupid. It's a daft price, that. And who bundles Jade? Liam. <laughs> Can I just say the smaller one shouldn't be $6.99? $69.99? No. We could sell those two reds on their own for $69.99. And there's yellows, which come under the red umbrella. I've got, I'm holding two yellows here. You could, any, that one on its own there, not one of these jadeite beads in my head should be $69.99. Not one of them. That, that 13 millimeters. That's it, a necklace. You just put a clasp on that. It's beautiful, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, and, and, and at that price, add a zero to the end and that's that's being conservative yes that's being being conservative this is mined out completely mined out how many do we have left of these what oh one there's one left london's got two elaine cumbria linda midlands cheryl linda maker and julie susan there's loads of you there well done everybody congratulations now what we're going to do is what Okay, we're going to cut to a break. Okay, and then, so everything on the web will disappear, so make sure you check out your baskets, and just after the break, we will be bringing you your early bird, the brand new space of bundle jewellery makers, so um, do not go anywhere. We've got amazing projects and demonstrations with the wonderful Debs, um, so you don't want to miss it. We'll be back after this. Hi, it's Debbie Kershaw. I'm back with you on Saturday, the 2nd of March with the most amazing projects. Now in the 12 o'clock hour, I'm going to be showing you how to make this carnival necklace, but there's a little bit of magic involved. I'm gonna be showing you how to turn a plain gemstone like this into something like this. It's magic, I can't wait to show you. And in the 9 a.m. we've got some lovely Heshi bead mini make boxes. I do like a Heshi bead. And I'm going to be showing you how to crochet with them this time. So I thought that might be a nice technique for us to do together. So I hope you can join me and the team on Saturday at JM. Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewelry Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? 
Then click here to see today's bestsellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click on the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewelry Maker. Shopping with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website, from your jewellery room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewellery Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewellery Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewellery Maker. Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. My ray of sunshine you are. <laughs> I'm always smiling when I'm with you. Good morning, everybody. It's lovely, Debs. Oh, Debs, and your jewellery is absolutely... Oh, look, we, um, Dan, can we just scooch that tea bar? Um, sorry, that lovely. Thank you. Oh, look at your jewellery. This is fun. Oh, it's so... And, you know, I know we say, you know, we're Heshi beads, but... You know, I've seen very sophisticated ladies wearing stacker Heshi yeah. bracelets with their, you know, high-end Yeah, totally. Love Funny, bracelets. Weirdly, we spoke about that yesterday as your deal of the day. Like, bracelet. The bracelet is like the hottest trend of 2024. Yeah. And you stack it, you have an arm party. Yeah, an arm party, absolutely. And it is mixtures, it's personalizations, it's corded, it's, it's uh, cuffs, it's statement weights and links, it's yes. all of the above, absolutely. And you think about like, uh, how many celebrities just wear one single cord? Yeah, they do, don't they? Yeah. You know, just one single corded bracelet. This is, I'm loving the little rainbows. Oh, so am I. That's what started it all, you know. What? Those rainbows. Oh, really? That's what, no, that's what started our oh. conversation this morning. Oh, yeah, it was. <laughs> I thought you meant what started these kids. Uh, yeah, up above the, the streets street and, and, and you get hearts and letters and stars. Oh, they're so beautiful. My daughter loves these. Yeah, I bet. And um, she just, yeah, I mean, she's 17 and they're all walking around with these bracelets on. You know, yeah. it's not it doesn't just have to be diamonds and ruby you know but jewelry can be fun jewelry can be everything i totally jewelry can agree. be whatever mood you're in absolutely it's festival jewelry holiday jewelry you don't want to take your nice jewelry on the plane take it abroad take your fun happy jewelry well this is the thing it can show your personality as well can't it yes i, I love that and there's nothing saying you can't mix them with your gemstones if you wanted to so this is deb's kit that's coming up in this hour of course you get your written project instructions as well um 
um, alongside each of those purchases. So this here we go. This is literally what we were just talking about. There's uh, Angelina Jolie at uh, premiere of Kung Fu Panda. Exactly. They, there she is, Kung Fu Panda, wearing her um, wearing her, her braided or is it, are they, they heshies or braided? Um, you think they're heshies? You got Leonardo DiCaprio wearing his in his suit. He's Looking quite a dapper. trendsetter, isn't he, Leonardo? Yeah. He's quite. Do you know what the red means? Isn't it? Um, I was looking this up, and it depends. It means different things to different cultures. Yes. Do you know why? Because I like landscape artists of the year, and Tai Shan Schirenberg had one on. Yeah. And he's not really a jewelry wearer. No. And it can be like a spiritual. So it can be Kabbalah, which is like Kabbalah, that. Kabbalah. Yeah. It can be a spiritual symbol for protection. Yeah. So that tends to be quite um, and for luck. So luck and protection tends to go across all the different religions and different meanings. Mm -hmm. So um, I know it as the Kabbalah, and that's like keeping you grounded, isn't it? But it also has bases in Chinese tradition, in Hindu tradition, yep. in spiritual yep. practices, and usually the common thread is protection and luck. Love that. Yeah. Absolutely love that. Um, well, they, why, why not? It doesn't have to be a cord. It can be a Heshi bead. Now, Madonna's got one as well. That'll be there for Kabbalah, because she does Kabbalah, doesn't she? Does she does Kabbalah. So but that's about her being humble. Yes. Yeah, and grounded. <laughs> and grounded. Um, <laughs> speaking about Heshies, you've got um, Ariana Grande. And is that Miley Cyrus? I think Gosh, it is Miley Cyrus. Miley Cyrus looks so different there, doesn't she? She does. There you go. I do like that. You see, there's something about that. I think that's ever so nice. Yeah. Yeah, they, they could, you know, let's be honest, they've all got deep pockets, haven't they? Yeah. I love that, Deb. That's so beautiful. So, again, just I put spacer beads on. I, in the past, when I've used these Heshi boxes, I've even put them with pearls. You yeah. Know, you can really mix it up and make them look quite quite high end. Yeah. I just think they're fun. They're such fun. And if you if you can't wear certain metals, yeah. go with a Heshi. Definitely. Because they're like a polymer, aren't they? So yeah. they're nice and soft. They're soft. I think they're great for fun jewellery. That one's just on um, stretch elastic, so it does go through. And then what I'm going to show you today is this crochet bracelet, because to me, it's a bit like um, a... Ah. What do you call those bracelets? I thought it was like, a, like a fiddle bracelet. You know, like a stress Fidget. bracelet. Fidget. Because you can move the Heshi beads, like it's hard to show because with one hand, but you can yeah. move them from side to side, so they go flat. Oh, um, you could go one way or the other. So oh, yeah, nice. so that you can just fiddle with that. I mean, you know, like those cushions that you can move the sequins. Yeah. And it changes. Yeah. You can do that when you when you um, crochet them like this. Yeah. Clothing. You some like my girls have got a couple of jumpers that you yes, do that. Yes. Daisy used to. So yeah. it had like a happy face and then a sad face. Yeah. Um, and Claire McDonald, <laughs> by the way, she's she's Excellent. got one of those too. Yeah. <laughs> now, so this project is on pre-order right okay. now and you get masses you get absolutely yeah, you masses we have also got cord bundles that are also on pre-order that you've just been raving about haven't you was very impressed with this cord. you know they're mark's cord the ones that that he he launched i'm not surprised because you know i thought I, i'm not the biggest cord fan i'll be completely honest but i got this and i thought oh goodness me this I did the necklace because of the way it crochets up so beautifully. Yeah, it does. So, you know, I thought, oh, this is the sort of thing Daisy, my daughter, wears. So, uh, love that. You could just crochet that and not even put a gemstone on no, it. No, absolutely gorgeous as is. Now, we've got your early bird Woo! to bring because you mentioned spacer beads in there. A spacer, and I've said this a few times over the past couple of weeks, haven't I? But a spacer bead, for me, would we call it a finding? I don't know. Uh, maybe, maybe not. But for me, it's one of those items that. I think you will use the most. Oh, I'm always running out. Uh, me too. Constantly. You know, because they are, obviously they're decorative. They're not necessarily, they haven't necessarily got a, a particular function unless of course you're hiding knots with them and True. things like that. They are decorative. But for me, when I make jewelry, I don't think there's a single piece of jewelry that I've made that doesn't have a spacer bead in there. Agree. Do you see where I'm coming I'm from? I'm always looking for them. Because yeah, I me think, too. What can I do with this strand? What oh, it needs something. Yeah. It needs something different, but not another gemstone. And I'm constantly running out of them. Constantly. Yeah. It 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 they are 
an absolute must to anyone's stash. And whenever we have them here at Jewelry Maker, they always fly out. Now we have 200 available. Ooh. The days, and again, I know I'm sounding like a broken record here, I do apologize. But we used to bring you spaces where they were like three or four millimeters, yeah. um, job done. They were sort of your plain uh, spherical beads. Lovely, absolutely lovely. Um, and they used to fly out. I'm fairly sure they were around about 14 pounds or something like that, weren't they? For a pack of, pack of 15, I remember. I remember when we used to do them in tens. Yeah, I remember tens. Because that it, sometimes we'd get them in kits and you were only allowed to use what was in the kit in those days, like yeah. findings and everything. And you'd think, oh, if I only had a couple more spaces. I need more, I need more. Well, we're about to bring you jewellery makers, a pack of, is there 50, did you say, Ross? So 25 in a pack, but we've got 200 available. Um, so these are brand new. But like I said, it's not just your generic spacer bead now. Each of these are a, a decorative feature. You know, cubes, look how, look how decorative they are. So you get five of your cubes and there's obviously a big investment um, of precious metal there. You get my favorite, these lovely rice bead shapes. Yeah. I think they're so gorgeous. Um, then you've got these kind of irregular, triangular, hexagonal kind of shapes across those two. There's two different designs. And at the back here, you've also got some of your spherical, but almost like illusion cut. Do you know yep. where I'm coming from? Yep. So if they, when, they, when you're wearing them, they're going to give you that light performance. Now, we have 200. Look at the gram weight. 25 solid 925 sterling silver findings. 25 of them. Even here. You know, I could sit here and witter on about all the different designers. I do witter a lot. No, you don't. You I do like witter a lot. No, you don't. Um, even my daughter said that yesterday. She was yeah, like, Mummy talks a lot. She talks <laughs> a lot for a job. Talks a lot. I was like, yes, well, I kind of have to, Willow. <laughs> all right. Um, but look, I could go to Tiffany's. I could go to all those big designers. I could show you loads of different uh, brands that do a classic, simple, stretchy bracelet with yes. sterling silver spaces. Exactly. You know? And that will elevate your designs. And are these sterling silver? Oh, they are. They are. Now, that makes all the difference, I think, because if you're going to put them with something like your jade, something with your higher end strands, beautiful pearls, personally, I want to put my sterling silver in there. Yeah, definitely. You? And you can straight away say, this is 925 sterling silver. And pearl. This and is pearls. precious metal. Yeah, exactly. And it only needs to be one. Right. We had 200. Mm -hmm. I was thinking that Ollie just said in my ear, actually, actually sometimes I think we're connected psychically, you know. <laughs> um, I was thinking you could set a gemstone or stamp onto the yes. cube, an initial, and Ollie just said that in my ear. And yeah, nice. I think you could, Ollie, definitely. Lovely. You could think about some of your favourite four letter words. You could have love stamped you, all the way around. You could. You could. <laughs> you could put, no, but there is a whole. People have jewellery that have rude words on. On I, Etsy, I wasn't and they thinking sell rude. I was thinking nice. There is rude word jewellery. Is there? And whole people have whole businesses. Of what? I don't know why you'd want to give your partner with it, but you know. For <laughs> me. Whatever. Whatever. Whatever flimsy <laughs> bone. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> um, I was thinking nice letters, nice words. Like love and hope. Yeah, things, things like, like that. that. Me too. Um, 24 pounds and 99 pence only. That's for that huge investment of sterling silver. And again, the, the, you know, the choice is like a pick a mix, a lovely selection. I mean, that's perfect on that image. You can see the kind of hexagonal yeah. shapes. You can see the diamond cut. I, I'm referring to them as like an illusion uh, circular bead. You've got the elegant rice beads. You've got your cubes. I'm loving these. Now they're brand new, but I will tell you, regular viewers know this. Um, 200 is not enough, especially on a Saturday morning. Whenever we bring you spacer beads, they always absolutely fly. Now, the first uh, group of people that have already shopped with us. multi -mine. Most of you have multi-bought, yeah. Most of you have all said, right, I'll have more than one of these. Because you know you're gonna use them, don't yeah. you? They, you know that if you do, I don't know, tassels, you can put them in tassels. Yes. You could use them in t instead of knotting gemstones. You can use them as spacer beads. Don't underestimate the power of hiding a knot. Yeah. Really annoys me when you can see they're not on a stretchy. Yeah. You know, you just dip a bit, a bit of glue on and pull it in and it'll stay in that bead. Yeah. And then, you know, that's extra security. I'm forever looking for beads that, to go in my stretchies so that I can hide the knot. Yeah, if you've got to like scratch around in the bottom. Uh, yeah. yeah, the drawer. I'm the same. <laughs> I'm the same. 
and you never you can always find one finding over and over and over again you're like i'm not looking for that i yeah. want a spacer bead exactly so when you see them make sure that you are stocking up your stash now already so many multi buyers getting involved we're at one pound per sterling silver spacer Ooh. bead let's take it lower jewelry makers how about under 20 pounds amazing under 20 i'd pay that for the cubes yeah if i put those cubes because you've got what five you've actually got five there not four we said four didn't we look you could put your name you could put you could one two three you could put initials or uh, letters numbers imagine that on one of our slider bracelets lovely on a bit of cord how pretty dream you could stamp dream on there if yeah. you wanted to you could do so if you multi buy then you know you could put full sentences if you want yeah, it's entirely up to you and we're focusing on the cubes you've also got these lovely decorative ones too 19.99 this is your early bird you know we're not stopping there you will use a spacer bead over and over and over and over and over again we're less than a pound per uh, 925 decorative bead they do so much more than space that's the thing right let's get that price on the move we've got 200 available they're gonna be on and gone 30 seconds on your screen we are going lower on some leather they'd be lovely on leather i'm suzanne says i'll have seven i don't blame you suzanne renata's multi-bought angela's multi-bought nicolette's multi-bought elaine's multi-bought lillian's multi-bought um there are loads of you there how about what well, right now we are oh the next price crash how about less than 70p yes please for a 925 sterling silver decorative that's bead. amazing it is amazing they're sizable some of yeah. these yeah you know, sterling silver but at base metal prices unbelievable there's loads and loads and loads of you getting involved lots of multi buyers getting involved as well absolutely amazing we're still not stopping that's not your early bird price tag look at how beautiful each of them are just one on a bit of leather cord i think would be amazing can i steal one of those cubes for a minute a please? cube yes you can i just wanted to see what it looked like on the cord because i think it looked really pretty yeah on your cord bundle that's coming up now 50 have gone that's 25 percent of the stock over 100 of you have added these to your uh to your in your basket suzanne you've upped your quantity well done to 10. carolyn cornwall louise multi-buying alison judith d multi-buying neathport talbot helen manchester multi-buying hillary renata multi-buying well done to you angela you're multi-buying catherine in manchester's just multi-bought today sterling silver a selection a pick a mix of 925 for less than 60p oh, they've got a great si wow 14.99 yeah they've got a great size drill hole there you, you could go. get a cord a good few times through there you get leather through there yeah absolutely you get chain through there do you know like, again sorry to sound to, deb's we used to do the little two three millimeter spacer beads packs of 10 we did for not far off that price tag uh, wasn't it 14.99 for 10 or 19.9 yeah. something like 40, that wasn't 40, it uh, 14.95 is in my head yeah i feel like that was the price mm. um because i used to buy loads back in the day back in it? the day when we used to do them in packs i thought of that was good then. yeah me it too. probably was good then yeah and then they went up to 15 and then they yeah. went up to 20 in yeah. terms of quantity but now you're actually getting a pack of 25 with different designs you know these are substantially bigger that's the key isn't it the different designs that will elevate your jewelry and make it look like nobody else's jewelry and that, let's face it that's why we make jewelry we want something individual something unique yeah something that we can stamp our personality onto and you can do that with things like this look at those i want them lower please ross <laughs> ross has just asked that question really come on you should we go lower Ooh, we're going lower shall we but they will sell out yeah oh yeah true they will sell out i don't know what's happened to these tweezers i know i don't know who's done that <laughs> you can fix that with the pliers yeah i'll they, do that in a minute oh, does that make it easier to hold no oh. it doesn't no it makes them so much harder um we're at 14 pounds and 99 pence but not stopping there we had 200 available sevens tens eight sixes fours threes yeah there's loads of multi buyers getting involved we're going to have a full call screen of names because producer roscoe has said should we go lower yeah shall we let's do it let's do it ross wow 
That's a very good price. Wow, well, honestly, I think that would be a great price for three cubes. I was just thinking I'd pay that for the cubes. Don't you think? Mm. If that was a deal, if I was, if we were talking early bird, three cubes, sterling silver, and I said, okay, the 925 sterling silver, you've got a nice substantial ground where you can see that, 12.99, they'd fly at that price. That's, I, bleh, I can't. Again, you know, this is sterling silver, and I know I'm always going on about it, but I know how much sterling silver has risen in price over the last 10 years. Yeah. It's, it's honestly, it's gone from being something that you didn't really think about to actually, it's it's expensive. Yeah, it is and expensive. And it's getting more expensive. Yeah. It can fluctuate day to day. Do you know, but I think almost we are blasé about this because it is mined from the ground. We yes. forget that, don't we? I'm just going to fix these because yeah. they annoy me. It is mined from the ground. You know, it's rare, precious. You know, it has... Uh, you know, it's not gone down in price. Precious metal is is is, is, is something that people trade on their precious. You know, the, the market. Oh, you know, I used to. But when I was learning to do metal work, we used to buy a piece, a sheet of um, sterling silver just for class. And what are we going to make? What do we need? You tell us what we needed. You know, and it wasn't. You know, you didn't think really think about it too much. And now, when I went to buy some sterling silver sheet, uh, probably about three years ago, I couldn't believe how, how expensive much, it was. How it? expensive it was yeah. now. I couldn't believe it. Um, we have twenty-five different designs mm -hmm. sterling silver spacer beads. Five designs, five of each. We are currently so at 53p per sterling silver spacer bead. There are 56 available within okay. the vault. Ross doesn't like 53 <laughs> for some reason. <laughs> really? Look, we don't need to take this lower. They are already looking like they're going to be an on-screen seller. I've got about 50 of them left as well. But he says, should we take it to 50p on the nose? Yeah. 50p. I, I don't know what that works out because mass is not my strong point. Nor mine. I'm just remembering when we had bead shops and we used to pay per bead. You used to get a little basket and walk around. You still do that sometimes at the bead fairs. And you know, 50p would buy you like a large plastic bead or a gemstone. Absolutely. Not, 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 <laughs> not sterling. Two, no, yeah, no not way. Not 25 sterling silver. We're going to do it anyway. We don't need to do this price drop, but we're doing it anyway. It, 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 the bullion market is the bullion market. The gram, you know, it, it fluctuates on a um, not just a monthly or weekly basis, on a daily, if not hourly yeah, basis. Absolutely. It fluctuates. Um, we buy quantity. That's the <laughs> only way that we can actually negotiate deals like this. That's crazy, low. That's so good. That, that, uh, and again, never mind making comparisons elsewhere. Those of you that have been uh, with us for um, for any length of time, you remember when we used to do packs of 10 seed beads for about this price? Do you remember when we used to do packs of 10? And they were like two, three, four millimeters? We've only, t look at the amount of multi-buyers getting involved. You know, you know, when you're multi-buying, that extra, those up. extra few pennies do add up, don't they? And you think of how much extra you can charge for your piece of jewellery or how much better your reputation is to be yeah. adding that element of precious metal to your pieces. Look, I, I think there's a place for costume jewellery. Definitely. Absolutely is. But when, you, when you've got gemstones, like, I don't know, use that Amazonite yeah. as a prime example, I would not put that with anything other than uh, no. precious metal. No. You know, I wouldn't because, uh, you know, it's it's almost showing the respect of the gemstone, isn't it? And you're right. I think it absolutely boosts your uh, um, regard as a jewellery maker as well. Especially if you're at a craft fair. I, I don't know now, but I think so from the craft fairs I've been to. But certainly when I was making to sell, there's always quite a lot of jewellery stalls. Yeah. So you need yours to stand out. And one of the questions I got asked the most was, is it sterling silver? Yeah. Are the earring wires especially sterling silver? Is this sterling silver? And you know, you say yes, and they're like, oh, there is prick up. Yeah. They Surprise. stay a yeah. bit longer. They yeah. look a bit more. Because we have that perceived value straight yeah. away, don't we? Um, amazing. Absolutely amazing. Now, the quantity that we have left... Um, Ooh, just 20. <laughs> now these are literally launched today. It's going to be what I always described as a one show wonder. Um, don't forget jewelry makers, we've got some absolutely amazing, speaking about luxury, we've got some amazing opportunities in today's show. Your dealer today, the finest pearls, honestly, they are dreamy, dreamy are pearls. Um, here they are, look. I, oh. have, I did say to my husband last night, after seeing this recording yesterday, I was like, please can you tune in at 10 o'clock and make sure that you buy the dealer today. The, the luster, which is the most important, I think, of the virtues. Agreed. Um, 
Pearls is our, I think, our greatest strength. Oh, it's our agree. greatest strength. 100% agree with that. Also, we've got Kotan coming your way as well in the showcase, last remaining opportunities. I've got six left, so I'll leave those with you. Amazing. Now, minute clock on your screens because, because it is time for Deb's project. These are brand it. new. I've written it out for you. Oh, amazing. Amazing. You get so much with these, don't you? There you go. So your crochet Heshi bracelet, that comes for free. For it does. Free. It does, it does. There you go. And you've, So that's available when your um, order is available for dispatch, by the way, jewellery makers. I bought loads of these little Heshi Me projects. Too. Loads and loads of them. And I tell you what, over half term, they were a complete godsend. <laughs> they really were. Tiggs was getting involved with these as well. Well, my kids have always, I mean, my son, who's 17 and a complete petrol, uh, 18, I'm talking about, will kill me for saying this, but he won't know. But when he was young, he was crafting too. Yeah. Now, he's at uni doing engineering now, and I'm sure that that working with your hands, getting his brain creative and that, mm -hmm. I'd like to think has something to do with it. Sure, most My definitely. daughter is doing A-level art. She wants to go and do an A-level um, degree. Uh, so an A-level degree, an art degree. And I think starting them young to be creative, get them away from the blooming screens and yeah. the, you know, get their creative brain flowing. It this worries is me, the screens, you know. It I really think worries me. As long as you've got something creative going at the same time, I think it's balance. Balance, yeah, I totally agree. I do totally agree. Um, I, I, and I'm funny enough, I had a similar conversation with my, um, with Willow's teacher. I was like, look, cause, because Willow got pulled out of her art class um, to do some additional maths. She needed a little bit of help with some of her maths. And I was like, look, uh, no. take her out of another class. Don't yeah, take her no. out of a creative no, 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 class. No, 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 no. You know, because I think it's so important that kids create. Um, look at how beautiful. I'm saying kids, I love these. And your jewellery is amazing. And we're under £20. Look, it comes within the case. You get masses. Absolutely masses. Do you know my favourite, though? Mm -hmm. My favourite. I'm just going to put uh -huh. one of each. Little rainbow. The little rainbows are absolute. I pay £20 for these rainbows. A lot of people make to sell for charity, don't they? Yeah. So if you're making to sell for that, I know we don't do it as much, but I always associate that with the National Health Service and all of the wonderful yeah. work that they do and did do for us and continue to do for us. Yeah. And if you're making and making charity makes, I think these would be wonderful. Also, if you're doing your school fairs, you're doing, you know, where you want the more pocket money price um, jewellery to sell. Also, bookmarks, things like that. I think this is perfect. Yeah. I like the little hearts. They're, they're so, so beautiful. You've got letters in here as well. Oh, they're amazing. All different colours. Um, look, if I just tilt them upwards, you can <laughs> see you've got lots of different stars. I like the fact they've got that little frame. Can you see them there? Um, you've got the... No, you can't, can you? You've got the little frame. I'll get a few of them out then. Oh, look at these. And we used to spend ages making them, didn't we? With like <laughs> yeah. polymer clay and stuff. Yeah. Oh, look at that one. You know what this is great for as well? Your colour mixing. Do you always stick to the same colour palettes in your jewellery? You, you think, oh, I love that colour palette, but I never would have thought of it. You can have a play with a box like this. Yeah. You can play with your usual colour palettes and put different things together. And that will impact you in, in your designing of your other pieces. Oh, these are beautiful. Aren't they fun? You've got all different hearts, different, you've got stars in there as well. We've lost Elle. You have lost me. Sorry, I'm totally, I'm totally loving She's these little shapes. She's engrossed. Aren't they lovely? They're amazing. I think they're just really charming. And, and and I know so many of you. We see your entries, don't we, in the Wall of Fame? So many of you make the the, the most incredible high end designs. But as as Ross was showing with those photographs as well, it's good to show personality as well. It is personality, and there is. Um, there's no such thing as proper jewellery. I totally don't yeah, agree with that. Jewelry. All jewellery is jewellery. And there's a place for every bit of jewellery because it says about your personality, about your creativity. And this says colour. And that's just on memory wire with pearls. So yeah. I wouldn't say that wasn't proper jewellery. No, you know, absolutely. I think that there's room for all sorts of jewellery. And if you mix up your style, then I think you can put something like this with, you know, your gold bangle or your silver bangle or whatever it may be. And you're expressing your creativity. Do, do you know, I'm just thinking about like these little beads, the little rainbows, just those alone, the whole conversation that they prompted this yeah, morning. Yeah. And we were all laughing. We were True. all having a fun, you know, all from the little rainbow. Yeah. You know, generally, that's what jewellery is about, isn't it? It's enjoyable. Should Absolutely. be enjoyable. Fun. We're at 14 pounds and 99 pence. Roscoe, how many have we got? 
200. Look at that bracelet. Oh, thank you, Ollie. Ollie says he thinks that looks high end. It is. Well, I think, like, if you look at, I'm going to put that on my wrist, okay? What if I've got a couple of stretchies, right? I'm going to put this one on because this is really colourful. Now, I've got just precious metal. Yeah, but they look lovely together. Bangles and things. And yet, I think that looks so pretty. It and does. And I would wear that. Oh, yeah. I've become cool. And it, yeah, yeah, edgy. <laughs> well, we, Roscoe, yesterday, you know that 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 um, headline that we read for mm. the deal of the day yesterday, and it was talking about bracelets, weren't they? They were talking about not. It's not just one style of bracelet which is on trend. No, it's all bracelets. It's, it's just and they kind of listed them, them didn't yeah, they? Yeah, piling them. Um, they listed. Have you got that? They listed the different varieties, and they went from sort of your statements. Here it is. I literally read this at ten o'clock yesterday ah. morning. Bracelet trends in twenty twenty four. Which wristwear styles will steal the showcase i didn't put it all in because it was quite a le lengthy article because it actually sort of uh, uh bullet points at the top uh bracelets those charming wrist adornments that have stood the test of time um are all set to redefine fashion in 2024 this year the world of wristwear is bursting with innovation and del a delightful blend of traditional elegance and contemporary chic Bracelets have always held a unique place um, in the realm of accessories, offering a way to express one's individuality, which is exactly yes. what we've just been talking about. Um, as we dive into the hottest, hottest bracelet trends of 2024, we discover the captivating world of statement pieces, the understated charm of minimalism, the nostalgic beauty of beaded bracelets, the boldness of cuff designs, and the personal touch of customized wristwear. See, th it's all those things, and that is, absolutely included in designs like these oh yeah and i just think to add that bit of color i you know i like to i, I often have a base of black and then i might wear a kaftan you've always seen me wear those or yeah. you know and i will add the color of my jewelry me too and i i i mean i haven't today because you know i just didn't put it on but i will always have a beaded bracelet with my precious metal jewelry or a, you know something fun some color and that is what they mean when they say arm party yeah and and this is just a party. Go into Pinterest and just put in arm party, and you'll come up with loads of celebrities and all the di how what they put together. It's so clever, yeah. and it looks so pretty. Yeah, Easter's around the corner. Easter, absolutely. Yeah. Now, sixty second clock on your screen. Oh, are we going down. Yeah. Shall we get these with your instructions? By so the good. way, shall we get these under ten pounds? under 10 pounds you've got what 4 8 12 16 20, 24 sections thousands probably of beads individually in uh 2 3 4 8 12, 16, 12 24. 24 can i just say that some places would charge 14.99 for the box for the box on their own <laughs> yeah, yeah absolutely you know that is the price of certain easter eggs if you are thinking easter gifts yeah. isn't it we've got the cord to bring you as well i just love these you know you could if you you know uh, I make little friendship bracelets out of yeah. these as well, That's not what just for did. my children, for my friends as well. Yeah. We're going to do it. It's going under ten pounds, jewelry makers, which is my favourite. The rainbows. I love the rainbows. They're so sweet. That whole section. Oh, they're forty-one p. You get so many in there for all those rainbows, not just one. All those rainbows. That's amazing. There's whole sections online for inspiration on Heshi or clay bead um, jewellery, things that you wouldn't even think, you know, and it's just, it's a real thing at the minute. It's a yeah. real trend, not just for kids, but adults, and it just gives you that fun. Well, they are a traditional shape bead as well, aren't they? They're used a lot in Native American jewellery originally. They are. Um, so, yeah, but polymer, obviously, the polymer clay, very comfortable to wear. Um, light. You could, yeah, lightweight to wear. Mm. So if you struggle with certain precious metals uh, against the skin or base metals against yep. the skin, um, then you won't struggle with these, I shouldn't imagine. But you get literally masses in there as well. And colours for every single occasion. You can have fun mixing them up. You know, they're just really beautiful. You've got little, what, centimetre, to sections on those yeah. so pretty and i think you know you very rarely get a strand or a, a box of beads where you get sort of four different tones of blue four different tones of green four different tones of gray and if you take 10 of them say and mix up the tones yeah. of, of your color um block so say you're mixing up like so if i show you um my pearl one i've used all of the blues but I also put sort of a teal green in there yeah and I just put them all together so that 
you're, you can just add that kind of moment of colour, all from the same colour family. And it just, I don't know, it's just fun. Yeah, it is. Beautiful. Loving those. Um, okay, don't forget, you get your project instructions with this purchase as well upon dispatch of your order. Any questions? We are live if you're watching at what time is it? 25 to 10 in the morning. Um, do text in. We'd love to hear from you. Debs, so what are you going to show us? A little crochet. Oh, lovely. Uh, you know what made me think? I was going to demo the uh, memory wire bracelet. And then I remembered that we had upsells of this cord. Now, I have to be honest, I'm not a great cord lover. I'm not, I don't I get cord and I'm like, okay, this cord's epic. It's lovely, isn't it? And the way it crochets up, because I'm a big crocheter, my daughter wears a lot of the chokers and the bracelets that are just cord, but they're common, like a spider's web. Kind yeah. Of. Do, do you know what I mean? I know what you mean, yeah, they're um, very fine. And it made me think about making this choker, um, and of course you can incorporate your Heshi beads in there, but this is how beautifully that crochets up. And it's ombre, so the colours of the cord change, and it's a really lovely kind of um, malleable cord. So yeah. I'm really impressed with this cord, and for me to be impressed with cords, pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm going to show you how to crochet the bracelet, and also you can move because of the shape of the heshies, they can move one or the other, like those cushions. So um, it's this bracelet. Oh, I love that. It's like kind of like a fidget bracelet. Like a fidget, but I know I've messed it up now because I've been fiddling with it. But if they all lie down flat, then they'll go like that the cushions and the, and the sequin. They kind of act like the sequins do when you move them one way or the other. Mm -hmm. Okie dokie. So all you need for this is some cord. And this is a great cord. Um, as I say, I'm really quite impressed with this. And some of your beads. And you need a crochet hook. I've got a larger one here. I think this is about a size. It's a five. Um, the difference in the crochet hooks are just the larger the hook, the bigger the stitch. So it doesn't really matter uh, with this sort of jewellery. Okay. Um, use a hook that you're comfortable with. And that's all you need. And so if you're going to just tie this as your closure, then you don't need anything else. If you could do um, for your closure macrame knots, square knots over the top and have a slider. Or you could even just knot this onto a lobster clasp and have you know have it that way so there's loads of um, different ways you can close it and I've put a selection of those in your instructions just some ideas for you so probably the most time-consuming thing to do with any crochet involving beads is getting your beads on because you do that first so you keep your cord on the roll and then you just put on all of your beads now I suppose depending on your wrist size I use between about 30 and 40 for just a single strand bracelet but you don't only have to use one of these at a time you could use three within the stitch or mm. two it's up to you I'm going to use one today um, now what I would suggest and actually again this is pretty good but if you want to do it quicker just let me get into frame a little more you can pop on the end some clear nail varnish a dab of glue or if you've got a thread zapper just run the thread zapper over it and it just makes this edge a little bit more sturdy so a bit more needle like so that you can get through those beads quicker it's better to have um, too many beads and too few because you can always just take them off at the end and reuse them um, so yeah so pop your beads on keep it attached to the reel and then we're going to do a um, slider knot onto your hook. Now, there's various ways of doing this. This is the way I do it. And this is the way I think is easy to show you on camera. So if you do, just let me get enough thread. If you do a circle like that, and then you take your tail underneath your circle, so it's like a peace sign, and then you reach in there with your hook and pull it through. I mean, that was a very big version of it that's a slider knot and the reason that's called a slider knot is because as you pull it it will pull up and down now the main trouble that beginner crocheters have and I think you'd agree with me if you crochet is they make this knot so tight to the hook mm. that when it comes to pulling something through it you can't get it through you're fighting it so you don't want to be fighting it you want this to be um, loose so Crochet is all about how you hold your thread and this comes with practice and this comes with experience and I can tell you one way and then you won't be able to get on with it and you'll eventually find a different way. So all I can do is tell you how I do it and it, sometimes this will depend on the cord. If I'm doing it with wool I'll do it a different way if the cord's more slippery but I generally do something like this. I take it around my little finger, across my palm and then over my pointer finger. So it 
I'm like this. And what you're aiming for is to get tension in this part, um, because if this part's all saggy, it's very difficult to crochet. Um, so again, I need to do that quicker. because I'm. And what I tend to do when I start as well is I hold this end of the tail just so that I've got more control. Now, what we're basically going to do is just one stitch, a chain stitch. Some will have beads in and some won't. So I'm going to start off by showing you a chain stitch. I'll do a couple. So all a chain stitch is, is yarn over, which is bringing your cord across your hook towards you. Taking that cord with the end of your hook and pulling it through. I'm going to do that again. And then as you get down, you don't have to hold this. So you yarn over, bringing that cord towards me. I'm turning my hook slightly so that I'm grabbing that cord and I'm pulling it through the loop. And if I go quick, you can see that this builds up what we call a chain stitch. And I'm going to put that down on my mat. So it's very easy to have a practice with your chain stitch because you can very easily go like that it all pulls out and you can start again from the beginning okay so I'm going to do that slip knot again so I'm making a circle I would usually pick it up and do it bringing the tail underneath into your little piece sign putting my hook in pulling it through there's lots of different ways of doing um, a slip knot on online so I'm just going to do two basic chain stitches to start off with with nothing in them so one and two and then the whole rest of whether it be a bracelet or a necklace um, will be with beads. So all we have to do then is bring some beads up and however many is manageable at one time. You can hold them in your hand, you can keep them on your mat and just keep taking your, your hand out of the um, position completely up to you. But what you're going to do is take that bead and drop it down to your last stitch to your hook. So this is quite a big stitch just so that you can see what I'm doing. So I'm taking that bead and I've dropped it down to my hook and I'm just going to do the same thing again. I'm going to yarn over and pull through and what that does it holds the bead inside your chain stitch. So once again I'm doing this really slowly, I'm used to doing it quick. So you're going to take the next bead, drop it down to your hook and do exactly the same thing again. So you just yarn over, grab that and pull it through and it starts to grow. And you can do this with monofilament and your chips, those lovely soda light chips, if you got those early, you could do those. Mm. And it makes that kind of floaty kind of um, gemstone chip necklace. Now I've put two down now, just to show you that you can do that. There's loads of different ways of doing this. And you just keep going and keep going and keep going. And what you'll end up with is a lot, and I've tied this onto the, um, you'll end up with a really long section of crocheted little nice. hashi beads. Now if you wanted to make that really 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 long and you've seen me do this before with the lucite flowers you can then cut, take it into twos or fours and make a necklace or a double strand bracelet. Yeah. So once you've learned that technique there's so much you can do. Oh high and boho I like that analogy. Ollie just said it's like high and boho. I'm very boho as a person anyway so it is my taste. But I think what you can do with these, just like those sequin cushions, is pull them one way or pull them another way. And I found that really satisfying because <laughs> um, you can fiddle with them. So that's all there is to it. But I've put all of the tips and hints and tricks into the instructions that I've written and anything else that, that I've used. But all the only other thing I've used for this is um, glue and a crochet hook. That's it. And, and you, you can, can make masses. Absolutely loads. I mean, you know, for, for that bracelet, I used a tiny bit of the cord. And uh -huh. what I love about this cord is the ombre effect that you get. Yeah. So if you wanted to just crochet like the necklace, um, you're going to get that ombre effect because as you work down the cord, it changes colour. And I really like that. It's amazing, isn't it? Now, well, do you, you know that it, this was a, a Mark launch. Oh, right. No. Yeah. I bet he did amazing things with it, didn't well, he? Well, um, both here we have i think we've got this bundle haven't we so you can actually shop ahead on that so do you get all of these colors together or is it two and you get do you get you all, get of, them all of them yeah you, you get see, all i love the colors of them they're, they're very 
They're colours I think that I would use. Like sometimes the cores come, I think I don't really like that. But I love all of these colours. Yeah, and, and if you macrame with these, it literally creates that ombre. Yes. Naturally. Absolutely. So you can macrame, you can kumahimo. You could even do it without any beads because the cord is that nice. That's, um, I was going to say, can we just show that? That's so beautiful. So I did Dex. a choker just because it reminded me of what Daisy wears all the time. And then she'll wear longer necklaces as well. Um, that's what that's how it um, and if I move it round then you can see that the ombre effect of the different greens isn't it nice oh that's so lovely now what I've done there is a chain stitch and then a single crochet okay. um, so any of your kind of knotting techniques crochet techniques works really well with this cord and you get loads of them as well so they're one millimeter is it is it ten meters on each spool I want to say masses 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 but we're at ten pounds per spool. Okay. How much? How much? <laughs> yes, please. Did he say what I think? Yeah, he, just he said. went from. Yeah, he did. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's go five pound per spool. Tassels, knotting, kumihimo, macrame, crochet. Yeah. Uh, you can put two colours together. So imagine. Um, oh. Imagine kumihimoing the pink and the green together. Oh yeah, lovely. Or the pink and the um, oh, actually, I can't decide. That's why you want all of them, but because you can pink do and like purple. you can do eight strands, can't you, in kumihimo? Yeah. So you could actually use all of those together if yeah. you wanted to. The blue and green would be lovely. That would the be pink nice. and the purple. You know how you can just play with colour. Tassels. You can make um, uh, cord tassels. Do you know, even if we were stopping here, Deb's at nineteen ninety nine. I think that's absolutely amazing. Can you, don't you? Can you tell I like this cord? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, and, yeah. And that, uh, that's amazing because you. I like the fact you've been really honest and said, "Look, I wasn't normally a core cool person. However, I'm loving this." As the designers, we have our thing, don't we? And of I think you we do. all know, like Susie's her amazing pearls and her. Susie loves her high end gemstones. Um, that's what I think about. And Susie, when I think about Mark, I think how amazing he is with his seed beads and his cord. Yeah. Um, me, I think, I don't know, what, what, what am I into? But I'm into, I suppose, my pearls and my boho designs. And Definitely. I'm a bit of a mixed media artist. Cord, metal not so much. Work as metal well. work. Metal work. But this cord really impressed me. Yeah, amazing. Absolutely amazing. At $19.99, they're already flying. So you get all four of them. That's £5 each, but not today. Not today. We've got 60. How about? You get loads. I made it. I had loads left. Two pound per spool. I don't, I don't think you can go wrong with that. I just don't. Even if you make... One of those at 7 99 I just think that's so good. If you put one gemstone on there, on one strand, like we saw on the on the A-listers, and tie it. Yeah. I mean, how many of those would you it, get? Exactly. What's that? You, you know, uh, genuinely, I think what back in the day, you know, we were harping on about back in the day prices on your spacer beads. Back in the one day, one of those spools would have been about that price. Yes, it would. I'm, one of them. But it's very not. I mean, it's it's so nice to work with. I'm just sitting crocheting with it here, and I am a crochet. I do love crochet. Um, I was just impressed on how you know. I mean, I did. I think uh, one to four rows on this. If you did two, you could just have a thin bracelet without any gemstones or anything on yeah. it. Yeah, you know, the cords that nice. Yeah, amazing, absolutely amazing. We've got some messages coming through to the studio. Um, hello to Julie and Wirral. Nice to hear from Hi. you today. Said I love these new uh, these new shapes. Um, uh, eight have loads of various round space beads. Oh, you're talking about the early bird. Um, but these um, are a must. Happy birthday to me. Oh, happy birthday, oh, happy darling. Birthday. Happy birthday. Ah, oh, amazing. Yeah, they are amazing new shapes. Hello, Patsy saying, Debbie, uh, my late father called my jewellery making, especially chain mail, mini engineering. Oh. There you go. That's I true. think it is actually. You know, I like to think I've been in this industry a long time. The one thing I don't do is chain mail. I've never attempted I it. I can't do it. I think it. you're I very, very clever. I can't do it. Um, Margot's saying, I think the Heshi bracelets enhance the silver bangles. Uh, love Debbie's work. Oh, thank you, um, Margot. She's also lovely and supportive, Margot. Thank you. Yeah, bless you. Uh, Christine, you're saying, uh, I'd wear all the rainbows together in a bracelet <gasps> with spacers. Yes, all the rainbows. Oh, I just think, look, just this morning as an example, when we were all prior to coming live, I looked at those little rainbows, I was like, oh, and then of course it started a whole conversation about rainbow. 
um, the actual Zippy program. Zippy and all of, yeah. Yeah, and Zippy and Bungle and George. And it was just, everybody was smiling. And that's what jewellery should be about, shouldn't it? Um, okay, now we do have... You can get your personality yeah, love on it. there. And I love that. Okay, so out of the three, Bungle, Zippy and George, which one are you? George. <laughs> Hello, everybody. <laughs> Oh, amazing. Uh, Dan brought in two tea bars of happiness just now. And oh, look at this. Tea bars of happiness there. These, right, I've got three bundles. Heshi bundles. Oh, We've got like your warms. Mm -hmm. You've got your pinks. And you've got your bluey greens. Oh, I love there them. There is two, four, six, eight, ten. Ten cans. These are epic. so soft. Oh, I like that orange. They remind me of the shell jewellery you get on holiday. Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know those like ankle chains? Like and... carry shells or something yeah. like that. That would be nice, wouldn't it? I want to make anklets out of these. Definitely. I think it would be lovely I mean, anklets. you could go in the sea, couldn't you? And you wouldn't be worrying. No. What? That's a pound per strand, and they are long strands as well. 38 centimetres. They go from, like, your deep crimson reds to, like, sort of, I don't know like tan colours yep, almost yep. to your lemon to your vibrant oranges to your cyan red I love them I love how many have we got we got big quantity but they are flying I love how they're complementary yeah so you've got that complementary colour wheel in each bundle which is just amazing oh, oh look at this one yeah this is good I'm just going to slide the tea bar over right let's bring you the oh. Let's, <laughs> let's bring you your bluey greens. Oh, I love they're so oh. Oh, like holiday. Zesty, 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 zesty. Pack of ten, you get all of these. Look at that from there. Amazing. It's giving me holiday vibes. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. You've got look like corn flower blue. I love that one, that these tealy ones. The tealy oh, one. The tealy yeah, ones. the tealy one's nice. And the nice. dark tealy one as well. And that one, look at that colour. Oh, look at that colour. That's, what's that, like a min minty min turquoise? Again, look, it's all like Oh, look at that colour. You could. Oh, I'm those. loving this colour palette. Please tell me there's quantity, Roscoe. Just less than 50, but they're on the verge of selling out already. I'm not surprised. Oh, I'm loving that palette. Now, the last one is the pinks and the purples are just stunning. Oh. Stunning stuff. And look, think how different each of your jewellery is going to be with these, uh, just the change of colour. Oh. I'd get all of them because Amazing. I love mixing the colours. You know, if you put pink and orange together or orange and turquoise, it really pops. Yeah, it does. I love the lilacs in this yeah, one. Yeah, lovely. Purples are stunning, aren't they? Oh, I love this one. Look at that one there. That's pretty, isn't it? That's like You've a wisteria got, colour. This goes oh, really white. well with the pur purples and the pinks in the box yes. as well. And the rainbows. Yeah. You've got white in there. You've got deep sort of uh, amethyst colours, pastel pinks. You've got like a dark. Oh, these are gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Ten strands, but absolutely flying out the door. You know the price tag. So Ten good. strands of your beautiful Heshies. And they're soft. They're really soft and comfortable to wear as well. Such fun. Yeah, loving that. Lightweight. Not everybody likes heavy beads or necklaces. You know, ultimately, when you make jewellery, yeah, visually it's got a, you know, you want it to look amazing, but you also need it to be comfortable, otherwise uh, you don't wear it, do you? No, no. Uh, or it comes straight off when you get home. And also, you know, someone said to me the other day, do you get sick of ma making jewellery? And I went, no. And I thought about it, and I thought, I don't, you know, because... It's so different. And what I get to, uh, what I'm honoured to do is for a living is work with things like this one minute, yeah. black diamonds the next. Yeah. So, you know, Jade so eye, there's pearl. a place for everything. Yeah. And it's all different and it's all fun. Yeah, I agree. I, I agree. It, it, it is a passion. You can tell this is your passion. Though. Can you? Yeah, I just, absolutely. I love it. And I just, things like this, you know, it, it, it helps me to think about different colourways I might yeah. want to use in my work. And it's fun. Um, and, you know, prices like that, everyone can have a go, can't they? Well, my dad always said to me, if you find a job that, um, that, in, uh, that incorporates things that you're passionate about yeah. and that you love, you'll never work a day in your life. And that's so true. Oh, that gave me goosebumps. It's so true, though, isn't it? It it's is so, so true. true. Um, now, coming up in about eight minutes, um, speaking about things that we love. Oh, my goodness. These look like the most perfect pearls ever. 
they, they, they really are. I spoke to my husband about them last night and I was like, darling, please make sure you're watching at 10 o'clock because the pills are incredible. His exact response was, Elle, do you need any more pills? <laughs> of course. It's a fair question. <laughs> it is a fair question. And I was like, yes. And I told him then about what's going on in the yeah. pill uh, market. And he was like, okay, so, okay, buy more then. That's what, that's his exact response, buy well, yeah, more then. Yeah, because no brainer yeah an absolute no brainer these like you said Debs are perfect they're oh, naturally gosh. coloured you know we talk about four C's with the diamonds don't they we talk about carrot weight we talk about cut clarity and colour when we're talking yeah. about your diamonds your sapphires your rubies and your emeralds when we talk about pearls it's five virtues so we talk about the size we talk about the shape we talk about the colour i.e. are they natural or they dyed um, we talk about the nacre how thick that precious material that forms your pearl is and the, the, the fifth is the most important in my opinion it's the luster because you can have a massive pearl you can have a beautifully shaped True. pearl you can have a lovely natural coloured pearl with thick nacre but if it doesn't have luster it's just meh you know what I mean? These have These got these luster are mirror -like. yeah. Yeah. Oh, That's what's making them stand out to me yeah. is the luster but and I know I'm sort of wittering on ahead of this now but um, we can't physically buy them now at the price no. with everything that's gone on over the past couple of months really it started the, the wheels started changing through covid of course because you know they couldn't get out to harvest no. the pills they couldn't look after the mollusks they could can nurture them so they were literally harvests were lost to the sea and that will have stunted the supply by considerable considerable time um but so there's that but then we didn't predict the 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 huge surge, the global surge in popularity, in particular by the Chinese market. Um, I'll talk some more about this because I've got carried away with this conversation. I was only <laughs> meant to just sort of show it to you. Um, but you can tell I'm really passionate about pearls. And again, I have always said here at Jewelry Maker, pearls have been one of our greatest strengths. Okay. However, now more those more so than ever, we can't bring you your ten pounds strands of pearls anymore. We can't do it. We cannot do it. There's just nothing available. Um, so those days, unfortunately, are behind us. You never know. It might change in the future. But high-end pearls like this, the fact we're bringing them to you at an, at an affordable price tag is amazing. And genuinely, if it was three times, four times the price that we bring these to air, I know what they're going to, obviously. If it was four times that price, it's still unbelievable. So what amazes me... Okay, what amazes me is that the reality is what we take this to, if it was 10 times that price, it'd still be less than trade and wholesale. Really, they currently. are so beautiful. They really are. Jewelry makers, if you are a pearl fanatic like Debs, like myself, like oh, the majority of the world, it seems, at the moment, then do not go anywhere because they are coming up in four minutes. Um, we have 104. Ooh, that's a good quantity, it is, isn't it? It's wow, an amazing, it's an irreplaceable quantity. Now, if you are waiting for those beautiful sort of flower comb beads that I showed you earlier on, um, we're putting those in the 12 o'clock hour because they go so perfectly with Yay, your project. I want those, I want to buy those. What's are they on pre-order? Oh, good. <laughs> They're on pre-order right now. Um, here they are. They are brand new. Oh, and they've got the hole at the top there. So we've got them in yellow, rose, and white. But we've we've pushed them back because they will go amazingly with Deb's uh, um, masterclass project. However, they are available on pre-order right now. Okay. So these pearls, unmissable. It's a quantity that we can't replace anymore the reality is this would be like a fourth of may opportunity dealer day opportunity right. birthday that's our birthday by the way jewelry makers so that's that is how excited i am about this auction opportunity and i've said to my husband you make sure you're watching you make sure you're watching <laughs> to get hold of these good luck these are also available shop ahead they are going lower um have they already gone? What, the flowers? I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised We've needed at all. these for ages. You haven't put the pearls on pre-order, have you? No, they're not on pre-order yet. But they're coming up immediately after the break. So do what you need to do Ooh. in the next couple of minutes and make sure you're back after this very short break for the most divine pearls you could ever possibly wish to own.
never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewelry Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click on the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewelry Maker. Shopping with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website, from your jewellery room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewellery Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewellery Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewellery Maker. Here at Jewelry Maker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard PMP is $3.95. Charges may differ outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option of $5.95. Shopping made easy on Jewelry Maker. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewellery making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8am until 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there, you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Jewelry Maker gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says gift cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email. Then decide the value you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion or just a way to say thank you, the Jewelry Maker gift card is the perfect answer. Welcome back everybody. Again, here's a little shopping channel in the middle of the UK that started quite literally in a cupboard. I'm not even joking. Jewelry Maker 14 years ago, best part of, started in a cupboard and it was on the internet. And then it grew in terms of its popularity and 
then of course we went to places like Sky and, and Freeview and our audience grew and grew and grew. Fast forward and now we have high-end jewellers who source their gemstones, their pearls from us, from all over the world, from Hatton Garden to San Francisco to New York, all over the world. And these Jewelers, remember, you know, I've worked in a high-end jewelers. They have suppliers literally walking through their door on a weekly basis. And they do literally wheel them in, by the way. Um, all obviously want, they're, you know, they've got to make a profit, haven't they? They're in business, they need to make a living, I understand that. But all of these suppliers who could go to the same places that we do, could go to places like Hong Kong, Tucson, and probably do, to be honest, some of them anyway, still will not be able to acquire them there and then at those wholesale trade fairs at the price that you are about to get the opportunity for. And I know that that is hard to actually fathom and comprehend. I had to explain it to my husband last night and I was like, come on, you know this, you know how we buy and how we, it's different to any other jewelers out there. So he's like, well, okay, well, why don't you go to Hong Kong and sell them? Well, we could, but then we're not going to have much of a shopping channel, are we? If we did it that way. And, and by the way, they did that uh, um, at Tucson, just gone. They took some of our jade. They took some other gemstones that we have. Our sister channel, Gem Collector as well, took loose stones. And they sold those at trade value. And made, they did really well. They did very, very, very well. But we wouldn't do that. That, is, that goes against the complete ethos of how... Not just jewellery maker, um, it's how Gemporia works as well. Because Steve started this whole company, Steve's our founder, Steve Bennett, by not thinking, okay, I'm going to purchase something, I'm going to times it by 400% and add VAT. That's what most jewellers do. His, his whole ethos, his idea was, I'm going to buy big quantities and I'm going to work off small margins. So it makes the highest end gemstones accessible and affordable to you all. Now, the reality is here, jewelry makers, that with pearls, nobody could foresee what is happening. Nobody. You know, we kind of understand the fact that the pearl harvests the pearl market was going to change in the midst of COVID. We, that's understandable, isn't it? Any gemstone that needs nurturing, harvesting, caring for, when you can't get those farmers actually out to those mollusks to chip the barnacles off, to pivot them, etc., etc., they got lost to the sea. So we kind of predicted that, and it has impacted what they said is pro approximately between five and 10 years of the pearl supply. But what we couldn't foresee is the fact that one Chinese influencer, the power of social media, eh? One Chinese influencer, and China is very different to our social media. We're like a drop in the ocean in comparison to them. They do loads on social media. They, 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 they don't have shopping channels, it's all on social media. So um, anyway, so one Chinese influencer, a celebrity ultimately called Nini, was just photographed wearing pearls, Tahitian pearls to be exact. Next thing we know, a week or so later, the future decade of Tahitian pearls are literally purchased by one anonymous purchaser. So now we can't get Tahitian pearls. Here she is, There's that. that's the very photograph. The power of influence, how Nini shook the Tahitian pearl market. That very photo. Let's read it. Who knew, who knew that social media would make such a big difference? Last week, the Tahitian pearl market in Hong Kong experienced an unprecedented surge, and it's all thanks to a single individual. The renowned Chinese actress and influencer Nini, experts who have been in the pearl buying industry over two decades were astonished. This has never happened before. 
Nini celebrated her outstanding performance in 2011 film uh, Flower of War, recently embarked on a unique pearl-wearing social media campaign while advertising her latest film, uh, Lost in the Stars. Being a pearl uh, aficionado, she marked the movie's immense success, a staggering box office collection of, is that three billion? By sharing 30 selfies with a particular focus on Tahitian pearls. Following this showcase, the industry eagerly awaited the September Robert Wan auction. That's quite legendary, by the way. A key highlight at the Asian World Expo, both buyers and vendors had it marked on their calendars with many in international buyers flying in exclusively for this auction. But fast forward, as we speak right now, our team are over in Hong Kong. Fast forward, just a few months, it's not a big difference in time. Now we have a Hong Kong fair where most buyers, ourselves included, Gemporia, where we buy the bulk of our pearls and we would buy literally, we'd spend millions on pearls. Across the whole partnership, we would spend millions for you guys and we'd stagger it out. We would, we would uh, uh, schedule it for, throughout the course of the year or future years, whichever it might be. Anyway, so if we hear, you can go to Hong Kong, but you ain't gonna buy any pearls. What do you mean we're not gonna buy pearls? That's predominantly why we go for. Well, because they're already purchased. Those, those, those transactions, if you like, have been discussed even prior to the event. Go back to Tucson when um, I was there, 2021, and it's really sad to say I saw this repeatedly. Because you've got to remember, those stands would have been purchased a year or so prior. You have to book your place and they're expensive as well. They're thousands of pounds. But they didn't have the pearls. They didn't have the pearls to actually take them uh, to, to Tucson. Now, this was a photograph that myself and Dave took in 2021. The wholesale, and that's really important, not retail, wholesale price three years ago, almost around, yeah, not far off. It was almost to the, to the date. Naturally purple freshwater pearls at wholesale. And I remember saying to Dave, like nudging him going, that's not a bad price. That was $1,250 for those natural pearls wholesale. So to work out the retail, it's times that by four plus VAT. <sighs> yeah? But actually that's not a bad price no. for pearls. Three years ago. That very same strand, if you were lucky enough to see it now, if you were lucky enough to see it, it would be probably, I don't know, 10, 12 times that price tag. pre pearl mania, which is what the world's calling it, Yoko of London was showing this amazing natural freshwater, freshwater, not salt water, freshwater pearl necklace in 18 karat rose gold. Now, the rose, we're not running out of rose gold. We've got a constant supply of gold, we have. That necklace, which is stunning, pre pearl mania was 22 and a half thousand pounds <gasps> there it is poa you have to phone up to ask if it says poa i can't afford it i know that straight away but who knows what that is now because you've got to remember most retailers we're not most most retailers will say well how much is it going to cost me to remake that piece of jewelry is it going to cost me 22 and a half thousand pounds no it's probably going to cost you more um, what about a matching pair of earrings? Just two natural pink pearls. Oh, you've got some lovely sapphires. They're not running out of sapphires. You've got some beautiful diamonds. We're not running out of diamonds. Eight thousand pounds. Pre-pearl mania. So what would they be now? And that's two pearls. They're beautiful, don't get me wrong. They're naturally pink like yours. They're beautifully lustrous like yours. Remember, we discussed those five virtues. But... You know, it's always, it's all, I think it's so important. And this is why I said to my husband last night, we don't say how much can we get. We could, but that's not how we've done business. We think, we purchased these, and Georgia mentioned it, didn't she, on Thursday. These would have been bought 
a year, maybe two years previously. Mm. Like I said, when we buy pearls at Hong Kong, we will spend millions of them and we will s schedule them out. We don't know what's going to happen in between then and now. Um, and it's my job, if you like, to update you on that news. Little did we know when we purchased these that it was going to change so dramatically. So again, if we were to go, oh, well, this has happened, so we've got to, I don't know, quadruple that price tag, if not more, we don't do that. You are getting pearls at a price pre-pearl mania. The JCK, which is an industry authority, um, they have the AGTA awards, which again, Georgia spoke about on uh, Thursday. And the JCK is the other. They're the two big shows, by the way, in, uh, in Tucson and also in uh, um, Las Vegas. They say, you may want to adopt this well-worn um, phase as the theme of the up and coming gem and jewelry show in Arizona. Uh, given that it implies to all gemstones, but especially two pearls. It's the first time, really, to my knowledge, anyway, that they have singled out pearls above other gemstones. Wow. Um, a Stuart Robertson, vice president of Gem World International, recently told JCK, when it comes to the organic gems, you can anticipate a shortage of finer material developing until probably 2025 because two harvest seasons, not just harvest, two harvest seasons um, were uh, partially compromised because of COVID. There's your first price surge. Robertson's advice for buyers, keep your eyes peeled for fine quality goods and don't hesitate to place orders. Um, to help you prepare, we've highlighted, oh, okay, they're just talking about where you can go and buy your high-end pearls. Don't hesitate is the key. Bernard, you know Bernard, he deals with fine pearls and high-end jade. He's talking about, in particular, your lavender colors, your, your, your naturally colored pearls. I think that should be literally as a, sort of an umbrella. And Bernard says lavender pearls were already very expensive due to the problems with COVID. But since Hong Kong, this is last Hong Kong, by the way, the prices have gone crazy. It's the same with Tahitians. Again, this is pre-Nini. Does that make sense? Tahitians have disappeared. And the only pearl that comes close to having that aubergine color is the fancy purple harvest that have come from um, just a handful. These are hybrid pearls, so only a couple of pearl uh, farms can actually produce your purples and your pinks. Tahitians, I honestly don't think we could produce another collection for you. This is Bernard talking about his offerings. That's a really good point. We said, and I didn't fully understand at the time, Charlie Barron is not returning to our screens anytime soon. Not just here at Jewelry Maker or Gemporia. So we've got a big photograph of Charlie in what we call like the, 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 the wall of fame. We've got like your uh, um, Glenn Lehrer, we've got Charlie, we've got Yanni, we've got Steve, we've got Jay, we've got, oh, we've got, the, got all the gents there with their amazing gemstone uh, collections. Charlie's in amongst them, but we might as well, no, no disrespect, Charlie, we might as well take that down, temporarily anyway, because he can't join us on the screens. He, uh, as a sixth generational farmer, he actually would be better off buying them into this, yeah. He's a sixth generational farmer. My husband's words when I said that was, well, that's really sad, six generations, and he's ha having to diversify. So yeah, that's the reality of it now. So he's now selling diamonds. Emeralds, sapphires, really? rubies, not pearls. Mm. Go on his Facebook, his Instagram. It's not pearls, it's other gemstones. Bernard went on to say, we had to pull the production of the plan strand. The price went too crazy for the factory uh, and the factory had quadrupled the price even after he agreed this collection. So they, they kind of gazumped him. Does that make sense? Yeah. Um, anything that has natural color in a purple tone is thousands and whole harvests have been snapped up for future years. For lavender pearls, we can only offer dyed moving forward, um, which is the standard in the West. Okay, so they're, what they're basically saying there, what Bernard's saying, um, is saying, look, we're keeping all the natural here in China. You're not having it. You're not having it. We can buy, we can offer you dyed. That's basically, basically it. Not, not here. China can have the natural. You've got to remember that uh, there's a lot of pearls harvested in China, yeah. but they're not going to export it. They're not exporting it. They're keeping it. They're going to keep the finest quality. And also, they've got a, uh, they've got 
a third of the world's population with an absolutely insatiable appetite for this gemstone. So they can charge top dollar, effectively. The West can have the dyed variety. So thank goodness that we are now, that we bought the millions of pounds worth of pearls two, three years ago. Mm. Because had we not have done that, today's deal of the day wouldn't be happening. We have an amazing 104. We haven't gone, Bernard said this, Charlie's doing that, China's doing this, the world is going crazy for pearls. I tell you what we're going to do, we're going to up our price. We're not doing that. We could. And he, Char Bernard spoke about quadruple, that was pre-Nini. What do you reckon that, that would be now? Look at the photograph on your screens right now. That's basically this strand in a photograph. You've got your purples, you've got your almost bluish tones, you've got your pinks, you've got your pure whites, you have your duskies and your golds, all in one natural strand. Because I need to point out, you know what Bernard said? You can have the dyed variety. These are not dyed. These are not treated. These are totally natural. They have the finest luster. And we have an amazing 104. That quantity is unfathomable, to be honest. That's why, jewelry makers, I spoke to my own husband last night and said, you make sure you're watching at 10 o'clock, because otherwise I'm gonna miss out on the deal of the day. There is a, and his words exactly to me after I explained all that to him was, oh, well, why aren't, you not, why aren't you buying more? And I was like, I'm trying, <laughs> I am trying, but they sell out, I, like yesterday, it sold out. I will buy pearls, not only because they're, they're you know, the price and, you know, I'm not that, it's not just about making money ultimately and buying something that's, that's valuable. It's not just about that. Look how beautiful they are. Oh, I love them. I love them. Look at how beautiful they are. The world, you know, new, younger generations, every corner of the world get pearls. Which really, I mean, over centuries and centuries of jewelry where they've always been, you know, that prestige, that luxury, that beauty, but yes. they've never had the desirability of every generation, I don't think. No, they've come into their own because you can put your personality on them. They can be trendy, they can be modern, they can be classic, they can be everything. Men and women are wearing yeah, them exactly. now, which I love. Yeah, I love that too. Now, jewelry makers, in a few moments' time, we're going to oh. make your deal of the day opportunity. Oh, look at these. We're going to make this possible. We're going to open the graphics. The, re the reality is, look, look, you might have pearls. I've got pearls. It's the gemstone I buy the most from, from here, uh, from jewelry maker. I'm never, ever going to regret a single pearl strand purchase that I've bought from jewelry maker because it's not just about how affordably we bring them to you. It's the quality that we bring you. Our team in Hong Kong right now, right now, as we speak, will not come back with pearls like this. And if they do, because Jen has got the budget, they've got the bank balance to do it, but if they do, that means they've got to sell them at that price. Yeah. They, we have to make money, we're a business ultimately, but we can't buy them anywhere near your deal of the day price. I know where they're going to, and I've deliberately kept this secret from Debs because you're going to go crazy about this. <laughs> and when Ross and I discussed today's deal of the day, we were saying, oh, we were saying, sorry, I'm just completely smitten by these. We were saying it could be four, five times the price oh, that yes. they're about to appear. Oh, okay. Wow. And that's jewellery maker. I'm not saying outside these four walls, that would be a fantastic jewellery maker price. So I think we need to start, yeah, let's do it, Ross. Our call center are ready. We will have, just to give you a heads up so it's fair for everyone, we will have jewelers shopping with us. In 30 seconds, your deal of the day is going to open. The only reason this is happening today is because we bought these pearls two years ago. Never mind the price, never mind you know, what they're worth, we can't physically buy them. No. China simply will not export them. They won't export them. So this is quite 
literally irreplaceable. These are natural, they are not dyed, the type that Bernard said. You can have that variety, that's fine. Yeah, we'll export that. That's all good. No, I'm sorry, Bernard, we don't want that. Well, that's not what we're talking about. We're talking about the fine luxury. We want the same grade. We want the stuff that, that you know that has skyrocketed in the price tag world over. But jewelry makers, you will not be paying those dizzy high prices that you're seeing. We're seeing at wholesale. Never mind at retail. Never mind what they are at retail. Honestly, and again, this is something that Ross and I discussed ahead of this Saturday's deal of the day. This is an irreplaceable price tag. Those pearls are just glorious. They really are so. They really, really are so. The, the type of pearls, you're right, that I never imagined I would own. It's not often I ask my husband to do this, because I'll be honest, he's got, the, he's got the kids to look after, he's gonna be busy. But I was like, you make sure you're watching a 10. <laughs> make sure you're watching a 10. <laughs> because I need these pearls need them and I explained and he's totally on board with it as well but you know what all that aside yes okay it's 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 valuable yes I know that I could sell them on at a profit if I wanted to um, but look how breathtaking they are as well that's first and foremost they just they elevate like the minute you put those up to your neckline yeah your whole face just lit, lit up. up and they just Pearls are made to be worn. They are. They? I mean, they, they love your skin. You, they love, you know, and you put them on and I always feel like if I'm having a bad day, I put my pearls on and mm. I just, I feel better. Yeah. It, 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 does that sound silly? No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. And I think, you know, you like, know. look, I just, I know they're amazing. so beautiful. Just, they light up your face, don't they? Yeah. That's the thing. Yeah. Pearls will literally light up your face. But the days of us being able to look, and these, this is not the same. This is not the same thing at all. Here at Jewelry Maker, we used to bring you ten pound strand of pearls, yeah. didn't we, on a regular basis? We can't even buy those, and they were not the same grade. No, Let's, they are no. worlds apart. You know, they weren't natural. They weren't not multicolored necessarily. They weren't this size. They weren't this bright and luster. But you could get pearls. They were pearls. Do you know you can't even buy freshwater pearls now? You, you know, we have to be Edison. They have to be Edison pearls. Tahitian pearls, South Sea pearls, right, they're gone for the next decade wow. because they've been snapped up by a, a, a private collector. So we're not gonna see those. So that means you've gotta look at places like a Koya, which are always already very expensive, or you've gotta look at the next best thing, um, which, well, not next best, as, as amazing, uh, are your Edison pearls. Well, Edison pearls are, are farmed in the same way as your saltwater pearls, and they come at those high prices too. Hello to you, Margot. What's that I can't see? Stop it, I'm supposed to be <laughs> sitting on my hands. They're so classy, they classy really are. Classy is a good word. Me too, we're having our kitchen done, Margot. I've got a lot of things to pay for at the moment and I'm like, I need these pearls. And I won't regret it. I'm gonna show you something, just to highlight what they could be. You know we're not stopping there. Even, but the reality is, even if we were, look, 22 and a half thousand pre-pearl mania. You know, pre-pearl mania. Hi guys, I have so many pearl strands bought from yourselves. I just can't get enough. Kerry, I'm exactly the same. I think you're exactly the same as well. The quality is amazing. We've had valuations shared from customers, you know, knotted on a clasp, you know, and they are high figures. Those valuations, by the way, need revisiting. They do need oh, revisiting yeah, they do, because they would have changed. But at five thousand pounds, genuinely, genuinely. So look at look at that strand twenty twenty one, Ross. That was what twelve hundred and fifty dollars. So that was twenty twenty one times that by four plus that you're talking about the price on your screens but that's pre everything went crazy okay times by four is five grand okay plus 17.5 is that what vat is these days about that so about another thousand pounds so you're talking about six retail but that's 2021 it's not the same that pearl. Would be, oof. yeah that's going to be probably double figures yeah. now um not double figures i beg your pardon five figures 
There are loads of you with it in your basket. I know you're waiting. I know you're waiting for the price. Um, the next price crash, still not your closing price, I need to say, but a huge jump, okay? Not your price, natural. Everything that we've just told you in the pearl market, and you know, not your price. It's opportunities like this which really make, I get, I get why the Financial Times are doing a write-up on Gemporia. One of the jeweler will say, or will, 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 will keep you so in the loop of, of what's happening here and now. We went to Hong Kong, we paid that flight, not me personally, Gemporia, you know, paid that flight, booked that ticket, booked the hotel, it's gonna cost them thousands of pounds yeah, that trip, yeah. not to buy pearls, They've done that trip to solidify and relay messages on gemstones, in particular your pearls and your jade. So even here, that's irreplaceable. We can't buy them there. We cannot. The only option, look at the, look at the quality of this pearl. Any one of them, look at the luster that you're seeing. Natural purple pearls. See those earrings that we showed you earlier on? One, what do you reckon? Two, eight grand, pre pearl mania. Jewelry makers, pearl lovers. I've never seen a change in gemstone dynamic like the, what, the situation that is happening right now with pearls, ever in my 25 years of working in gemstones. Never seen it, never seen it. And the reality is in conversation, I hope you've got someone watching today, Debs. In conversation with Ross pre-show, I was like, 299's amazing for these pearls. They are some of the most mirror-like lustered pearls that you could possibly imagine owning. Yeah, that is incredible. I'd go as far as saying probably one of the best strands we've had. And we've had amazing pearls. Agree. Do you agree? Yeah, because they're just when you hold them up, I was thinking you could be on the red carpet with yeah. them. I mean, you really could. Yeah. Debs, that's not our price. Oh, okay. I've bought a strand of pearls from Jewelry Maker at an, and it was, a, it was a big price tag for me, I don't mind saying that. They were, they were launched on air for 799. That's a lot of money to me. Yeah. A lot of money. However, I do not regret that purchase because they are amazing. The fact that we are at 299 pounds and that's not our closing price. You know, if these had been on air at 7.99, I still would have sat here, friend to friend, pearl lover to a pearl lover, and said, that's a great price. You won't find a price like that elsewhere, no. anywhere in the world. Yeah. Anywhere in the world. We're beyond trade. We're like past tense trade. Past tense. We can't go back in time, you know? And this is the thing, and it's all down to the fact that Gemporia, we've always loved pearls across every single channel, every single channel. So if I, we know we're gonna buy them, we know, you know what quality our customers love. So we do buy big, we buy big. Yes. And then we'll say, okay, so that's for that show, that's for that show, that's for that date, that's for that date. What goes on then behind the scenes, that we don't know, obviously. No. And it, prices might change, that doesn't mean your prices change. Another minute clock, because we are not just about to shave 10, 20% off that price. I have 104 and I can tell you that's not gonna be enough. Half the stock approaching is already confirmed and I have 127 of you with it in your basket, not including the multiples that some of you have in your basket. We are not about to take just a little 10% off that price tag. To be honest, the fact we're going any lower, I think is amazing, amazing. Uh, uh, these are unprecedented, some of the finest pearls that you will find in Place Vendôme, that you would find in, in, in Las Vegas, in Milan, in Rome, in London, in Bond Street. Genuinely, they are of that grade. These are premium, la maison worthy pearls and they are irreplaceable. They were irreplaceable at the 499 price tag, quite frankly, jewelry makers, but at 299, it's ridiculous. You won't believe this. Take a deep breath and get ready to check out your baskets. 
because everybody will pay this final low price tag. Huge congratulations, Whoa. everybody. Genuinely, I mean this. They could have been, I would have been over the moon if I was sat here bringing these to you, <coughs> excuse me, at 799. I'm not sitting here saying that's an affordable price tag. It's not, it's a huge, it's a, it's, it's a large amount of money. Of course it is. Not for what you're getting. Not for what you're getting. Hello, Hazel, who said, hi, I would not have pearls without you. I'll be honest, I did not like them. I bought the papaya pearls from you, had it valued a while ago, and we need the second part of that message. I'm intrigued, Hazel. I am intrigued. Pearls, you know, valuations that you've had maybe done a couple of years ago, I know it costs money, maybe, maybe think about doing moving forward too. Hello, Kerry saying, I knotted a nucleated pearl necklace, uh, it's pearl strand from yourselves, valued at 450 pounds, and that was about four years ago. Oof. Must get them valued again. I would recommend it. I would recommend it because 450 pounds, that's a fantastic price. Over half the stock's gone, 60% natural fat. Multi buyers getting involved. I don't, I, I, I don't, this is frugal and I'm not saying you're gonna do this, but you could buy these jewelry makers and you could sell them on immediately without doing a single thing to them. Yeah, true. You could, mm. you could do that. I, I kind of think of us as wholesalers because of all the middlemen that we cut out. Mm -hmm. You know, and a lot of people don't get that about this business model. They're like, well, why don't you sell it for £799? Because that's not the business model. And because all of those people in between that would usually make money, we don't have any of that. We kind of swim through it, don't no. we? And, 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 and pearl traders, gem traders, want to deal with jewellery, uh, with Gemporia. And let me, and I can't, do you know that really hit home? Years ago, about 10 years ago, when I went to, um, I went to India. Yeah. Um, I went to India and I went to our head office in India. Oh, did you? And it was amazing. And it fully registered with me and in Tucson just, and this is not me massaging their egos, people know who Jake Thompson is. They know who Dave is. Yeah. And they want to do business with them because we buy big. Yes. So that's fantastic for them. They can get all their work done in one purchase. Mm. All their work done in one purchase. Absolutely. It is... And, and the fact that we don't do, I think Tucson just, to, okay, what, a month or so ago, was the first time we've actually gone to a trade show and sold at mm. market value, because mm. we've always done the opposite. 199 pounds, Ross. There is 31 available within oh. the vault. There is so many of you with it in your basket, but jewelry makers, I have been keeping something from you. I do apologise. I think you're going to take that apology. Is that not your price? It was never our closing price. Really? Never our closing price. We need to stagger auctions like this because if we just went straight down to the price tag, we'd melt the phone lines, crash the web, and I would not be popular. Look, we've got less than 30 available. Oh. Expect these to be an on-screen sellout. Can you? Ma I, I haven't seen his name yet. I have been keeping an eye on the call screens for my husband. Um, yeah, I, I trust him. I do trust him. Look, we have 30 available, 30 available opportunities. We are not stopping at 199 pounds. These are impeccable quality. The luster is absolutely amazing. But what I really, really, really need, you know the five virtues, don't you? Size, shape, color, nacre, and then luster, okay? It ticks every single one of those. This, uh, this, is indicating the fact that that was never your deal of the day price tag jewelry makers i know i'm sneaky like that <laughs> um but this was why we were completely flabbergasted by the amazing price not four thousand nine hundred and ninety nine pounds not nine hundred and ninety nine pounds not four hundred and ninety nine pounds not even two nine nine or one nine nine today and this is your final price crash we are genuinely bringing you the finest quality pearls at probably five, six years ago prices. 251 of you have this in your baskets and I have 22 oh, left. Oh, grief. 22 of them left. 
massive congratulations. The pearls are truly exceptional, truly exceptional, and they are irreplaceable. Just keep that word in your mind. Not just, I'm not saying pearls, they're not mined out. This is the thing, certain gemstones get mined out, don't they? They do. Um, pearls are still being harvested, they just won't export them. Mm. China's like, no, you can have the dyed variety, that's okay. No thanks, Bernard, we want the, we want the, we want the, the natural quality, the heirloom quality. Thanks for the offer. This is how many we have left. Oh, good grief. Yeah, you need to be really quick on this right now. You are not getting the dyed variety that the Chinese will export, but even then they're expensive, by the way. Even then they are expensive. Really? It is irreplaceable at many of those prices that we sort of crashed through. Irreplaceable. Um, Hazel, we've got the second part of your message now, sorry. It only holds so many words. Uh, valued by, I can't read it, so a jeweler friend at five times what I paid for a while ago. I bought her um, for my niece, white gold or gold L, which do you think? What were these? Do you know with these, I think it's entirely up to you because you've yeah. got all the colors. I would always go gold because that's my preference, but I think because, do you know one thing, and this is only my opinion, please don't shout at me for this, it's only my opinion. Pearls now, I would only put with gold. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Um, the days of us actually, nothing wrong with silver, I'm not saying that, but I would, the price that pearls are, I would put them with gold. Hello Elaine, saying thank you, just bought a second strand for my sister so I can keep one for me. Oh Elaine, that's, oh wow. How lovely yeah, is that? that's lovely. How lovely is that? And I love the fact, it's really heartwarming, I think, for all of us here uh, across uh, Jewelry Maker, is that we do make these opportunities possible. Ourselves included, by the way. You know, I haven't got the, the deep pockets that you see shopping in Yoko of London. No. You know, I couldn't afford £8,000 on two pearl earrings. I couldn't afford £22,500, and that's what, a few years ago. But... I can get to 149 and if it wasn't for Jewelry Maker, there's no way I would own the pearls. Or if, if you're thinking 149 no, that's a stretch for me, Al. Okay, how about some 0% interest, £37? £37 today, and you are owning the finest quality. <gasps> They've sold out, sold out massive massive congratulations just take a moment breathe it in the quality of the pills that you have just you have just acquired maurice you just snapped up the final few of the uh, the final one which is amazing um please keep an eye on the website keep an eye on the website wish list it because the reality is, look, folks, those that missed out, and I'm so sorry, that's never something we like uh, um, like seeing. We can foresee it. That's why I was saying 104 is the quantity, that's it. But um, keep an eye on the website, wish list it, and our call centre will call you back. They will call you back if any does do fall, uh, do fall back into um, quantity. And again, can I just say, can we just as well recognise um, the buying team as well? Because I think, you know, it is one of our greatest strengths here. And I don't think we're going to be able to say that pearl buying is going to be our greatest strength. This is not disrespectful. I, do, I mean it with great respect. We're not going to be able to say the same thing the next few years. No. Because we quite literally can't, can't buy them. them. Quite literally. So massive congratulations to you guys at home. Um, amazing. Truly, truly, truly amazing. And I know it gets better from there. When you get those home, take them out the bag, by the way. Pearls like this need to be in something breathable. So maybe put them in like a, a cloth or um, put them in a nice sienna box or yeah. something like that. So um, yeah, they're truly amazing. Absolutely amazing. We've still got so much to bring you. <sighs> Amazing, so beautiful. It's just privileged to, to be able to, to buy those, to be able to work with them, to be able to just keep them and you know, look after them. They're just stunning. Uh, it, I, we've, we've always loved pearls, yeah. haven't we? Yeah. And I like the fact now the world's woken up to it. Me Do you know too. what I mean? Yeah, yeah. They've always been popular, but never like this. Not like this. Never, never, never like this. And, and, and it was like, geography was not my strongest point in school, but 
A third of the world's population in China makes accessing pearls like this nigh on impossible. Yeah, well, you can see, can't yeah. you? Yeah, nigh you look on at impossible. It like that. Amazing. Don't forget as well, you've got these beautiful fluted flowers coming up. We've got them in all three colours as well. So we've got them in um, the rose, the yellow and also the silver. Um, they're flying on pre-order and they are drilled at the top because that's a question that Deb um, was asking. So we've got them in the gold. We've got them in the silver and we've got them in the rose. You could just literally pop those on a head, uh, on a head pin, couldn't you? This, um, we've needed these for so long because they are stunning what I tend to use these for I make flowers so I make stamens I put like an eye pin and then some little oh, three pretty. mil I use them for tassel caps mostly um, so that I can have a lovely waterfall tassel they're beautiful for putting a pearl nestled inside and just having as earrings I use this kind of well I call it a finding it is a finding but it's a beautiful one all the time but we've never had precious metal ones here no before. they've always been base metal i definitely they? want or, these yeah or like a, a, a like a, an acrylic shape we've also got everybody a massive opportunity again for the collectors and we can quite clearly see today we've got um lots of collectors shopping with us so um and i mentioned it oh much like your pearls i've said this loads of times about kotan buy kotan now because it is still the most expensive gemstone on the planet um, every single Kotan offering that we have in the building is here. Oh. Is here. Um, we will bring as much as possible. So I'm sorry, I've got this and I've got some behind, uh, behind the scenes, but we'll bring you as much of the Kotan as we possibly can. Again, this doesn't come as a surprise. We knew that, Co Co we know Kotan's expensive, don't we? It's one of the world's rarest gemstones and it's steeped in history. So the pink rounds, this is brand new by the way, that's never been on air. Cotan Jade, 10,000 years of mining. Beautiful. Amazing, absolutely amazing. That's coming up at 11 o'clock as well. Now, oh my goodness me. Can we go back to Yoko of London, just for a second? And then we'll read Bernard's words, just for a second. There you go, Yoko of London. That was around about 2020, 2021, I think that slide, so it won't be that price. Now, who knows? What about those earrings? Oh, they're beautiful. Natural purple, purple, uh, purple pearl earrings. Should we put the earrings? Oh, there you go. 8,000? Let me just show you that for a second. That's pre-pearl mania. Have you seen these, Ross? Can I, I'm going to try my best. How many have we got of these? Oh my goodness me. I've not seen that before. Oh, hell, we need these. I know. <laughs> I want these too. Oh, earrings are insane. And also for um, just a single pearl. You know, when you wear, I've got a couple of where I just wear my favourite pearl there. Oh, wait, 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 oh. wait. I learned from Charlie, always assess your pearls on a white sheet pe uh, piece of paper. Because oh, really? there's nothing, there's nowhere any flaws can hide if it's literally True. sat on a white piece of paper. Look at how perfect, perfect, I can't speak. I can't speak. Again, I don't know, Ollie, if you can do your thing and put your pearl here alongside the Nova earrings. And we know that those Nova earrings are not eight thousand pounds anymore, don't we? Oh my goodness me! I've got no idea what you're taking these to. This is ten to eleven millimeters in their size. There's nothing near about this. Do you all agree? Our graphics, we will always under promise, over deliver. Look, this is a round pearl. Do we all agree? Yeah. That is a perfectly spherical pearl. There's no, it's not slightly off. It's not slightly squashed. It's not elongated. We'll always, we'll always err on the side of caution with our, with our sizes, descriptions yeah. and sizes. That's a double figure millimeter pearl. 
Pills are so rare and so expensive now. For the first time ever, they're actually selling them in a carat weight mm -hmm. as opposed to a measurement, uh, a millimeter mm -hmm. size. It's half drilled. Five virtues size. Well, I remember asking Charlie, "What's give me a give me a um, a definition like between uh, you know equivalent in sizes of diamonds to like a big pearl?" And he said, "Well, you know, just say South Sea because he used to deal a lot in that South Sea. He's good. A double figure millimeter South Sea pearl is like an equivalent three carat diamond." Oof. Look at this. <laughs> Seriously, yours is actually a better colour. What? It's a stronger colour. Yeah, but... And you've got to remember, that's photoshopped. I was going to say that looks that's photoshopped. That's the absolute best those earrings are ever going to look, aren't they? Yeah. First price crash. But I don't know where these are going to, so I'm, fine. I'm learning with you. I want these. So do I. First? First price crash? Okay, well, that's ridiculous already. 30 seconds we go in again we have did you say 30 available sorry 48 available if you missed out on the previous strand then definitely get involved look you can go to yoko of london in fact i think those earrings are sold out um if they remake them it's how much will they have to buy the pills for are they going to be eight thousand pounds no no definitely not going to be much 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 more london's just multi-bought are you going to be making those perfect earrings they are half drilled as well um i've got collectors wanting multiples fours threes twos nobody's paying 99.99 that's a ridiculous price though ridiculous Oh, <laughs> good grief. 50 pounds, what? Oh my goodness That's me. That's amazing, oh it's so beautiful. It's perfection in a pearl, and I'm so cautious saying the word perfection with pearls. What on earth? Hello, Rosemary and Lester, she's saying, my niece got married in Philadelphia last year, and she borrowed a pair of 12 millimeter Tahitian pearl earrings, $20,000, yeah. Good grief. That's two pearls, two pearls. Um, hello to Janine in Lincolnshire saying my mum buys your beautiful pearls to create heirloom jewellery for my children that will be cherished forever in, in remembrance of her. Bless you Janine, yeah amazing, oh, amazing. And this is the thing, I'm so with your mum Janine on this. I buy amazing gemstones like pearls, like Kotan, here at Jewellery Maker because I know the reality is my girls probably won't be able to afford it. Yeah. You know, J and Pearls are simply the best, top quality. Absolutely, Debbie, totally agree. Uh, Ollie said he bought his mum a, a pearl last year. A fireball pearl, yeah. Her main Christmas present. I bet she loved it. And then you got Vicky one, yeah. You know, you, you know what I mean? It, this is heirloom jewelry. All you need to do is put a peg bale in there and we bring you gold peg bales too. Wow, sorry, sorry. What's this? Oh my goodness me, Dan. You never told me about these, Roscoe. Oh, what a tinker. Oh, are you ready for this? The most amazing fireball pearl, full of luster. I need, this is positively mirror-like. First price crash, 99.99. Wow. Look at the luster on that. Can you see the different color spectrums? Let me see. <gasps> oh. Right, let's count the colors. Purples, pinks, yellow, yellow, gold, gold, green, orange, red, red, green. Did we say green? And Blue? that's literally, it's not a colour change gemstone. What? This is not coated, it's not dyed. That's all down to the nacre. Oh, I love it. That rare, precious material. This is what we call a fireball pearl. It's half drilled, everybody, and they are hugely popular at the moment. We're loving them for the, for me, it always reminds me of like silk draped over a yes. pearl. It's just amazing. Um, those, put that, it's half drilled on a peg bale or on a pair of earrings. I mean, talk about high-end jewellery. We are going even lower, though. How many have we got, Roscoe? 
48. Oh my goodness me. Just gorgeous. Remember folks as well with all of your pearls, especially your high-end pearls, last thing to put on, first thing to take off. Don't spray them with hairspray, don't spray them with uh, perfumes and even let your moisturizer dry in, uh, soak in and everything because pearls, yeah, they're the last thing you put on and the first thing you take off, don't put moisturizer on over your pearls. We're at 49 pounds and 99 pence. Try and keep all those chemicals and things away from your pearls because you want them to constantly have this display of lovely iridescence. They're amazing. I'm, I'm going to be getting some of those. So you can get the round and the fireball for under £100 That today. is amazing. What an hour. What beautiful, beautiful pearls. Do you know, I was in um, a shop yesterday, which will stay nameless, and I saw one of these pearls, and it was on um, a costume jewellery like ring, like gold-plated, mm. um, and it was £39.99, and I thought, oh, that's good. And then when I went up, the pearl was plastic. Yeah. So that was £40 for a plastic pearl on yeah. a base metal ring. It was lovely, but it wasn't real. It was plastic. It was plastic, yeah. And this is... Ten pounds more. It's bigger, and for a, a look at it. Look at the abundance of colours. It's absolutely this gorgeous. This is why we always say luster is the most important thing. Luster, because I could have the most beautiful shape, size, pearl, um, coloured pearl, but if it doesn't have that mirror like yes. luster, you're not seeing the colours no. in that recording. And that pearl is exact same pearl that I'm holding here in the studio. You've got to remember, I've got floodlights above me, and it still looks like this. It still looks like this. Paul's got two, Malik, Cambridgeshire, Helena, Nina, Helena's got two, Nina, Linda, Kent, Christine. And the reality is, jewellery makers, the same conversation that we had with that pearl necklace as your dealer today, we can't buy them at 49 no. 99 we literally can't. It's not necessarily, it's not just the rounds. It's not just, you know, certain shapes that we can't buy or have access to. It's pearls blanket pearls we can't get hold of them at the prices that are on your screens anymore they're simply not being uh, um, offered exported well done to those of you that have it we had 48 of these as well but there's a lot of multi buyers i think some beautiful earrings coming uh coming our way Ooh, please yeah. send photographs into the wall of fame so we can admire your wonderful creations um donna you can do it linda you can do it cumbria's just got three amazing uh tracy you can do it christine mary you can do it if you check out those three swan another swansea's there kent's them uh linda manson's just got two that's the thing 48 can disappear very quickly especially when it's just crying out to be earrings you know you got to think about it that 48 becomes what 24 opportunities Cumbria's making a suite I feel Manchester's making a pair of earrings and Paul and Helena I think or maybe you're thinking about gifting it how amazing that we can gift pearls like this I know you know I I, I never thought I'd be able to afford pearls like this I know they're beautiful yeah amazing 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 now not long until we bring your Cotan selection. That's very close. Um, let's bring you something else which, you know when you don't realize something is rare until you actually learn about it. Yeah. I didn't realize it's rarity until I heard Dave talking about this. So have you heard of the giant clam? Yes. Initially I thought the giant clam was literally something that existed in, in, in like animations. No, they, haven't they got a mock-up of it in that pearl place on the Isle of Wight? A giant clam. It's huge. It's yeah. like that. There's more moulds than there is actually giant clams in museums. When you go to a museum, they do a mould of a giant yeah, clam. Yeah, I don't think this one was real. It no. just It was showing you what a giant clam looked like. Looks like. So, you know, like, if you watch Little Mermaid, when they... When they yeah. That's the giant clam shell. But they exist in depths, the darkest, deepest parts of the ocean. Right. And think about the size, that's why you see so few of them mm. on land. Now, also, because they live to so many years, uh, over time they get covered in barnacles and debris and other life forms, so they become almost camouflaged. 
this is the giant clam yeah, shell. Wow. And you know when he's but prior to this show, and I and it was David was like, yeah, we just can't. We can bring you molds. You could, that's what often is the case. A giant clam shell is probably rarer. Than, well, in fact, Dave said it definitely is. Is rarer than your queen conch. Really? Because a queen conch is like what between 15, 12 and fifteen years, I think. Twelve and fifteen years for a, for a shell wow. basically to exist. These can be like did he say ninety odd years of age or something like that? It you know they can live multiple 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 decades now to get this shell one discovery one cl giant clam commissioned this collection are the pendants the same as well what oh that this is <gasps> giant clam i know really yeah. i've never seen that before nor me like i said i didn't realize its rarity oh, until it's i actually beautiful. saw it it is the purest of all white gemstones <gasps> i've seen wow but it's rarer than queen conch it's rarer than many varieties of pearls i know this isn't a pearl but it is it's rarer than your ripple pearls you know it's rarer than your mellow pearls i've never seen anything like this rarer than mellow pearls and this is all totally natural now i'm going to start with the 10 mil but I wanted to show you that you have the two other sizes. This is single-handedly the only purchase, the only parcel that we will ever be able to bring you in Giant Clam. Because it would be like winning the lottery to source another one. Yeah. To source another one. It's that rare that a Giant Clam, and they refer to it as Pearl, you know, that mellow and also giant clam. It's the it's it's basically another version of itself, effectively. So it's not nacre in the same way as we've just been discussing. It's another version of itself um, internally. So, but look, look at your mellow pearls, which are the kind of orangey ones and the pinky kind of ones. They team giant clam alongside that. But it was really interesting because Dave actually said, what's the rarest out of that collection there? And you think, okay, so pink conch pearls are extremely rare. Uh, mellow pearls, well, surely they're one of the rarest of all. Actually, the giant clam pearl is the rarest of all of them. Wow. You know, it, I think it was Mickey Moto, which if, it, if there's any brand that would, be, would work with, with giant clam, it would be Mickey Moto. I think they've got one piece, haven't they, Roscoe? One piece, one design. There we go. Um, and there's one of each. Mellow pearl. Queen conch, extremely rare, non-nacreous natural pearls. There we go. It's the giant clam that's the main feature, isn't it? The giant clam pearl and a conch pearl, three extremely rare, non-nacreous nat natural pearls. It's amazing. I'm going to bring you the 10 mil. Then I'm going to bring you the six, uh, sorry, eight and four. We're at 499 pounds. The first time that we have seen this since launch, and we launched it, it's, oh um, goodness me, to source another giant clam at 99, I know Ollie, at 99.99, and you've got your four way split pay. Look, we were discussing the fact, Dave and I, when we were launching this, we were basically saying, look, imagine the deepest, darkest parts of the ocean. I'm terrified of the ocean, so I, like, no thanks. No, thank you. No, 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 no. But that's where these exist, and that's why they get to live and uh, you know as long and because they're so deep. Because they're so deep. But we rarely ever see them. For me, the giant clam was like this mythical, mythical species. Yeah. I didn't know it actually existed. I've seen models of them. Yeah, you know. But I, as you say, but I thought like maybe there was only one or two in the world or something. Yeah. You know, like an anomaly. Yeah, if you go to, I don't know, the, 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 the National History Museum, yeah. you will probably see a giant clam. Probably a model, though. It'll probably be a model of it. Let's bring you the 8 millimeters. They're stunning, and it's the purest color. To, to say that we're going to replace this parcel genuinely be like a winning lottery ticket. Um, okay, so, first price crash. Look at that. It's the brightest white oh. you could ever imagine. <laughs> The fact we have four split pays tells you that we should not have been at the previous price. And it does have that knock-on effect. Now the eight 
and the six are the most limited an opportunity to own not just one giant clam like at Mikimoto, an entire 38 centimeter strand. Yeah, not just one Mikimoto pearl. You are getting a full, full strand. We're already under 100 pounds. You've got your split pay there as well. Oh, that's stunning. I'd put this with a Kotan, you know. Oh, or with those pearls. 69 pounds and 99 pence. I was there on the launch. Look at that. They were launched too low. Dave was having a little funny five minutes, I think, when he was <laughs> launching these. The split pay. What's that? He says if I, if he gets a great deal, then he will always pass on that great yeah, deal. Fair enough. And that, you know, and all you know, credit to him for that. Credit to him. He did say as well that when he um as you know he's got this ambition to bring Imperial Jade yes. to our audience. He'll do it. He will do, do it. Do you think? He had this ambition to do to source giant clam, but everybody laughed at him. He had, everybody laughed at him when they said about that Imperial Jade's not hard to buy. He said, "Yeah, hey, I can go anywhere. I can go to Stanley, who we who met yesterday, and purchase Imperial Jade. Not a problem." However, to get a giant clam, that is almost a laughing joke. Um, hello, Gloria, saying one ice blue Amazonite in the middle of those. Wow, yeah, that Ooh. would be amazing. Oh, that would be beautiful, Gloria. Oh, that fireball pearl. Oh, yes. All the pearls you've just had as your deal of the day. $69.99. Well done. Now, the most limited of them all is the six millimeter giant clam. It's funny, isn't it? We can buy Alexandrite. We can buy red diamonds, pink diamonds, imperial jade, Bra uh, Brazilian prey. We can buy the rarest gemstones, not a problem. But do you think we can source another giant clam? No, 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 no. Just an existence, they're rare. You know, it's, it's at 69.99 for the purest natural white, by the way. Oh, really? That's yeah. natural. And this, or, this entire launch was from one giant clam really one giant clam what everything yeah the whole parcel because they're huge oh my goodness they're absolutely huge but the, the reality and that thing's yeah but we won't get another <laughs> unlikely to get another i don't know if dave's you know dave's fairly brave and 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 i'm and steve and jake to be fair but i don't think they're digging uh, they're digging sorry diving, <laughs> diving to those <laughs> to those depths are they no. i don't think even they would do that oh, goodness me 49 pounds and 99 pence only for the only purchase in 20 years as a partnership that we've ever brought you and by the way gemporia didn't have the giant clam in a, on, a, on a showcase it didn't have it it was all exclusive to jewelry makers so um there's no collection on our sister channel it is literally this not even on our sister channel gem collector there's no giant clam. What we had was all in this amazing showcase. So well done, everybody. Heather, Patricia, Jane, Dorothy, Margaret, Jenny, Sue, Amy, uh, Dawn, Frida, Christine, Brenda, Maker, loads of multi-buyers. People on the phone lines as well, which is amazing. Jane in Yorkshire, you can still do it. Just make sure you check out your baskets. This is the most limited of all the collection. If your budget allows, can you imagine a graduated giant clam necklace? I mean... That's Come auction on. house worthy. That's something to get into your collection, even yeah. for, if you're a collector. Yeah. I mean, how many people are going to own something like that? Not many, are they? Oh, a handful, I yeah. would say. You know, minimal, minimal people. It's up there with the rarity of your mellow pearls. I love having things that no one Me else too. has got. <laughs> Me too. And affordably as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, have I got what? Uh, no. We've got some drops. Oh, I remember them. I remember them. Half drilled. You've made your necklace, right? Yeah. You've got your necklace sorted. And see the kind of blend of colour? That's called the flame. We describe it in the same way that you do your mellow pearls or your, uh, um, thank you, uh, queen conch pearls. You talk about the flame that glides across the surface of them. These are extremely limited. 
We're going to go straight to it because there is only 30. You don't just get the one, you get the pair. And you know what? They're larger than they appear on that recording as well. Oh, so we've got some carved conch coming up next Saturday. They would be amazing. Look at, we are at 20 pounds. 20 pounds per natural clam pill. Yeah, use them with your carved. Use them with the finest gemstones that you can get your hands on because these are uber, uber rare. Again, let me uh, tilt them towards you. There you go. I didn't, uh, genuinely, you know, when you don't even think about something until you actually a part of, uh, you know, uh, of um, a launch, basically. And I was like, oh, yeah. I haven't said that. I've only ever seen them in an animation. Yeah, me too. Only ever. Yeah, or a model. Yeah. Oh, now, that's just not real. One more auction. And just before that. Okay. We've had a message into the studio. Okay. I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. Uh, hiya, Barry. Hello to you, lovely. Can't see. It. One minute. We'll just pop it on the... Yes. Um, hi all. Can you please say happy birthday to my lovely wife, Tracy? I admire her strength and her determination since becoming disabled 13 years ago. Oh my goodness. Well, Barry, of course we absolutely can. Happy, happy, happy birthday to you, Tracy. Happy birthday, Tracy. Sending you How lovely. both lots and lots of love. Have the best most wonderful day most wonderful day um it is our pleasure to barry happy birthday tracy sending you lots and lots and lots of love i love that i love that little outward display of affection yeah and admiration for what someone's been through by the sounds of it and yeah. just to say that publicly i think means the world doesn't it totally totally amazing have the best birthday celebrate both of you won't you now i've got one more auction before the break and then we've got your Kotan, which is absolutely amazing. Liam's manager special. Of what? The mother of Pearl. Yeah, but you said we can't do this bundle. It wasn't... You're as bad as him, you know, Ross. <laughs> you know, you were saying that he can't do it and then you're recapping it. Oh, it's lovely. I love that. Mother of Pearl. Look at that. You know, you know I, I've witted on loads, haven't I, this last hour, and I do apologise if I've bored you, but hopefully you get... You can see why I get as excited when we've got luxury gemstones like this. It is my job to do that. Anyway, but you wouldn't think it. Mother of Pearl used to be inexpensive, didn't it? Certain varieties. However, Van Cleef & Appels, Chopard, Gucci, all those big designers yep. working with Mother of Pearl. And... Everything that we were describing with the pearl harvest absolutely applies to the shell itself. Absolutely applies to that. The finest quality mother of pearl has got, and I'm gonna, can I show you one at a time? Because it's really, look, look. Look at that iridescence. Oh, it's lovely. On the day, yeah, that's true. Ross said to Liam, no manager this week, because you know we've had the manager special yep. deals, will beat Liam's deal. How beautiful are they? Ooh. Wait. These are all carved and double-sided as well. Oh, I love the stars. And you get two strands. Debs, I'm not even done. Not even done, because you don't just get the strands. You also get two mother of pearl donuts. That is quite a stash. Goodness yeah, it's me. amazing. Yeah, R Ross was saying, Liam, no one is going to beat this manager special deal because it, the price of mother of pearl has gone up. Because of, it's obvious if pearls have gone up in price, yeah. the same applies to the actual mollusk itself. So what? One, two, three, four, five, six strands. Yeah. Two donuts, 99 pounds and 99 pence, all beautifully carved as well. So you've got stars, hearts, flowers. Oh, come on. Um, <laughs> stars, hearts, flowers. They're double-sided too. They're not just the one slice. So, I mean, they're just crying out to be beautiful earrings, aren't they? Just a ring. 
Loop those on a leather, on a piece of leather, amazing. How many did we have, Roscoe? There's just nine of them left. Again, look at this iridescence. I'm really struggling to hold these. Look. At 99 pounds and 99 pence, the price of mother of pearl is equally expensive now. Very, very, very expensive. I'd use this with your uh, giant clam. We have the final two, Liz, Marie, Carol, Dawn, Alison, Isle of Wight, Lynn, London, uh, Amy, you've just got yours. I've got literally two left. Uh, Barry, Anna, Kerry, County Antrim, Maker, Kent, Gloucestershire. And look, you know, so you can get mother of pearl from a few different mollusks, but it won't be necessarily the Van Cleef grade, no, of course. No, no, no. Um, that's an unbelievable price tag for the multitude of components that you're getting. Do not go anywhere, jewelry makers. It's on the verge of selling out. There's so over allocated, like you wouldn't believe. Now, coming up after the break, jewelry makers, it's a whole hour designated to the beautiful, the steeped in history, Cotan Jade. 10,000 years of mining. I don't know any other gemstone that can say that, no. to be honest. 10,000 years of mining. The history has to be one of, one of if not the longest. Um, but that mining uh, um, story, if you like, um, is about to come to an end. It is one of the world's rarest gemstones. Yeah, just because it's 10,000 years doesn't mean it's abundant. Um, it is one of the world's top 10 rarest gemstones and it is easily one of the world's top five probably most expensive gemstone. The legend that is Kotan Jade mined in the Kotan River under moonlight where they believe, locals believe that the jade lights up. Um, the opportunities, those, those offerings um, are coming to a close and they say at best two years. Get it now. If you do sell your jewellery, don't sell it yet wait until it is announced to the world that this gemstone is all but mined out. We have an hour dedicated to Kotan after this. Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewelry Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's bestsellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click on the Schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewelry Maker. Shopping with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your jewelry room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewelry Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewelry Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewelry Maker. Here at Jewelry Maker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard P&P is $3.95. Charges may differ outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option of $5.95. Shopping made easy on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker.
It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Do you know, those words collector's choice couldn't be more apt for this showcase this is the ultimate collector's gemstone and it has been for literally thousands of years in fact once upon a time it was only emperors of china that were allowed to own this gemstone emperors of china that's it they were the only ones that were able to own kotan jade now I'm going to quickly sort of, oh, I must never assume that everyone knows what we're talking about. So, um, and again, this really, it, it, I recognized it last night in the conversation with my husband and I kind of just, I just think he knows. He just think, I just assume he knows. And he was like, what's Kotan? I said, like, okay, okay. Kotan Jade. Well, when we talk about Jade collectively, uh, collectively Jade is, we all know, um, one of the world's most desirable, valuable gemstones. But Jade is actually almost like, I've always described it this way. Imagine a family tree. Jade is the surname. And then you have the two children, Jadeite and Nephrite. Yeah? They are two chemically different, chemically different, two different ages as well. Um, Jadeite, it comes from Burma, um, which is now mined out. Uh, nephrite you can get it in a few different lo locations you can get it from um, British Columbia you can get it from nephrite jade Russia I think you can get some from Pakistan as well but the ultimate is Kotan and it's also the oldest it's probably you know you think about Kashmir Sapphire <clears throat> which was mined out in the a tiny frame of window but uh, window frame but it was still to this day centuries on still still to this day we know cashmere sapphire is like the the the, the best of the best um we can bring you the reality is when i was in tucson two years ago i saw lots of cashmere sapphires loads and loads of cash expensive don't get me wrong but we could get it that's the point um and that was mine for what was it between two and five years something like that it was it was, it was a short time frame cotan jade has been mined for 10,000 years. That blows my mind. It does mine too. And when you see, I'm gonna show you a sketch of them literally mining this gemstone, just the drawing itself, the drawing itself, there, shows you how long they've been sourcing this, this gem, or mining this gemstone. And I mentioned just before the break, uh, jade pickers is what they used to call them used to literally wade out into the Kotan River under moonlight because the jade, the Kotan jade, they believed shone in moonlight and made it e easier to find. But if you go to somewhere like J uh, Burmese jade, if you think about that, we know it's no longer being mined, but that's vast boulders, mm. vast. They're huge and jadeite forms when quite crudely described, when the movements of tectonic plates um, collide and then that tectonic plates literally pivots down below the ocean's crust 
that's how the gemstone is actually formed it's incredibly rare thank goodness that doesn't happen quite frequently because as you can imagine it's quite uh um well for example tanzanite and um kilimanjaro was formed from the movement of tectonic plates you know what i mean it's going to be quite geologically significant anyway your Kotan jade, some 10,000 years of mining. Do you know, along the Kotan River, that's the secondary deposit. They've never found the first deposit of Kotan jade. Really? Never. So every single one of your Kotans, the ones I have here, the ones that were worn by the emperors, were literally washed down the Kotan River, which it, it makes it understandable that they're almost pebble sizes. Mm. We've got a photograph of Kotan jade being traded and they are literally laid out on little blankets almost and you can see they're pebble sizes pebble sizes but look at this from the new york Times: jade from china's west surpasses gold in value there's an ancient proverb saying gold has a price jade is priceless mm. it those words were written about kotan jade Ounce for ounce, the finest jade has become more valuable than gold with the most prized nuggets of mutton fat, which I know is not the most romantic of descriptions. We like to sort of frilly things up here in the West, don't we? But in China, they're kind of like, right, okay, that's pigeon blood. That's mutton fat. That's chicken skin. You know, it's, it's, not, it's not romantic how they describe things, but we kind of can imagine it, can't we, in our head? So named for its marbled white consistency, fetching $3,000 an ounce, a tenfold increase from a decade ago. Can I just say those statistics, by the way, will have changed? Because I didn't know the first time I read that article that actually Kotan Jade was on the verge of depletion. With very strict monitoring, what they're actually doing now is closely monitoring the uh, um, exportation, not exportation, that's the wrong word, um, the offerings of Kotan Jade. Here's another uh, photograph I can show you. Again, it's in the river. A man searched for jade at the White River, Kotan, China, ounce for ounce, finest jade has become more valuable than gold. You can see him, and he's literally looking for pebble sizes. D I I always try and remember the fact, firstly, this is one of the world's most valuable gemstones if not the um secondly this is a gemstone that is only found in very small sizes compare compare that to the burmese jadeite sizes which were like something like the size of a car whereas these are literally pebbles literally pebble sizes keep that in the back of your mind when you're looking at your entire strand what you're sourcing is totally natural it is not type b it is not type c so when we say collector's choice, and again, this is what I would always say, I say to my lovely friends here at Jewelry Maker, I say to my family, I've, I've bought Kotan Jade for some of my extended family as well. When I say to them, this is the gem, if you were to ask me, my personal opinion, what gem should I buy now? What two gems should I buy now? The two I've just brought you in the 10 o'clock and in the 11 o'clock hour. That would be my first answer. Because Kotan Jade, if it does la if it lasts another two years, what do you think is going to happen to the price of your Kotan when it's already one of the most expensive gems in the world? Um, is it going to go down or is it going to go up? I want to show you a piece on First Dibs. First Dibs is like a platform. You can sell your pieces of jewellery. And if I were to sell my Kotan, which I'm not going to right now, but if I were, it would be First Dibs that I would approach. So. Here's a piece of jewellery that they photographed. It's a jade necklace, hand-carved, white, mutton-fat nephrite. Look at the translucency. Look at that they've got perfectly colour-matched, lovely, and one simple gold clasp. Certified, untreated, like every single one of your mutton-fat, uh, of your Kotan jades that I bring you today. But look at this. The price of mutton-fat jade starts at $995. I'm yet to see one at that price, to be honest. Um, and tops out at three hundred and twenty five thousand dollars that's a house yeah that a is nice a... house yeah it is you know with these necklaces on average selling for ninety three thousand dollars <sighs> ninety three thousand I, I, again i really need to emphasize if we did things the way so many of us and I get it, I get why people go, well, why don't you sell it at those prices then, Al? If that's what you're saying, that that's what they're worth, 
Why don't you sell them at that? Well, we could do, but then we wouldn't have a show. We would not have a show. We would not have Jewelry Maker. We would not have Gemporia. You know, like Stanley Yu, I was saying earlier on, he used to be a wholesaler. He saw, okay, hang on, Burmese is my, uh, Jade's mind out. Uh, Kotan's on the verge of it. So what, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? Right, we're no longer going to be um, a wholesaler. We're going to set up our own retailer. Thankfully, here at Jewelry Maker, we don't just, just deal in Jade. This is why, again, I always say to my nearest and dearest, if there's a gemstone that you can buy right now, if you can afford it right now, Cotan Jade, buy it, but do not sell it. My opinion, you can do what you want, of course, but it's my opinion. Don't sell it yet. Wait two years, then see what happens to the price. Right now, on average, it's 93 and a half thousand pounds. It's, you know, what's gonna happen in a couple of years? I don't mind that investment of time. Also, let me just slide these over. Never mind the price. Never mind what they're valued at. Look at the quality of that Cotan Jade that you saw on first dibs. It's translucency in color with Jade. And color with Cotan is, mutton fat is the ultimate, it's the most expensive. But really, I've got colors here <coughs> that I didn't even know existed, pink Jade. We've got blues, we've got mutton fat, we've got your candy colors. Look at the translucency. These are all, in my opinion, as amazing in their, in their quality as what you see next to, in First Dibs photograph. Now, we will never be able to bring you vast quantities of Cotan Jade. It's just not possible. It doesn't form in big, big quantities. But the fact that we are actually bringing you full strands is amazing. The largest quantity that we have in this showcase is 45 and it's actually the rounds oh. all the colors of jade in this amazing ombre strand okay now hang on a minute hang on a minute because i'm mining cotan jade fishing effectively yeah, isn't it yeah really by hand, no big heavy duty machinery like you would do your diamonds, but I need to color match, I need to translucency match, and then we need to acquire enough to create this perfect work of art. That in itself is not to be sniffed at too. Now, I'm gonna start this opportunity with natural, certified natural, the same words that you saw on first dibs, certified natural, pink, cotan jade, this is an amazing, I'm just going to borrow this bus for a second, a 70 centimetre strand. You know, we don't make, we make our own job hard, to be truthful, because you take the world, one of the world's rarest, top five rarest gemstones, and then we go, oh, I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what, actually, you know, we're going to, we'll, we'll, we'll um, oh. look at that colour, oh my goodness oh. me, that's <laughs> incredible, <laughs> that's all natural, I oh, know. I've never seen it's anything like that, that just... There's a magic about it. It's there is. Like, I don't know. I don't Look even know to pink. describe it. There's three. Oh, it's gorgeous. Oh. This is the ultimate collector's showcase. The ultimate collector's showcase. And again, if it's only my opinion, I wouldn't sell mine. Let's just put it that way. Not yet. If you're purchasing right now to make money, then you can do it and you will, will do very, very, very well. Even here at £1,999, it's not your price. Not your prize. There's 20 of you with it in your baskets. I've got the final opportunity. Not, look at that pink and it's natural. It's never been on air, Jerome, because we were only able to source three. Oh, ridiculous. Actually ridiculous. £299. Look, take that price. It's sold out. Take that price and forget about it because that's no reflection of the true value. Now, whenever we bring you Cotan, we've got collectors the world over that will get involved. Now... I've got one more pink. I'm going to show you that first dibs piece again. Look at the shape that they've cut them into, like drums. Oof. Here's a rarer. Pink is rarer than mutton fat. 
Oh, it's so beautiful. And it's not it's not a, like a um a Barbie pink. No, not at all. It's a dusky soft pink. Yeah. Absolutely unbelievable. Good luck. How many do we have? First one sold out, this will follow suit. I didn't even know pink Cotan existed until recently. And then Dave advised, he was like, Elle, it's so rare. This would have taken, I don't know, decades to source enough to produce, to, to, to produce a full strand. And it's not a 38 centimeter strand, it's a 55 centimeter strand. Again, again you know, when they're talking about, on average, an, a, a, a mutton fat or a jade rather, a cotan jade necklace, averaging 93,000 pounds. <laughs> and we're at 1,999. Pink is rarer. Pink is actually rarer than mutton fat. It's not necessarily the most expensive, but it is rarer. I've got five available opportunities. You need to be quick. You saw how fast the first opportunity sold out. This is not going to be any, any different. And you know what? There will be collectors all around the world tuning into this showcase. The reality is, this is why when we said we have uh, uh, jewelers in in San Francisco, jewelers in uh, um, Milan, jewelers in uh, New York, London, loads and loads and loads of jewelers in London that will shop with us, especially opportunities like Cotan. I don't know if they're selling them on, it's up to them. It's, it's entirely up to them. I wouldn't personally, I would keep it for the next couple of years. And I would only ever put it with gold. Only this is the ultimate collector. Yeah, you have to. Gem. You have to because yeah. you can't undervalue it with anything less. I, it, just in my opinion. No, I but, totally agree. Oh, it's. I've never seen anything like it. It's really beautiful. We had seven Debs. Yeah, I'm, oh. I, I'm not surprised. On and gone. Yeah, sold out. Well done. Do you know we could, we could do if we were like Sotheby's, you could do like the. It would be an upward bid, wouldn't it? Yeah. yeah. Ollie, four nine nine would have been amazing, wouldn't it? Absolutely amazing. Yeah, Ollie has been. <laughs> um, Ollie, so he's, he's been on Soul Street. He said that four nine nine for Cotan Jade. Oh, uh, let's now bring you the baby blue. Again, can we have a look at the photograph of where they're trading the the, the pebbles, effectively, of Cotan Jade? Can anyone spot a blue? Well, jade, Burmese jade is, can be the size of a, 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 a car. Whereas Cotan jade, remember it's secondary deposit, it's washed down the river so, river, so it tumbles, so it loses a bulk of its carat weight as well. Then you're finding a color, natural, type A, baby blue. Now don't expect it to be like tanzanite blue. It's much like your lavender is to your Burmese jade. It's a whisper. It's a suggestion. It's a very, very, very soft suggestion of blue. But you've got to match every single one of them and you also have to translucency match every single one of them. This is the only baby blue Cotan jade strand we've brought you ever. Ever, ever, ever. That's true. That's, that's factually correct, isn't it? This is the only baby blue we've ever brought. Yeah, ever. And even here, 2,499, that's amazing. I'm not sitting here saying that's, uh, that's not a big amount of money. Of course it is, of course. But it's not in comparison to what we're actually discussing. As a collector, there is no better showcase that you could be tuning into than the Kotan collection right now. The most expensive piece of jewelry in the world, in the world, Features part of a cullen and diamond. So it's got a cullen and diamond in the center. And when you zoom in, countless, countless diamonds all around that. The Heritage in Bloom necklace, which is 200 million. Look, beautiful. There it is, the cullen and heritage of Chow Tai Fu. Chow Tai Fu is like Tiffany's, by the way, in oh, the okay. East. Um, Hong Kong based jeweler, retailer Chow Tai Fu released a gorgeously crafted diamond necklace a heritage in bloom in September 2015. Once released, it became the most expensive diamond necklace in the world. It's not just diamonds though. 
Because if you look at this photograph, oh. that circle of heaven is Kotan Jade. Oh, yeah. Are you ready for your prize? Not 2,499. There are five left. I've, this is the only aqua blue that I've ever seen. Baby blue. <laughs> it's a nervous <laughs> laugh. It is actually a nervous laugh. Well, we did not launch it at 199, did we? Massive, huge, heartfelt congratulations. The reality is, Ollie, if we had brought them at 499, that would be a complete steal. It would be, because I don't know anywhere else that could, I've never seen it, Blue. I've never seen it. The final three, you've got that beautiful translucency. You've got a full 55 centimeter strand. Um, it's impeccable quality. When we talk about heirlooms, it's exactly what's on your screens. Hello, Hartford, just saying, please don't miss out on these stunning Cotan strands. I got the pink and the blue strands and I wished I got more when I had the chance. Here's your chance, Hertfordshire. You've got a second opportunity. You have, but there's only three. There is only three, and I totally agree with you. If your budget allows, if you are looking for, how do I word this? Oh, and I have to be really careful. A savvy purchase, there we go, yeah? If you're looking for a savvy purchase, do you know the reality is diamonds do, diamonds currently don't go up in value. Diamonds are plentiful. Yeah. They are plentiful. Millions of diamonds are mined on, a, on an annual basis. Millions. This gemstone's gonna be mined out and it's one of the most valuable in the world. And we're here sit, sat casually going 199. Is it any wonder I nervously laugh? Is it any wonder? It is a savvy purchase. You know, the, it's gone, well done. Yeah, about 100 solitaires. Oh. This was my favorite when we first launched this. I love it. It's called Lemon. Full 55 cent, but all perfectly color matched. Look from there. Natural lemon color. I love this one. It's like sunshine. It is, it's joyful. I want to loosen that strand and then it'll just flow that a little bit better. But they're so, I mean, I'm not complaining because that means you get more. You're actually getting more on there. Now on your recording, it looks quite green, but it's actually much more lemon in its color. Even here, 2,499 pounds. I'm not sitting here saying that's not a small amount of money. I am saying that's an amazing price though for Cotan Jade of any color, frankly. It has the translucency. It has that uniformity of color and you are getting a massive, a staggering 155 carats in this full necklace. We're not staying there. How many do we have left for us? Nine. We, we, laugh, we laugh and we joke, and it's something Dave and I were discussing at the time. We are like, look, we laugh and joke the fact there will come a time here at Jewelry Mech, and we had it with Russian Alexandrite. Well, we didn't realize, well, although we are fully aware of what we've got here, but at the time, Russian Alexandrite, we were like, yeah, bring it to end, lowest ever price. Look, we got a great deal, you get a great deal. We could have charged tens of thousands of pounds for Russian Alexandrite. We can't get it now. No. You know, we will look back and go, you know, we knew full well the price of Cotan Jade. We knew full well, but yet we still brought it to you at triple figure prices. And do you know what? You know this too, because what I'm seeing on the bottom monitor right now, what you're looking at right now, this, it wouldn't be the case. If, 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 it, if you didn't recognize the value of Cotan Jade in the history, they wouldn't have all sold out. We are not stopping at 2,499, although we could. I didn't hear first dib saying the average at two and a half grand, do they? <laughs> I, I honestly, it is a nervous laugh every time I do that little titter. 199. I can bring certain gems for 199. That's incredible. I mean, when, when I was on last with Dave and he was saying that somebody um, didn't believe that our jade was real. Yeah. So they had it appraised privately. Yep. And every single bit, obviously, was real because people look at the price and they can't believe it. 
Yeah, we make our job hard sometimes. Every single... By, by the low prices. Yeah, so every single piece was appraised real, so much so that it actually did us a favour in the end yeah. because did, didn't we end up paying for the appraisal? But yeah, we've said that quite a few times. I was that, fascinated um, yeah, by that. Yeah, it's like, that. well, go, go get appraised. And if it's valued, we will pay for it. We'll do that. Um, look, you know, Gumps, an employee of Gumps, which is one of the oldest jewellers in, in San Francisco, oh, right. messaged us and said, look, I used to work in Gumps. They deal with jadeite rather than nephrite, but right. they were like, the quality that you have at, at, at Jewellery Maker or Gemporia is exactly the same quality you see at Gumps, and Gumps is five figures. Really? Five figures, yeah. So please know what you are getting. That's why I said, take that price, purchase it, and forget it. Yeah. Forget it. Right, now, a moment to reference again the first dibs photograph. The price of mutton fat jade, which is the most expensive, starts at $995 and tops out at $325,000, with these necklaces on average selling at $93,250. Um, Hello, Sally. I so love your jade. It's a joy when it comes through my door. I would love some mutton fat, please. Got earrings, but need rounds. Okay. I haven't got rounds, but have got drums. And this is your white mutton fat Cotan jade. But there are 12. Make that 10. Make that nine. You need to be quick. Ooh. The mutton fat Cotan is the most expensive of all, ordinarily, outside these four walls. Make that six. These are absolutely flying. You can see the purity of the colour. It's natural. It's not dyed. It is the same. I totally agree. The only difference is the one on first dibs is knotted and it's got a gold clasp. That's the only difference that I can see. That's the only difference. Are you ready? It is a guaranteed sellout. It was super over allocated. I thought this would be more expensive. Oh. Didn't you? <laughs> I really did. Do you know, so at this point, I feel like we're going to be the laughing stock of this. What are you doing? We do know what we're doing. We <laughs> honestly do. We know the value of jade. We know the value of mutton fat. We do. But this is how Jewelry Maker and Gemporia works. I, I, and do you know how we purchased these, by the way? It wasn't monetary. There was no money exchanged. Oh. To get this, we we bought alongside Bernard, who we mentioned earlier on. Steve and Bernard bought a parcel of jadeite together, jadeite Burmese jadeite together, which you kind of buy blind. So, and you'll never lose money on that purchase, which is mi millions of pounds oh. it costs for this purchase. You never lose it, but you you will either break even or you'll do really well out of it. They did really well out of it. So we have exchanged jadeite. Oh for these acquisitions and when we say exchange jadeite we mean it was like truckloads of jadeite for this showcase wow. that's the difference that's the difference between kotan and burmese jadeite you know it's vastly expensive look at that we've got the final two it's a guaranteed sellout sally you've got to check out my darling there's so many people there swansea gail susan tracy geraldine hazel marishka dorothy devon sorry susan janice karen not only that you pop to first dibs if i was to say you know that necklace that you've got advertised that on average is selling for 93,250 pounds uh, can i can i have that but can i only pay you 49 pounds 70 pence per month <laughs> you'd be there for the rest of your life yeah exactly They're like jog on l jog on um amazing well done well done well done is that sold out there's one left now i've got a six mil and a four mil they are both rounds Okay, I'm gonna repeat what Ross has just said to me. Um, if you are specifically after your four mils, you're gonna get an amazing deal regardless. But if you're particularly wanting the four mil, shop ahead on those. Um, if not, the deal that you're getting on your six mil is ridiculous. Hold off on the four, unless you absolutely want that 
you absolutely want that size. If you're not bothered about size, don't buy the four mil, get the six. Okay? Ooh. Let's show the two together. This is my favorite, these. I mean, look at them. I'm gonna do the four mil first, and then we're gonna go into the six mil. Okay, now I'm gonna ask Kat to follow me. Because I don't, that's the thing when it comes to Cotan Jade, you need to appreciate every single one. I agree. This is imperial green colour. You don't describe nephrite as imperial. You describe it more as a, um, a spinach green colour. Spinach green is what imperial is to, 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 ne to jade out. But look at that colour. Look at that translucency. You have your dove greys. You have the pure imperial white. You have the yellow tones. This is all natural. All totally natural. And then follow down. It's stunning. Look at those greens. It's absolute. Look, there's some blues in there as well. Do you know what? I would get the four mils to go with any of the other strands, Ross. These would be amazing with the other ones if you wanted to alternate. Yeah. Do you think, Deb? Um, do, do you still find th this? Excuse my ignorance, but in the river. Yeah. How 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 long would it take to get all these colours in the river and then? make them get those little pebbles and mm -hmm. then make them into these strands mm -hmm. i love the story of it before and we me. even start and me and there's the fact it's ten thousand years oh it's incredible ten thousand years are you ready it's the only four male strand of cotan that we have only get this if you are specifically looking for four mil. when have you ever heard a retailer say that <laughs> actually don't buy that Unless, of course, you want the four, which is a beautiful strand. It's a lovely, lovely strand. I'm just trying to highlight that the six mil deal is, is unmissable. Is absolutely unmissable. It's complete mirror image. 149 is absolutely unbelievable. Translucent, beautiful coat and jade. There's five of them left. I personally would be using the former. Look at that, 37.25. That's just a ridiculous price tag. Ridiculous, ridiculous, ridiculous. Now, okay, next up. We, you know, we had a bigger quantity of these. The only reason that we are, or it, the only way we are bringing you Kotan here at Jewelry Maker is because of that exchange. And we do that with other gemstones as well. That's how we source your Sleeping Beauty, by the way. We saw Sleeping Beauty in the same way. We can't physically buy it from the mine. It's mined out yeah. 10 years, over 10 years ago, 12 years ago. So we will go to other traders that may well have Sleeping Beauty and say, okay, I don't pay for it though. How about we do swaps? Yeah. So that's how we do it. So we basically exchange some of our Burmese jade for the Kotan. Look at that. It's perfectly mirror imaged. Ollie's, Ollie's saying he wants this one, yeah. Look, even down to these fine colours, look how perfectly colour matched they are. Front and reverse. Translucent. Natural. Today I have 45 opportunities. If you've missed out on any of the strands, it's also one of the few rounds that we bring you as well. I can't believe we're doing this. I can't believe we've brought a single strand of Cotan Jade at, at, at under £1,000, £2,000, under £5,000. So again, let me just say, in comparison to that four mil strand that you saw a moment ago, you get 100 carats more of Cotan Jade, you're getting a slightly longer strand, and you're obviously getting a bigger size. These are six mil. You're getting that same amazing quality. You've got translucency and color, but you have extreme. Get your certificate, jewelry makers. It's, you need your certificate with these. With all of your Cotan, you want that little piece of paper. It won't say the price that you pay. That little piece of paper, and all the gemologists will be looking for is, is it treated, yes or no, not enhanced? Are you ready to see an unbelievable deal? Ignore that. The ultimate collector's choice. Oof. That is ridiculous. <laughs> it's actually ridiculous. You've got, uh, you've got like a bouquet of all the rare colours yeah. in one amazing strand. <gasps> Ross, did we? No, but it's only 50 pounds more and you've got 100 carats more here. 
It's not fifty pounds more. Oh, the quantity apparently. We shouldn't be. Uh, it, it's kind of like a um, a trend that we've slipped into here at Jewelry Maker. The bigger the quantity, the lower the price. We should not be doing that with Cotan Jade. If we shouldn't be doing it with Cotan Jade, <laughs> that's the thing. Do that with a gemstone that's that's that still be in mind fully. That is not one of the top five rarest gems in the world, let alone one of the top five most expensive gemstones in the world. You know, the most expensive piece of jewellery in the world. What halos the Cullen and Diamond? A Cotan Jade. What you're sourcing right now. At £199, that's epic. It's ridiculous. It's absolutely amazing. And that's quite clearly no reflection of the true value or worth but apparently we didn't even stop there there was 45 this is nuts I don't know how else to describe it other than it's nuts and and again from one collector to another don't sell it yet it's up to you it's entirely up to you it's your decision personally I will try and hold on to my Cotan Jade as long as possible because the mo that's ridiculous for six millimeters how many 150 carats of natural, ombre, translucent, genuine Cotan Jade. I can't even say that out loud, Ollie. Ollie's just worked out what they are per bead. I can't, I can't, I can't say it out loud. <laughs> it's ridiculous. It is actually ridiculous. Don't, as long as we know, take that 149 and forget it. Forget that price because it's not what it's, it will be valued at. It's not what it's worth. I would literally just restrand it as is. Absolutely. You don't even need gold. Because remember that proverb. Gold has a price. Jade is priceless. You don't need to invest gold into your Kotan. Or your Burmese for that matter. You don't need to. It's valuable without it. Incredibly valuable without it. Um, we are super over allocated on this one. Do you want to see how many we've got left? 10 and I can see Mary Susan Northumberland Invanesha Sheila uh, Amarjit Marie Janet uh, Aisha Jackie James Nikki hello to Joanne who wants to you need to check out your basket and the reality is again I'm not going to say we won't be able to get Kotan because that's why we're in Hong Kong at the moment. We're trying to get gems like this. However, the only way we got hold of this showcase was because of that exchange. And it was a case of Steve, um, Steve and, and, and Bernard, two successful chaps, let's just put it that way, yeah? Two successful guys who basically said, Steve was like, yeah, I'll have a go with you. I want to have a go on this Jade Ike buy-in. <laughs> he was like, we'll go 50-50. And Bernard had never done that before. So it was kind of a little bit like, oh, okay, well, well, it'd be a big expense. He was like, yeah, that's fine. So they, I don't know how much they paid, probably a lot. Um, but you buy it blind, effectively. And Bernard said, look, look, we might not make money. And we might, we definitely won't make money in this in the short term yeah. because it's got to be processed, carved, all of those things. These are big, vast boulders. That's how you buy jade eye. Um, but you won't lose money. Let's just put it that way. That's that's pretty good bet, isn't yeah, it? I yeah. suppose. So, and it turned out very well, very, very, very well. It was some of that purchase that acquired your Cotan Jade jewelry makers. Um, it wasn't actually a financial exchange of cash to source them amazing now i've got four remaining chances once they're gone i've got jan mary janet jackie nikki joanne debbie maker and swansea still with it in their basket well done to lillian keith susan caroline tina hazel swansea lou scottish borders aisha susan london getting two patricia maker surrey sharon sheila northumberland i can't keep up there's one left i'm gonna leave it with you amazing 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 right oh I just keep, they just keep coming and I keep thinking, that's my favourite, that's, oh, look at that. <laughs> oh, look at that one. Oh, <laughs> incredible. Uh, have we not got the best job in the world? Oh, yes. Are we, are we not the luckiest people in the world? Yeah, absolutely. And also, don't forget, we've got the, you know, the best talent in the world as well, with oh, our lovely Debs. Oh. Honestly, love Jewellery Maker, really do. Look at that, look at it. Look at it. <laughs> How do they even... Oh, that just wants to go straight over your head and around your neck. Oh, it's... You don't want to disturb that perfect no, ombre, no. do you? I mean, that's skill in its own right, isn't it? Just sourcing. But this will take... 
Um, can I get a, li a, a lighter bust? Just so you can really see that colour. Is that alright? Have you got a lighter bust for me? Um, but just so you can see the perfect colour and the perfect ombre. But it would take years to source enough cotan to form this perfect ombre. There are nine in existence. We're going to do it in one price crash, thank you, lovely. Because nine is not enough. Okay. The reason why I want to do this is because then you will actually see the perf... Oh, it's a, it's a wibbly-wobbly one, okay. I'll hold oh. it. And I apologise for this bust. I'll just... Look. Look, look there. Look at that, perfect. I don't see first dibs bringing you a, 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 an ombre, by the way. Let me, let me just for a second though, and excuse the state on the bust on the river. Oh my goodness. But look. Oh. Let's follow it round. I know the bust is tatty, I apologize. Follow it down. We're already down to the final five. Unbelievable. That is beautiful. How are we doing this though? I know, we know how, but seriously though. Uh. Take that price, forget about it, because it's no reflection of the true value. £199 for certified natural Cotan Jade. A collector's <laughs> hour, a, le a collector's show, to be honest. Unlike any collector's show that I've, you know, amazing, truly, truly, truly amazing. We know our team are in Hong Kong and they will just, they're, they're more there. This is me being completely honest. <clears throat> they are more there so they can get footage for you. That's honestly, uh, like Tucson is not just about buying, it's about getting the knowledge so that we can relay that message to you as well. And the footage that you will film. Sorry, what was that? The mutton fat rounds, right, I'm going to swap over a bit. Look at this one. <laughs> um, okay. Let's bring you the mutton fat rounds. There are 11 available. Thank you. Sorry, cat. Doing it in one price crash. We have got mutton fat and rounds then. Was it Sally who asked? I think it was Sally, wasn't it? Sally, I've got 11 of these. I've got 11. This is the only mutton fat round that we have. Mutton fat, certified totally and utterly natural. It's, yeah, do you know, the... <laughs> L speechless. I d I, I d 149 pounds for Kotam Mutton Fat Jade. There's five left. You know it. I know it. We all know it. That's ridiculous, don't? Isn't it? Absolutely ridiculous. Look at the translucency. Okay, t can I take a memory photograph image of that translucency in that pure white colour? Now look at the 200 million dollar whatever it was necklace. That halo, look at the pure white, look at the translucency of your necklace, and look at the translucency of that. The, of course, if, they, if they're haloing the icon, one of the iconic colour and diamonds, they're not going to halo it with substandard, and you can see the quality. What on earth? Well done, sold out, amazing. Earlier on, we had light lemon. Oh, it's gorgeous. That was in drums, wasn't it? This is in rounds. There's three available. That's lovely, that is. We'll do it in one price crash because there's only three. Get them home. At some point, get them valued. Not just, you know it's gonna be valued more than this, you know that, but also for your insurance purposes. Yeah. You know, we, but we, we, yeah, it's wonderful to hear evaluations being sky high, and we know that will be the case, but you know, it's as important that you add them to your household insurance because you, it's a replacement value. And in a replacement to, 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 to replace Cotan Jade, it's not going to be £199. It just literally isn't. I've got three available. You can do it, Teresa, Susan. If you check out, Teresa's done it. Well done. I love it. It's a really it's delicate lemon, yeah, isn't it's it? Just yeah, spring-like. 
Yeah. Okay, yeah. Um, amazing, amazing, amazing. If you'll check out, oh, we're over allocated now. Susan in Essex wants two. London, you're there, and Patricia in Hampshire, you're there. So I'll leave that with you. Well done. Um, okay. Multicolor jade drums. Oh, that's nice, isn't it? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Look at that. The, what? Do you know one strand to describe all the, all, you know, the color wheel of Kotan? It's right here, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you've got, got your candies. Uh, yeah. Though, so what are those greys called? Are these kind of... Well, these I'm going to say here are your baby blues. Yes. Yeah. It is like cashmere grey. That's mutton fat. You've got a mixture. You've got your spinach greens. You've got on the recording. You can really see it on the recording. The deep reds. They're the candy, candy colours. Can you see? Look at. You've got imperial. I know we don't use the term imperial for Kotan, but you have got imperial green, haven't you? Yeah, definitely. In that strand by that recording. That recording, because you can see it in true light, and you can also see um, the translucency. Look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. Isn't it lovely? Oh, stunning. stunning There's two stunning. left. One, four, nine. Here's a pinch me moment. You know what? We'll wake up from this one day, this <laughs> dream, and we'll go, oh, my goodness me, what was that all about? Kotan Jade, one of the world's rarest, most valuable gemstones. And yet here we are bringing it at 149 pounds this is what jewelry maker do and what they do best it's honestly this is what makes so many of us proud to work for jewelry yeah. makers uh, maker because uh, don't forget this is a gemstone that reserved exclusively for uh, for emperors of china once upon a time you know, that's mind-blowing that yeah mm. and uh, you know auction houses all around the world sell it for tens if not six figure numbers you know, it's it, it, it's amazing that we can do this. Amazing. Sold out. Well done. Well done. Well done. Right. We're going to have some happy customers today, oh, aren't I we? I, 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 you should be ecstatic. <laughs> Absolutely over the moon. Ecstatic. <laughs> do you know, there are probably collectors with the deepest of pockets, mm. yeah, mm. who won't have the collection that you have. Yes. That's the reality. Oh, Dan, you keep delivering gorgeous things oh, to the desk, yeah. don't you? There's only a couple more, though. Because we've got your masterclass. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, which one? Yeah. These? Okay. I have the cashmere grey, which is incredibly rare. Oh, we'll take a little look. Have you seen this? Oh. It's that colour that is just... A bluish grey. Blue grey. It's, it's not grey. It's... Oh, I love it. I really love that. that. Yes, storm clouds. This is very rare. You know, like we said about the baby blue, mm -hmm. the grey is very, very, very rare. It's stunning, isn't it? We'll do it in one price crash. We only had four. And we've got your masterclass to bring you as well. Yeah, the translucent. They should look like... Same as your jadeite. Um, same as your jade out, 499, very, very rare. I've only got one left. Um, you've got your split payment as well. But look, same as your jade eye, it should look like a melting ice cube. That tells you've got a fine, nice, uh, um, fine crystal. There's only one left, so I'll leave it with you. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Um, okay. The what? The rounds. Okay. Oh. Now we just closed the last Well, you have those again, the darker steely blues. Uh, oh, look at that. That's amazing. Do you know what? I can imagine a celebrity wearing this on the red carpet, yeah. like a gent wearing this with a nice suit, Ooh, nice yeah. dinner suit. Yeah. That's not the price. Okay. It's got a, a, um, a little bit of your um, lavender shades coming through. Six millimeter rounds. Wow. Two nine nine. Oh, it would have taken years to source this color, these colors because it's the rare, ultra rare, baby blue tones, which 
obviously this has those baby blue tones those purpley light tones into the grays incredibly rare um you know again that photograph that we saw um at the kotam markets effectively and it is literally sold on the floor again here in the, here in the west we do things very differently don't yeah, we it's we more do. a lot of it is electronic whereas that is visually um at what we call jade markets you're not going to find an abundance of these 299 ridiculous again get your certificate of authenticity um you've got your split payments there as well on 0 percent interest natural natural genuine cotan jade down to the final three opportunities and less than 60 pounds how amazing is that so it will say ombre smoky purple cotan jade and it will say treatment not enhanced it's worthwhile especially with any variety of jade i'll leave the last three the last of your strands the last opportunity that we have this one you've got cotan on this too so you could wear this one of two ways you could wear it that way from your gray your lavender into your mutton fat or you could wear it mutton fat into your lavender does that make sense yes oh wow <laughs> look mutton fat into beautiful lavender colors wow i love this today has been like a high-end jewelers yeah it's like i'm sitting you know in tiffany's or cartier or you yeah. know sitting over here looking at you showing all those beautiful things that so the rare. bees wouldn't have a lineup like this you know no they wouldn't genuinely of, of cotan they wouldn't have a lineup of this amount we'll do it in one price crash i don't i genuinely don't think so no you're right to have this amount of cotan in one opportunity, Sotheby's wouldn't have that quantity. This is why we have jewelers from all around the world shop with us. Oh my goodness me, 249 pounds only. Approximately, yeah, Ollie's saying approximately 100 strands on each of these. You could add your gurus, your markers, you could turn them in marlas. Tell you what, that's the most luxurious marla you'll ever make, though. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, the most luxurious yeah, marla. Yeah. It is, though. This is the thing. This is, <laughs> uh, this is the thing. And, and I need to emphasize this one more time. It's only my opinion. You don't have to take my recommendation, of course. Personally, though, I would not sell my Kotan just yet. I would wait until, you know, 10,000 years of mining is announced to the world, it's done. It is done. And each of your cotans is sourced from the secondary deposit. Because in those 10,000 years, they've never found the main deposit. I know, it's amazing, it's amazing. It's hidden. Um, love it. I absolutely love that. Well done, everybody. Okay. Now, to close the hour, we're going to bring you... I didn't even know we had carvings in cotan. Oh! <gasps> Oh, it's a lotus flower. Oh, look at the colour of it. I didn't even know we had carvings in, in Kotan. You've got to th factor this, and this makes sense though, to not have carvings in Kotan. Why would you take a gemstone that is, or, okay. So take a gemstone that ounce for ounce, remember is more expensive than gold, significantly, is one of the world's top 10 rarest gemstones is also one of the world's most expensive gemstones. This has effectively been hollowed out. <laughs> does that make sense? Yeah, it does. You're taking bits out of it. It's translucent. And you have, would you say that's a lotus flower? Uh, yeah, uh, it looks like one, I think. Yes, it does. Like I an love Aztec the board. border, yeah. I love the border. I was just marvelling at how they even do that by hand i've got 30 available literally to close out yeah both sides to close out your cotan showcase now because this is the finale 199 is absolutely amazing if your budget allows imagine this is a pair of earrings oh my goodness talk about auction house worthy just before we crash we have just put some last of stock cotan and we're gonna put that on the web during the break. So if you've missed out on anything, but we do mean like ones and twos and we'll take them to the lowest prices that we can. As we have done with your showcase today, you'll see, check the website during the break. 
to close out the hours i make my way over to our lovely debs for what will be an amazing masterclass. let's do a, i can't say the words close out for for kotan <laughs> you know it's just not it just doesn't seem right um, okay, Ross is saying this price crash is going to be so good though, I have to time it. Um, you're going to have a minute on screen. That doesn't mean it's going to disappear after the minute, it means we'll move on. You can still do it, dial the number, speak to our contact centre, check out your baskets available on the web. That, uh, what on earth? Like I said, 79 99 I'm not even looking. <laughs> I didn't even look. <laughs> That's amazing, I mean. It is amazing. amazing. It's on split pace again, that tells you that's far too low. I can't even get my head around how they carve that, agree, agree. to be truthful. And um, you know, like with your bangles, the reason why bangles are so expensive, whether that's Kotan or, or Burmese, you have to pay for the, the negative space. Does yes. that make sense? Yes, you have to pay for what you cut away. Mm. You know, that's one of the many reasons why it's as expensive as, as it is. The circle of heaven, you have to pay for the for the negative space. Same with your carvings. Um, we're about to dive into a break, jewelry makers. I'm gonna make my way over to the lovely Debs for her amazing masterclass. Check the web during the break, jewelry makers, and do not go anywhere. We've also got your wall of fame as well, so don't forget that. Um, and join us in just a couple of seconds. Huge heartfelt congratulations um, on your Kotan. We'll see you after this. Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewelry Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click on the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewelry Maker. Shopping with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your jewelry room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewelry Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewelry Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewelry Maker. Here at Jewelry Maker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard P&P is $3.95. Charges may differ outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option of $5.95. Shopping made easy on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. 
Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. It's gorgeous, Tim. <laughs> Otherwise known as George. And his, George. And his oh, you, Zippy. Your Zippy. <laughs> frog and the what hippo? Weird alien thing. Oh yeah, someone said he was a frog. He might have been a frog. I think he's just a. I don't know. He's a creature. Not sure. I don't know. It's an intriguing. All from those little heshy bees. <laughs> um, okay, right. What an amazing masterclass we have planned for you. I am loving your jewellery. We've got so many options. Yeah. And these work together, wife's wife and puts some together. Loads of beads. Yeah, and the colours all go together. Just... Oh, my goodness me. Now, um, we'll get to your projects in a second. All come with written instructions as well, called the Carnival Necklace. Amazing. Look at that. I can't wait to see your demonstration. But first, Wall of Fame. Do you want to start us off? I love this. Me too. This piece, it's beautiful. This. Beautiful. You have been ooing and ahhing over I've it. I've been ooing because it, I love it. It's... um. Yeah, sorry. Anyway, <laughs> it's 889. It's Sandra Crowther. Hi, all at JM. My entry this week is a take on Mark Smith's Kiss Cross design. I used freshwater cultured pearls, silver 11 OC beads, sterling silver leaf connector, all purchased from yourselves. I'm wearing this suite to a wedding in May. Good luck to all oh, fellow wow. waffers. Sandra, I'd wear that to Asda. Other, Every <laughs> other supermarkets are available. <laughs> Every given occasion. Good luck. That's amazing, Sandra. <laughs> um, absolutely beautiful. From John, Janet Ray. Oh, Hello, Janet. Jan, hi. Um, you're number 890. And Janet says, hi, a lovely jewellery maker folk. Here's my waffering this week. Oh, I love that. Um, after making last week's gallery wire pendant, I had just enough to make a ring. Fits my little finger perfectly. So here it is with a rough uh, aquamarine wired to the join. Um, too lazy to solder it. <laughs> Uh, not had my torch out since um, being hit with vertigo. Oh, um, not quite safe yet. So will you rest up, my lovely? I know how awful that is. Um, hope all the jewelry maker family are well and wishing all bright blessings and joy uh, and joy at the start of spring. Hugs oh. to all. Ah, oh, lots of love to you, Janet. Dunn. that's beautiful. Bless you. I like. I love a little fingering. Yeah, and me. I love a raw gemstone. Yeah, me too. Oh, it's me. It's, it's you. Me. It's you. Busy, Your turn. Ooh. Now this is also lovely and this is 891 Jude Ryan. Good morning JM, here is my latest make, a present for a friend who loves to wear strong colours. It's orange jasper, rose gold findings and seed beads with copper spaces all from JM. They've been in my stash for a long time but I'm happy it's now a necklace and earring set ready to be worn. I was wondering what that gemstone was because I think that's absolutely beautiful. What is an orange jasper? Yeah. Ooh, lovely. Isn't it stunning? Yeah, gorgeous. So you're 891, gorgeous. Loving that. Um, I've got a very spring summer time vibe oh, yeah. piece from Anne Clark. Hello to you, Anne. You're number 892. And Anne says, hello, here is my entry to the Wall of Fame. Um, it is a slider bracelet made with two colours of 11 O's and 8 millimetre shell pearls. All components purchased from Jewelry Maker. I found this tutorial online I, and I loved it. Hope you do too. Good luck to all my fellow waffers and hope you're all keeping well. That's amazing. I love that. That's yes. really, really pretty. Definite summery vibes with that one. Yeah. You're 892. Ooh, look That's at these. That's very nice. Very Van Cleef. 893, Joan Barron, and she says, Hi, JM. Here is this week's offer a shell pearl and seed bead Alambra inspired earrings. I connected them to mini hoops, all from JM. Fingers crossed, as usual. Good luck to all the waffers. They are so wearable and beautiful. Good luck, Joan. They are loving stunning. those. Absolutely loving those. Wow. I love looking at everybody's Aren't they talented? Jewelry. Oh, my goodness. So, so, so talented. Look Keep your these. entries in, and the winner, it, um, the draw is on Wednesday, so that's with us. With us. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I haven't that's picked the draw for ages. Oh, well, you can do it then this next week. Oh, you exciting. can do it. Now, take a moment to appreciate just how amazing Deb's jewellery is. It's very versatile, these kits. You can go slightly minimal, mm. or you can go carnival, baby. <laughs> yeah. 
like feathers in your hair and yeah, everything, and just like a bit of Rio Carnival. And if you've got like a black dress or a black cardigan or jacket, you just put a little bit of colour around your neck. Oh, and then, like you said, that's quite bridal, the piece that we're looking at right now. Yeah. So they're a bit more classic. Um, I tell you what, I did like putting the um, the purple and the. Um, the and the Amazon, Amazon here, eye. yeah, that's amazing. I oh, love so those. pretty. Debs. So they're two separate kits, but I put them together, and I also put um, the little gemstones on the lucite flowers. You know those lucite flowers that yeah. we had. Um, they had like an opaque kind of lovely um, a b, not opaque design, and I thought how lovely to just pop that some there at the bottom. It's it's yeah it's by the earrings so i think you, i don't know if, if you can see the, the earrings in, in, in yeah, the way let me go. move it out of the way one sec you see there there's you so many things you can add those little gems to oh they're beautiful it's like a little flower fairy that one does um now are all kits available roscoe all available on pre-order but you were saying you told us how these manifested earlier on didn't you um now each of your project you got different colorways different gemstones that you can shop ahead and choose all come with a lovely sterling silver component which i'm going to show you now with my tweezers that deb's has now repaired that's it's lovely <laughs> that's very nice it's so annoying me this is mm -hmm. um because my soldering tweezers always do that this is gorgeous and it's got a little um I don't know what they are in there. Is it cubic zirconias or? Are they topaz? Are we looking at topaz in there? Okay. And but it's a connector because you've obviously you've got two um, connection points. But isn't it lovely? Yeah, they're gorgeous. You've got a nice round, brilliant cut in the centre. So each of your project comes with one of these. It comes with a choice of your gemstones, but it also comes with this amazing. Magic. It's magic. Diamante. It's Two, not, strip yeah it's I don't know thing I've ever seen before and it's sticky it's sticky because it's it's really um oh my goodness me okay so how did the this um master class manifest uh Georgia was in India and she saw some strands of beads mm. that looked like that like the beads on the necklace and they're in just in strands and she thought how can we recreate that look and then i don't know about her by her very clever buying power um she bought these now when i was first told of this idea and i like to be honest and transparent when i'm here i thought why would i want to stick things on gemstones and you can ask kate i said to her, i don't really know what you're talking about and then when i got the kits boy did i have fun <laughs> i bet you did i i, I always kind of I think one thing and then I prove myself wrong and yeah. I was like I love this yeah and it's quite mindful doing this it's quite relaxing and I've not seen jewelry like this anywhere and I quite like the idea of our viewers and, and myself being trendsetters yeah oh, well you definitely <laughs> definitely are the only thing like you know like the um Vivian Westwood mo motif not the same but yes. that's kind of got a globe and then the halo all the way around it does it's give me those kind of vibes. vibes and what I loved was you could go full out carnival or you could be a little bit more elegant like yeah. with the bracelets I think yeah. they look quite elegant so when we were talking about our arm parties I think that you could do that and once I started I couldn't stop <laughs> yeah I bet I really love it and I didn't think I would and I absolutely love it oh i love these so we're going to start with the shell pill which i think is going to be one of the fastest selling <laughs> okay so if i just scooch them for a minute i'll show you everything that you're getting um the shell is also the most limited so um okay i've only got 50. so you get the two different strands of your shell pearl um so you get a gosh, bigger and a know? smaller do you know, I've just thought of something after we've been discussing pearls today. I wouldn't be surprised if the price of shell pearl goes up now. Uh, probably will. It probably, it? yeah. Um, anyway, so you get, there's your lovely sterling silver connector. You also get the two strands of your shell pearl. Here is your reel of adhesive sparkle. And it comes in this bag. Oh, it comes in a little <laughs> silver pouch. Yeah. <sighs> what a great gift for somebody as a kid. Yeah, you'd keep you know. that for something, wouldn't you? Yeah, yeah make the jewelry use the bag to actually present it yeah amazing and um, we've got a limited quantity of these though jewelry makers so what in total three five different projects to bring you limited in their quantity all available on pre-order 
you get the instructions for the carnival necklace but obviously you can adapt the techniques to anything you want to make I just go into detail on um, here it is how um, I added them in There's some little tips and tricks I learned along the way of, of getting it to adhere nicely and um, but as I always say with kits that have the same gemstone in two different sizes I love that yeah because you can put the bigger bead at the top the smaller bead at the bottom you've got earrings pendants yeah you know if you put two kits together and you've got four strands in smaller and bigger perfect wow i mean look at that that's absolutely stunning that's the rose quartz it is bright i was thinking bridal jewelry mm. or oh, your mother's day makes as well because yeah. uh, uh, a week tomorrow well my daughter came and looked over my shoulder and went oh that's nice did they come like that and i said no you no <laughs> your clever mummy did it um okay <laughs> she's like Oh, was she thinking about Mother's Day gift? She was going to take it from you to give to yourself. Well, she no, does make me things. She, she does. does. She's yeah, very she clever. Yeah, she makes jewellery too. Um, wow. How for much? the strands alone, twenty nine ninety nine. Um, You have... How much is on this reel? Because there seems go like forever. masses. I made every single piece of jewellery that you can see here, and I've still got loads left of one. Really? Yeah. Yeah. So I think this is what I've got left after making all the jewellery. Wow, I tell you what, yeah, should we stretch it out? It's a yeah. metre, isn't it? Yeah. That's a metre, and it's what the, the, the adhesive is on the inside. Yeah, so when you think that to go around the larger gemstone, it's between 12 or 13 gems. So I was cut off 13 because it's better to have more. So if you go up, and I'll show you in the demo, if you go up 13 gems and then cut that off, you've got four strips, and mm. it's only a little tiny bit like that. Yeah. So, you know, then you've got four and, you know, so you get four out of that for four beads. So it just goes on and on and on. Oh, it's very sticky as well. It's really it? good. Yeah. It's, yeah. Like, it's rubbery almost. So you can imagine it being very durable. Do you know what else this would go amazing with? Like your diamond tubing? Yes. That would be a fabulous You could put it on it? metal. You know, if you're doing yeah. copper and you wanted to add some bling. Yeah. You could, you could, you could zhuzh up your phone case. Oh, yeah. Handbags. Yeah. All of the above. Wow, boot shoes, yeah, absolutely. £29.99 to get hold of this one, love it. Debs is going to show us how to actually create those beautiful, um, it's like a little planet, isn't it? It's like a little planet. Amazing. Guess what? That's Not your price. Nice. This is the most limited. I might be here a while winding this back you up. You don't have to do them in strips, by the way. You can cut them singly into little single ones. Ah, oh, yeah. So that you could make... Um, my daughter came up with this idea. I cannot um, take credit for this. But she said, Mum, on a larger gemstone or on a cabochon, you could do initials. <gasps> and she said, or oh, you could do stars or motifs if you... It's a nice idea. And I, she went, you can say you thought of that. <laughs> Did she say? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, you can take that one, Mum. That's because she does use it on her nails. She uses things like this on her nails. They're not as nice. Um, and that's what she came up with. So to actually do um, an initial or a heart or yeah. something on a cabochon or a larger gemstone, I thought, what a great idea that was. Or if was. you don't drill pearls. If, you, if you've if yeah. you never drilled pearls before. £19.99 pence only to get. The most limited of your projects, though. It comes with the written instructions as well um you know the two right wait a minute so you've got sterling silver yeah yeah you get a silver connector you get two strands of shell pearl yeah you get the coil of or meter long length of your diamondy bits just here <laughs> i don't know what else you know the little diamantes, diamantes. let's go, let's call it as that yeah so look, four components there i think we'd all agree there's a fiver five pounds each but I don't think you can ignore the bag because you'd pay at least yeah, that's true. a pound or two pounds for that. I think so. I think you're you know, right. If you went to buy a, a gift bag somewhere, so, you know. Totally, totally agree. Okay, now that's the most limited. Now they're all available on pre-order. Let's get into the demonstration okay. and then we'll bring you the, your uh, um, other projects as and when as well. So shop ahead on those. And as always, if you've got any questions for Debs, do drop us a message in the studio. Now it's a beginner project. It's basically stringing apart from decorating the beads. So I'm gonna show you how to decorate the beads. But I have got everything on here of anything extra that I have used for the uh, carnival necklace. But of course you can adapt the techniques in here to any of the gemstones in it you know even as the stretchies and it's yeah. just all the same so let's so this is what you end up with obviously and it's like a little 
satellite and as I said you can cut these down individually so you don't have to put it all the way around we just thought that looked pretty okay so let's grab a bead that's quite dark so that you can see what I'm doing and then this is the strip so things that are going to be useful are a sharp pair of scissors mm -hmm. and some tweezers when you're doing this now when I looked at this I thought oh it's going to be fiddly and actually I really enjoyed it so to go around the larger gemstones because gemstones we know this they fluctuate within you know millimeters so yeah um some 12 went round, some 13 went round, depending on the gemstone that I was using. So, just to be safe, because it's easier to take one out than add one in, we'll do 13. So let me get this right in a shot so you can see what I'm doing. So, you want to count across 13 gems. So we go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And then you want to cut that in as straight a line as you can, just because that's going to want to meet up at the other side. Now, just to put that into perspective, I'm going to get four beads out of that. And this is how much... It goes on and on and oh, on. Oh, yeah, you'll do masses, on on on. yeah. And then once you've got um, your little strip, then you're going to cut them again. Now, you, you know, you don't have to. You might want to put that around something. It's up to you. So I'm just going to now cut these into four. Do you know what, Debs, yesterday we had the um, these scissors, didn't we? The mate Scott brought the most of those uh, cutter bee scissors. What are cutter bee scissors? I need them. And they're like they're like the they look like bumblebees, but they're like the ultimate crafting scissor. Every time I get a really good crafting scissor, someone nicks it. Um, my Sizzix ones, um, don't know where they are. I think they're probably in my daughter's bedroom oh. or, or the garage. Well, there fact. you go. We'll have to give you the code for that. So, okay. I so don't know if they sold out though. Sorry, I'm looking at L because I was wowed with the scissors. <laughs> so you get, then what you end up is your little strips. And then you'll notice that on the back, you've got just like pretty much anything of this nature. You've got your um, little paper that stops it sticking to everything. So then you just get your tweezers and pull that paper gently off. Make sure, whoops, make sure when you um, pull this off, that you don't um, put your fingers, you know, all over this bit because it's quite. Now I tried loads of different ways because you made quite a bit of jewelry, and this is the best way that I found to do it. Get around the centre of your gemstone, and around the centre of your strip, and just press that bit down so you've got your tails hanging, and then. I just gently, and I'm not pressing down too hard because I want, might want to redirect that. I push that down. Now, you have got a minute, if you don't press it down too hard, to actually manoeuvre that around until you're happy. Then once I was happy, I just gently squeezed around with my hands. Now, I've made, this little mandrel, by the way, is just a piece of wire with a loop on the end. I found it easier to hold it that way than try and hold it in my hand. And then when I was happy with the placement, put it down on your bead mat. Don't put it down on something hard and just go like that. Ah. And what that will do is just adhere that equally to all ends of your bead so that then you have got, you've basically taken something like this. Yeah and you've made it different. You've made it into something like this. And I found that- um, You've bejeweled the jewel. You've bejeweled it. So if, yeah, if you ever look at the, the necklace, I think that gives a really different effect than if I just had those as station beads without the bling. That's so gorgeous, Deb. It's quite joyous. Yeah, so gorgeous. And then all I've done in between those beads is add a selection of other beads. So this is actually strong. Now, I know I'm really old school because I've been doing this for a long time, but I call it tiger tail because I think yeah. when you say beading thread, it could mean millions of things. It could, mean, it could mean wildfire, fire line, it can mean anything. So what I mean by tiger tail is our bonded sort of seven strand um, hmm. old school beading thread. And that's all that I actually stranded this on. And I just crimped it um, in a double strand. So... I've chosen the biggest crimp beads I could find just so that you can see what I'm doing. And then what I did was I just popped on my crimp bead. So this is great if you want to make something different but you haven't got into the world of jewellery making before. I will give you instructions uh, with the kit for um, doing this. So you could definitely do this if you're a beginner. It's not 
a really hard techniques at all. So I've popped on my class, I've gone back down to through my crimp bead and all of our lovely um, experienced jewelry makers will know this already. And then you just want to squish, either squish or you can use some crimping pliers into place. And then I just stranded on. Now, what I did was I got a mixture of eight O's 11 O's and then a little three millimeter that would match the rest of the beads or sort of go with them all. Now you can be really exacting in this. So for example, you can go right two 11 O's, one 8 O, two 11 O's, one three millimeter and do the same every single time. But I didn't, I just put them on the mat and I just went random with it. As the only thing I did the same between each bead was the number. So I think I started off with 23 or something. I just roughly put the three millimeter in the middle and brought that down. I then added the halo beads to that. So I would usually take this tail down for as many beads as I could without trimming. And I just continued, I just continued. And then when I'd finished one strand, I did a longer strand and I give you all numbers and, uh, of, of beads that I've used and everything in the instructions. Um, and I just crimped that bottom strand underneath the top strand and then just added the connector bead um, to the center there as a charm with one of the smaller beads on the bottom. So. This is a very simple technique, but I think you end up you can you can end up with quite wow pieces of jewellery. Yeah, and it's joyful. Yeah, it's it joyful. It is really joyful. I love it. It's like a carnival in a piece of jewellery. I can see your inspiration. Well, as soon as I saw that strand, because I, I loved putting the Amazonite and the amethyst together, but as soon as I saw that strand, it just said carnival to yeah, me. Yeah, totally agree. Because we need a bit of colour at this time of year. We don't certainly we? do. We certainly do. Well, I tell you what, let's bring you that project. Do it. The one with the multicoloured strands. Um, this, by the way, has been the most popular on pre-order, I'm not surprised. Um, and you get a mixture of your mixed agates, so you've got all the different colours, reds, yellows, greens, purples, oranges, pinks, all in there. Two different sizes as well. Um, don't forget you get your lovely little charm here as well. Um, and also you're getting the meter of your diamante. And don't forget you're getting uh, Deb's amazing... Um, project instructions so that doesn't physically come what it, it basically upon dispatch if you go to your order in your order history um, you can print it off basically or save it to your computer system whichever you wish so that comes for free 19 pounds and 99 pence only that's wow, a really? lot isn't it do you know what I think is great about these instructions even if you know how to make you know you like me you look at something you know how to make it if you buy a lot of kits or a lot of um, strands, quite often you haven't got round to that one yet and you might think, oh, I can't remember what I bought that for. If yeah. you get those instructions, it can remind you of what maybe you decided to make with it. Yeah, because I've, I've got memory like a fish. So have I. Yeah, so to, uh, yeah, I, I would need, I would need that reminder um, to, uh, to, to, to actually sort of go, okay, yeah, that's it. That's why I loved it. That's why I made that purchase. Um, I'll be dialing through. Amazing at £19.99. pence. These are again um, super, super duper popular on pre-order. Um, well done everybody making your confirmations. Oh, you're loving it. And as always, if you have any questions for Debs, do text us. We are live here in the studio. We've still got more gemstone um, colourways to bring you. And you do get... Um you do get a lot in in these kits because when you think about it you've got the two um strands of gemstones yeah um two strands of gemstones and the larger and the smaller you've got the really long <laughs> Both of our talk backs of the week. Be Sorry, it's really funny. <laughs> if you're wondering why you're just on stuck on recording, my talk back went then, so I couldn't hear what's going on in the gallery. And then as soon as I'm fixed, Debs goes. So like, <laughs> and I'm thinking it's gone very quiet in my ear. Yeah, no, it's, it happened by the way yesterday Thanks, at the Dan. end of the show too. Um, amazing. What was that? Sorry. <laughs> Let's get another project in while Debs is up. Which one? <laughs> Don't forget we've got the flower beach. We do the Amazonite. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. We've also got, don't forget, those lovely Lucite style fluted flowers to bring you as your finale. Um, they're available on pre-order. They're absolutely flying. We've got them in three different colours as well. Um, are you right now? No, sorry, I was just going to say, if you pass me one of those um, flowers, yeah. I can just incorporate in what I'm doing here just to show you. Eh. Just give me a silver one or... Oh, 
Okay. Oh, thank you. That See you, my darling. Just because I think they'd be so pretty. Yeah, they are beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Textbook coloured Amazonite. Oh, I love knife. this one. Two strands that you're getting as well. Amazing. Absolutely stunning. So you've got your 8mm natural Amazonite, 6mm natural Amazonite. You get your lovely little uh, um, connector. Oh, it hiccups then. Um, you get the connector as well, which is bejeweled. And then you have your metre long length of your Diamante, plus the instructions, everyone. Have we got quantity on these? 60. Okay. Oh, that's good. Amazonite, you remember what we were saying earlier on, here's a gemstone that we believe 2024 stroke 2025, it is going to be, we reckon it's going to be the year of the Amazonite. You be what, sorry? Yeah, you, it's like we cherry picked all the bluish green ones out of the multicolored strands and put them all in this one amazing yeah, project. It is actually, isn't it? Uh, sorry, I'm just, I'm designing now because I think these are gorgeous. They're stunning, aren't they? 1999 that is just um stunning and i'm just thinking that these here this little i'll show you oh i love that <laughs> have you made a nice little flower with those lucite flower yeah. sterling silver type things uh, yeah I had to they're not it. lucite but the little flower sterling silver they, they're flying on pre-order oh, what are you showing us what are you showing so sorry look look at that little snowdrop there so I've put like just some 11 O's in there um, as a stamen and then I've put a little three millimeter gemstone and I'm just thinking that, look at that on the carnival, oh, on lovely. the carnival color, how amazing these are. They're so, so beautiful. Well, they're on pre-order so you can shop ahead and you actually get one, two, three, four. How many of those do you get? Six, six of each. You get six, is that right? Six of the silver, six of the, uh, obviously separate colours, so separate auctions. Shop ahead on those. Sorry, so I just thought they'd be so good with the kits, but also, I just felt like I couldn't have the Amazonite without the Amethyst. Yeah, oh, you love those together? Together, oh my goodness. I mean, it's a match made in, in heaven. Look at that. It, yeah, it is. If you've got the Lucite boxes, the ones with the, like, the purples and the greens in, all of those flowers are going to go with these colours. Yeah. And you can bling them up. <laughs> yeah, massively. <laughs> loving, loving, loving that. Um, £19.99. pence. I've still got the rose quartz to bring you and the amethyst, of course, to bring you. Shall we do the rose? Oh, I... this is, yeah. This is the one that you said was quite wedding-y. It is, yeah. It's quite, um, you know, if you want to be a bit more sophisticated with your bling. Sophisticated you know, with if your you bling. want to be a bit more Susie Menham with your bling, yeah, because Susie's very sophisticated, isn't she? And she's yeah. very like, oh, she, oh, she here she's tomorrow. She's in tomorrow, yeah, that, yeah. and so she loves Rose Quartz like, too. Su I can see Susie wearing something like this. Yeah, beautiful. It has actually got a bit of a jadeite feel about it. Yeah, like the pinkish cotan actually. Um, so definitely getting those vibes. You get a meter of your diamante. You get your lovely little same charm, two strands, same sizes, but this time with your rose quartz. And of course, don't forget you have the uh, carnival necklace tutorial, so you can recreate each of you can recreate that necklace in the rose quartz. Yeah, definitely. Exactly the same. So any of them. Don't forget your little snowdrop charms are coming up as well, which are absolutely stunning. If you think, oh, that's a bit blingy for me, that carnival, but just think how um, wedding -y or, or a bit more um, dressy it would be and understated with the rose quartz. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. It's not, not everybody will go for big, bold colours. You know, it's, it's up to you. If you want something that's maybe a little bit more, oh. a little softer. Oh, look mm. at this. Sorry. <laughs> Here I am making jewellery as we go that's what you do best my lovely look at that i think that would be gorgeous with the kit oh that's good that's so we've got a little snowdrop hanging from the charm that you get in the kit so i think that would be lovely to add in beautiful i love these i just these kits are amazing and i just i don't know it's something different and fun can you imagine putting some of those diamantes around the little flowers <gasps> oh, you could oh Nothing. you could Oops. Oops. Daisy, don't step on that um it could, it you could, couldn't you? There's nothing stopping you putting them around around uh, your charms, which are coming no. up as our finale. Okay, let's bring you the amethyst now, shall we? Meter of your diamante. Um, oh. Textbook amethyst. There's amethyst and there's amethyst. Look exactly. At the colour of this amethyst. I wonder. It's always been in my top three amethyst. Yeah, I can see that. I think everybody gravitates to amethyst. Oh really? 
Well, if it, 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 well, didn't Mark used to say that when he had his artisanal markets, it was all, he used to make up um, like a third of his table was amethyst? Yeah, everyone knows what amethyst is. Yeah. You know, that, but you recognise it. It's beautiful amethyst. And of course, because you've got the dark colour, it lends itself to this beautiful sparkle in the yeah, other bits beautiful. and pieces. Loving that. There's your charm, just, to, just in case you're looking for it. <laughs> Poking up. Poking up. Um, you've got your metre of your diamante. You get the two strands of your, yeah, chocolate box. Oh, it's gorgeous. Um, it's really, really saturated in yeah. colour. Delicious, Whoa. sumptuous. It should conjure up images of luxury and decadence, I, Ooh, I think, Amethyst. Yes. You know? Uh, £19.99. Have we got quantity, Roscoe? Oh, 70 available. Oh, that's ever so good, isn't Don't it? Don't forget as well, you get the written instructions with this as well. So I've used that for a station necklace. So this one's a bit more understated. It's the big one at the back. Mm -hmm. um, but you can see there how you can still add a bit of bling. Um, no, not that one, the one behind. Here we go. Right. <laughs> I made so much jewellery this time, I got excited. But you see how that's more understated? Yeah, loving that. But you can really see, it's just a station necklace with chain, but you can really see that those little diamantes that really pretty on the darker gemstones as well. Loving that. A bit Van Cleef, feel, that one. Do you think? Yeah. It's a different Cleef. feel, isn't it? Yeah, loving that. And something you could definitely wear on a regular basis. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, amazing, 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 amazing. Well done. Yeah. I mean... Oh, okay, now, everybody. These have been on pre-order. And I'll be honest, we have been teasing you with these since <laughs> 8 o'clock this morning. And I've been demoing with them whether they told me to or not. <laughs> <laughs> now, um, before we get into this, because it's going to be the finale of our show, I, you might have noticed that I seem to have gained a piece of jewellery. Um, <laughs> if only it was that simple, eh? It'd be, it would be temporary. Oh, I know, that. how amazing is this? It's tomorrow's deal of the day. Lavender Haigu bracelet. How amazing is and this? And these little yeah. flourishes, I love those. They're stunning, aren't they? Per I could I like macrameing, but there's no way my macrame would look like that. Me neither. No way. It's coming up tomorrow. You've <gasps> got your deal of the day, the most oh, beautiful stunning. aqua jadeite. You've also got this amazing strand as well, which is brand new. Um, your deal of the day on Sunday. I'm so, so excited to bring you these. You don't, you're not gonna wanna take that off me now, Ross, are you? <laughs> you know, you don't. <laughs> um, it's amazing. No, 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 that was not tomorrow. I don't wanna take it off. That's At all, the thing. It's so beautiful. <laughs> um, anyway, the finale of our show. We have been teasing you with these all day and that wasn't intentional, everyone. Um, we've got it in three different colors, three different auctions. I'm gonna start with the gold um, and you get, how many is it? Five. Mm -hmm. Five of these beautiful, like little snowdrops, aren't they? Oh, they're lovely. Ah, oh, they could be little flower fairies. They could be so much. Look at those two tops earrings. of tassels. Tops of tassels, charms. You've got, if you get five, you've got two pairs of earrings and a pendant. Ah, oh, lovely. Um, I've got some charm bracelets coming up um, next week and they'd be gorgeous on those. Stunning, I wanna get some of these. I'd use them as like multi-way connectors as well, Yeah, you know? And just to make little flowers, your wire work designs, think kind of like a um, Rachel Norris kind of thing. You can yeah. make like a bunch of flowers necklace oh, or lovely. A, a vine or, you know, if you make wedding jewelry, you've, you're making a tiara or a hairpiece. Have it like sort of yeah. tumbling oh. down. Loving that, you gave it the shoulder as well, Deb. Did I? Yeah, give it a, give it a bit of a shoulder action. Um, oh my goodness me, two <laughs> grams of sterling silver. You've got buttery yellow gold. Um, five pounds each. A big amount of sterling silver and precious metal there. Let's not forget that. You can shop ahead on the rose. You can shop ahead on the silver as well. How many do we have, Roscoe? 100 available. Oh, it's a finale. It's a finale, 24.99, that's amazing. Incredible. I mean, I'd certainly pay that for a pair of earrings like these. Yeah, Just me too. Could and rest a gemstone, a nice little teardrop pearl or something like that underneath. I've done a lot of demos where I've used things like this, and they're usually base metal because I've not seen them in, in Precious. And people always ask me where I got them from. Yeah, I bet. Because, you know, they're gorgeous. Yeah, I bet. $14.99. Ooh. Shop ahead on the others, everybody. We had quantity, but they are absolutely flying. 
absolutely fine. They're so beautiful. Best thing is, though, Debs, it's not your final price. Really? Mm -mm. Okay. Oh, my goodness. What is the final price? I don't know. In 30 seconds, we are taking it even lower, everyone. Good luck to you all. Let me tilt one of these towards you. You can see there's a nice... There's quite a large aperture in there, so you can yeah. put some of your wires through there, your cords even through there you if you wanted to. You could put a few to. and have like stamen, three or four nice. stamens. That would be really pretty. Yeah, gorgeous. Yeah, Ooh, Nestle yeah. drop inside. Beautiful. You could use these at the top of like Kumihimo, your yeah. cords, your braids. There is a multitude of ways of working them, uh, working them into your jewellery. Um, hello, Caroline, saying mix the colours. Um, earring, necklace and bracelet. Yeah, amazing. Sounds beautiful, absolutely beautiful. They're, they're very well made. I mean, they're very floral. I know it sounds ridiculous, but Fluted. they look exactly like a little snowdrop. They do. And that's they do. Really or a tulip clever. if you did it the other a way around. Tulip, yeah. Like, like a tulip. Twelve pounds and ninety nine pence. That's amazing. I like your idea of doing little bunches. Mm. You can make bunches of flowers. Mm. Like, so lovely in the brooch. Colours. Brooches are back in. Yeah. Wow. There's so many of you with it in your basket, so um, keep on dialing through. I've got just 30 of them left. Let's bring you the rose gold. Same applies, by the way. <coughs> rose gold are very popular on pre-order. Well done to those who take the initiative to not miss out. We've only got 50, though. Rose gold is more limited. So we've done the yellow. Bringing you the silver in a second. Right now for the rose. 12 99 Amazing. Loads of multi-buyers getting involved. It's little components like this, Debs, that make the difference between you know I always take your jewelry to another level always say that so those spacer beads you've got earlier yeah. and these can take your jewelry to a completely different level you know you get those two strands of amethyst in the kit yeah you add this you add some different spacers and it makes it completely unique and just next level yeah just totally agree it. totally totally agree 12 pounds and 99 pence only crazy they're on the verge of selling out now for the big finale on what has been such a lovely show i've really enjoyed myself today now you will get five oh, and i've only got four here's one um because one was one was made up Snaffle. in some lovely jewelry um hiya valerie in nottingham she said oh, i love your bracelet thanks see see valerie says it's mine it's yours now um l love the bracelet that you're wearing that's car <laughs> i know it's mine is your deal of the day tomorrow at 10 o'clock today? Sadly, it's not mine. I will have to buy it as well. Um, <laughs> yeah. 200 of what? Of, of these, the silver. Right. Okay, of the silver. Oh, look at those. Beautiful. Look at him. He looks just like the snowdrops outside my front door. Oh, have you got snowdrops? Yeah, snowdrops. Outside. They grow in a little patch just outside they're every so year. They're so cute, aren't they? Yeah, they're lovely. Who wants a massive finale deal because it's been a pretty lovely show i think you'd all agree i've had a wonderful time so i hope I. you all have too um we have 200 available who would like these under 10 pounds oh wow yeah that's no i mean I, I know that we've got some very talented silversmiths that watch you know is it even worthwhile making them no because you'd either price? have to cut it out of metal sheet and then form it and solder it or you'd have to um cast it so no i wouldn't even bother for the price we're going to no save your time and you know your work and all the time and your energy and oh my goodness wow 9.99 yeah. yeah 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 it's our finale deal i hope there's some left when we go off air well we have oh, okay. 200 but the call screens have gone just a little bit crazy <laughs> yeah. um loads of multi buyers getting involved amazing 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 mix the colors i love that idea caroline to uh, create like oh an ultimate like Cartier spring bouquet, Ooh. something like that. Nine ninety nine. Well done, everybody! Amazing, amazing, amazing. Um, make sure you keep an eye on the website for that deal of the day today as well. Um, wish list it if you don't know what mm -hmm. wish list is. Speak to our contact centre, um, and uh, they allow you to a queue. And it, you know, if anything does fall out of baskets, or I mean. It's, it's an opportunity, isn't it? You never know. It's a, it, it's a, it's a chance. Um, and our call centre will give you a call to get hold of those pearls. Likewise with any of the Cotan, all your sterling silver, Deb's amazing projects. You've been fabulous as always. Thank you, and you have too. I can't wait to see you next week. I know. It's going to be fun. It's going to be really it's it, loads, be good. loads of fun. There's some lovely kits. Is there? Yeah. Do you want to give us a little bit of a teaser? We've got a little uh, under the sea theme going Ooh. on. And I do love a little under the sea theme. Um, like giant clamshells. 
Yep, I just need to try and get it in the back of my car. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's found one. You found one. Um, nice, that sounds like a nice yeah, buy. Yeah, so we've got um, some really lovely kits coming. I've got so many shows coming up, I'm trying to remember. What, oh, and also, just to say that I'm going to be at the NEC on this Sunday. So if anyone's coming to the Gemporia stand, on the Sunday, please come say hello to me. I'm going to be there all day. I'll be doing a demo and also just chatting. You know, I do like to chat, but you know, oh. be prepared to stand there for a while if you're I chatting to me. I book a special <laughs> trip especially for that, oh. just to see you. Make sure you check it out on these. They have gone crazy, crazy, crazy. I've got less than twenty of Ooh. them left. Oh no, Debs. Um, rose gold. There's a few of them. Yellow gold. There's a few of them, of them as well. The, uh, tomorrow, don't forget that amazing rose quartz early bird that's coming up. We've got 800 in quantity. Wow. Yeah, and it's going to a ridiculous price tag. I'll see you bright and early. Lovely to be with you. Have a wonderful day.